Up to date with what's on Sewing Street, as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. Head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope, and you're done. Never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Are you a fan of Sewing Street? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing community. See you there! with a feather crafter's companion is turning a sensational 17 and boy do we have a celebration for you we are bringing the razzle dazzle and putting on the ritz for a fabulous and very flamboyant affair and of course you're all invited from the 18th of october we're going to be shining the spotlight on a glittering array of spectacular new launches some amazing offers and so many show-stopping surprises Good morning, good morning, good morning. Oh, very foxy today. Very foxy. Uh, Hannah's breaking the rules. Uh, it's gorgeous, isn't it? That's coming up later anyway. Uh, now, before... Ooh, <coughs> before I do today's early bird, I need to tell you about a competition. If this week, if you buy anything from us, whether from the show or from the website, that is Crafter's Companion, that's Threaders, Gemini, anything that's Crafter's Companion, <clears throat> your name will go into a virtual hat. Uh, oh, listen, I don't know what's happened. <clears throat> and on Tuesday, I'll be announcing the one person who has won £500 worth of goodies. So that's if you buy anything from Crafters Companion, which is Threaders, Gemini, all the different makes of uh, that, 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 are, that are Crafters Companion, you will win £500 worth of goodies. One of you, one of you will win £500. All you have to do is buy something, buy either from the show or buy from the web. Right, having said that, before I explain what today's early bird is, you know that this is the Gemini cutter. And with the Gemini cutter, you get all of these plates. What you get is you get, you get your two plastic plates. Obviously yours will be new. There won't be these used ones like that. You'll get your metal plate. You will get your um, shim. You will get your magnetic one, uh, that's used for paper, and you will get your embossing one. So you get all of that, and the way you use it normally is you put th th that down, you put your metal plate down, you put your fabric down, you put your die down, then you put your shim on, then you put your plastic, you've made your circle, your, your, your sandwich, you push it through, and it cuts perfectly. Now, when you do fabric, right, we, they, they, what happens is, you see this, this metal sheet like this gets very dented and everything. It's called a consumable. So you can buy that, you can buy new ones of those. You can keep using it over and over and over again. It doesn't matter if it, mine are all dented and everything. However, what they've done is they've developed one to use just for fabrics, right? Or these for fabrics. Now, that's these, right? That's these. Now, look. They don't come with the machine. These are separate, right? You have to buy these separately, which I've got on the website today. But before you do that, don't buy them yet because I've got an early bird bundle that have these in them. But I just thought I'd show you how it works if you buy these ones, right? So what you do with these is you have your first plastic sheet. You have your A, um, or you can use either of them, Sarah says. Then you put your fabric on. Then you put your dye on. 
right? Then you put your other fabric sheet on. You don't need the shim. You just put your plastic on there. You feed it through the machine. See, now you don't need the shim. Now, we'll make cracking noises because that's, that's the um, dye going through your fabric. pressure there's no knives there's nothing in there what it is is the pressure of that machine pushes these down there's your there's your metal they will slightly mark or anything but then look that has cut your oblongs perfectly right or whatever shape you're doing whatever shape you're doing cuts it perfectly so that's why you need if you can do a lot of fabric ones you don't you don't have to have them but it makes your life so much easier right so i've got an early bird bundle which has got two of the fabric um, sheets in, two extra shims, because these are consumables when you're using your normal metal, and then this here, uh, perspective-wise, this is your, um, basically, you get one of these to put these in. However, someone's walked off with the one that's this size, and we've only got a little one. So you'll get one of these. I was trying to do perspective. There you go. So you will get one of those pouches to fit that in, right? That's so it's two of the wider fabric metal plates, two shims and the bag will cost you normally £52.96. However, it's today's early bird. Oh, £35.48. £35.48. Now, how much those plates cost on their own? Aren't they £24.99? Yeah, twenty four ninety nine. The plates are on there. The shim. You can go and have a look how much the shims are. I don't know how much that would be. Say that again. Yeah, we've never sold the shims. We've never sold the shims separately. You buy them from Craft and Companion. I think you can buy them on Hobby Maker, but we've never sold them. We've never sold them because they're what they call consumables. So if you go into a Crafters Companion shop, you can buy this and these all because they're consumables. They're just replaceable, aren't they? Thirty five pounds and forty eight pence. So you get two. How many? Half the stock's gone into baskets already. Half the stock is in baskets already. Julie says good morning. Sue says good morning. Claire says good morning. Laurie says good morning. Looking forward to a great show. Another pretty shirt. Susan says good morning. Cousin Susan says good morning. And Mari is in as well. £35.48 and pence will get you that bundle. Remember, everyone who bought one advice, one of these is entered into the draw. One of you on Tuesday will win £500 worth of goodies. You won't get Sarah holding that box. It'll be me holding the box on Tuesday. Well, actually, I said that again. No, I won't come to your doorstep. I'll do it here. I'll see, if, I'll see if I've got a chartreuse frock like that and I'll see if I can wear that. See if I can recreate that picture. I won't be able to. £35.48 and pence for this, right? So let's show the slide again. So you get two of the fab... It looks like you only get one there, but you get two of the extra thick fabric cutter sheets. You get two shims and you get the bag to put them all in. At £35.48. and pence. No, you don't want to sing six shim shiminy. Hannah wants to sing shim shim. Right, okay, right. You know my earpiece here, right? I always put this in when I'm in the dressing room, when I'm getting ready. So we do our top our seven meeting. I've already done my makeup by then, have my breakfast. Then I go to the dressing room, put my earpiece in, put my microphone on, put my clean shirt on, right? And I put my earpiece in and all I heard Kat was saying, uh, not Kat, all I heard Hannah saying was, well, I wouldn't like it if people threw ham at me in the street. And then she went, especially if I'm blind. And I was like, what? And then, the, then, they, went, then they moved on to something else. And I was like, what? And the, and the dressing is right the way over there, so I couldn't pop that through the door and go, what are you talking about there? Anyway, they're talking about Cat's dog, who's not got very good sight, and they throw little bits of, not big, I always had visions of throwing like legs of lamb, or ham, at uh, Hannah, whatever. Different animal, isn't it, lamb and ham? But the things you hear, and then most of the time you hear Hannah singing to herself in the gallery, it's normally a Christmas song. Normally it's a Christmas song. Right, anyway, look, 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 35 pounds, 48 pence. Oh, right, once you've all checked out, they're all sold out. Once you've checked out, they're all sold out. Let me just remind you. Oh, I'll do that straight away afterwards then. I'll do that straight away afterwards. Right, okay. So I'll just remind you, you get two of the heavy metal sheets for fabric. You get two shims and you get the bag to put them all in. You will get the right size bag. There's more people got it in their basket than we've got stock of now. It's brilliant. You just saw me do it, right? You don't. It's just fantastic because you, you'll, you'll use it over and over and over and over and over again. 
Okay, all because it's Crafters, Crafters Companion's 17th birthday. I know. Becky Swan will be in later. Uh, Carol says good morning, John and team. Carol, oh, another Carol. Isn't that funny? Another Carol's just come in. Uh, Anne says morning, John. Alan says, I've got the Gemini die cutting machines and I love to use it every day. He's been very poorly, but he's getting better now. That's good, Alan. That's good. 35 foot, right. Hang on. How many do I need to check out? Okay, right. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to, you know me. I'm up front with you, right? There are seven, seven, not checked out, but 21 people, 22 people, 23 people got it. Oh, that was four. 23 people got it in their baskets. So if you want it, you need to check out. You need to check out. But remember, as soon as you checked out, your name will go into that virtual basket. To it. Uh, morning, John. You do cheer me up. If you stand in the right place in front of the fox, looks like you've got two big red ears on top of your head. Ha, 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 from Elaine. Like that. I don't know. Thirty-five pounds and forty-eight pence. Right, it's about to sell out. It's about to go. It's about to go. Right now, before I do anything else, I need to tell you that we did have a lot of these on their own as well. Right earlier, how many have got left? Ten. I've got ten of these on their own. This is not the early bird. This is just. A, this wasn't supposed to be until the ten o'clock show. Right, we're going to do it now. Twenty-four nine. I can't get any more today, can I? Can't get any more of these today. So there's ten. There's two in there. There's two in there. Oh, sorry. I'll put it down. Hang on, hang on, she's just coming back now. $24.99, you get two of these are the fabric plates. I just showed you how to use the thicker fabric plates. Yeah, if you've got, if you've got the early birds, you've already got these, right? They, these are in the early bird, but the early bird's about to sell out, right? So if you haven't, and you just, or maybe you don't want the shims or the little bag, maybe you just wanted those $24.99. Yeah, shows you the value of the early bird, doesn't it? Dawn Taylor. Oh, now, Dawn, you've changed your name. It's with Dawn Taylor. Morning, John and team. I was about to say, you've got fox ears. Love it. Doreen says, morning, John. Lynn to it, waving. Good morning, everyone. On a misty morning. Oh, it wasn't misty at my ass. I don't think it was. No, it was, ra it was raining. Roy, what are you doing here so early? Yeah, he's here already. Is that, did you bring me one of these? I've already got that. You're over it. You just came because you want to see me, isn't it? Yes. You need a haircut as well. Oh, don't. Yeah. <laughs> oh, bye then. Oh, he's off now. I've upset him now. He's got home with his tail between his legs, as I say. I've got the big ears, he's got the big tail. 24 night. Oh, he's lovely, that man, isn't it? No, Roy's, Roy's lovely as well. But what was the man called from upstairs when we were in the old... Oh, you weren't in the old building? Oh, he was lovely. He was a DJ at the weekends as well. All right, Bob. All right, Bob. $24.99. How many of these have we got left? Right, they're about to go. They're about to go. Right, now very quickly, before I carry on with the show, I want to tell you about the special deal we've got going with the Gemini machine this week. So many things for the birthday, for the 17th birthday. Right, so what you get, let me just point this out. That You don't get that. Right, okay, now uh, this is how much you should be paying, right? You won't be paying that much, you won't be paying that much, but you get the Gemini machine, you get, here, let me get this right, you get your two plates, you get your shim, you get your metal cutting plate, you get your embossing sheet, and you get your magnetic one. Now, those two are only, that's used if you're embossing leather, that's used if you're doing paper, because you can do paper with this as well as fabric. Right, and then you don't get the heavyweight sheets with this, right? But you do get the um, wavy line ribbon. You do get the pineapple die cutter, and you do get the Catherine wheel from Karen Lewis. Or oh, you don't get the old cushion in the back, so you don't see that. Have a look at the slide. You get all of the. Oh, and you get the embossing tools, and you get the wire. <laughs> Yeah, the, the machines aren't kind of hidden, but the wire's very prominent there. If you bought all of those bits on their own, it would cost you 236.96. However, while stocks last, 179.99. Now, 179.99 is how much you'd pay for this machine normally on its own. So you get, and you get those with it. Anyway, you get all of this for free. Get all the other bits and bobs for free. 179.99. We sold out so many of these yesterday, I can't tell you. So many, so, oh, and, 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 I, I know I'm not supposed to mention this yet, but uh, I'll, I'll, do, I'll do it actually when we do the menu. No, because I was going to tell them about, we got those boxes back in. 
Got the boxes back in. And if you want an alphabet box, you've got an alphabet box. Oh, I've got so much for you to do. I did that. I've got that one. I've got the alphabet one. Brilliant if you're making a quilt with a, chi well, a child's name. I say my name on it. Any name on it. Alphabet, you can do writing. and if That's later. That's later. This is what you need to buy now. Right, if you don't know how it works, we had somebody message in yesterday saying, I don't know how a Gemini machine works. Well, this is how a Gemini machine works. You take your one plate. You take your metal sheet. You take your piece of fabric. I'll you reuse this fabric because I don't want to waste any fabric. You put your fabric on there. Right, you take your die. Now, this, you don't do it like this, but you, you, you can spread. Don't waste fabric, that's what I'm saying, right? Then you put your shim in. Then you put your other cutting plate in. It's ever so easy, ever so easy. And it's all done by pressure, right? And then you literally just slide your sandwich in there. Doesn't get hot, there's no, there's no heat, there's no blades or anything like that. It's a 19 seconds through from one side to the other. It will go. Oh, it only did quietly that time, clink, clink. You've got a button there to pause if you want to. You've got a button to reverse if you want to. You come through the other side. You literally take your fabric out like that. There's your pieces, perfectly. And every single piece is identical. It's got the seam allowance already included in the dies. Fantastic, it's fantastic. The other thing is, right, don't think, oh, I've got children's dangerous, dangerous. This one, look, I'm putting my fingers in. That does not set off, right, until the plates are in it. It can gauge the size of the plates that are going in. So little children's fingers or your fingers is not going to set it off. So don't be a cat's tail. Mind you, my cat's tails will most probably set it off because they're like... Um, I'm a bit worried about Luther's tail because it's about this long now. It's really, really long. It's got kind of kink in the middle of it. It's what, what? He's, he's got... They've both grown enormously, but Luther literally is about this long now. And their face... Because Ghost got on the bed with me last night and was doing all this, and I thought, you've really got the face of a panther, like a wild animal. So I'm hoping they're not going to grow much bigger. Maybe they are panthers, but they're very, very friendly. 179.99. Oh, split pay. I haven't even talked about split pay. 59.99. You could have paid for this by Christmas. Because what date is it today? It's about the 20th today, is it? Is it the 20th? 20th, so that'll be done by Christmas, will it? September, October, where are we? October, November, September, yeah? Christmas week, I'll be here. Christmas week, I'll be here. Bruce has got a video he's got to show you. Uh, I'll do some more messages. Um, my cat is watching you, says Carol. He answers your questions. Roxana says, morning, John, Hannah and everybody. 66 sleeps till Christmas. I know you have to start writing your letters to Santa soon. Oh, be careful, Delphine. Don't wreck our set as well. Delphine's just been on Hobby Maker. Broke the set. She broke the set completely. Okay. And she did what? Oh, and she broke the machine. And, oh, she's not doing very well this morning. And she, they've got pink and blue glitter in next door. And she's wearing a pink and blue top, so she sort of disappeared into the glitter. She's not in a good mood. No, they didn't see you do that. She did that as she went on the first time. Anyway, look, 179. I've got to get on. Look at the time. Right, so that's that, 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 that. I'll let Cat clear that up. I'll let Cat clear that up. I'll lump. Oh, no, I could just do that like that, can I? Now, before I show you the menu, guess what's back in stock? I'm not doing it now. I'll do it at the end of this hour. But back in stock. Back in stock. The Stripology Extra Large. I shall be doing a demo at the end of this hour. I'm not putting the graphics through now. You can find out. Right, let's do today's menu then. Here it is. So I've got velvet fabrics this hour. Velvet fabrics. They're beautiful. In fact, I've got a cushion that uh, Kate from made for me from Merseyside with the velvet on the back. It's beautiful. Then at nine o'clock, oh my word, we've got this quilt. The Tula pink quilt with Delphi. But look at it. Look at it. Now it's huge. It's huge and it's flipping gorgeous. It's really, really, really lovely. We haven't got a finished one to show you, I'm afraid, but you can see from that how spectac spectacular it is. Then at uh, 10 o'clock, Becky's here <coughs> with Crafter's Companion. <coughs> a birth Crafter's Companion birthday build a block with Becky Swan. We're finishing off the cushion from yesterday and we're also putting in, um, zips on a roll and all that sort of thing. Then, oh, and got the alphabet in that one. 11 o'clock, we've got Fox and Owl applique cushions. Well, we've not only got cushions, there's the cushions. And we've also got, there's the one, oh, hang on, there's another cushion. We've got both cushions in both colourways, basically. And we've got wall hangings. That wall hanging, which you just saw behind me, 
and this wall hanging, which is behind me now. I wonder what that looks like over my head. Oh no, I'm not in the right place. There you go. Right, okay, back to the menu. Oh, now it's called Christmas Makes the Last Day. It's not, it's Christmas Fabrics. It's called Christmas Fabrics. Right, uh, there are three ways to get in touch. The first way is uh, by email. Studio at sewingstreet.com. Studio at sewingstreet.com. There you can message me on Facebook Live because it's working now. Um, Alan says, is it normal that the plates do bend? Yes, 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 it is. Oh, well, Alan's going to be 40 uh, this month as well. So I'm just says, uh, good morning, John, from Soggy Glasgow. <clears throat> and the third way is by going to the website. <coughs> www.sewingstreet.com. You go to the pain page, you click on watch the show live. And then you'll see that there and you'll see a box on the right hand side that says send message to studio. Now what you can also do, oh hello, you can also scroll down the page there, there'll be two columns. The f oh, early bird sold out, early bird are sold out. Right, there's two, <coughs> oh excuse me, there are two columns, today shows deals. There are two of the plates left, there are two of the plates left, right? Then coming up on today's show is like pre-order, that's everything coming up in the next five hours. So there's all your velvets. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful fabrics. There are your velvets, animal print, jungle prints, planes. We might not get through all of those, just to you. There's the quilt. There's the quilt. It's beautiful, isn't it? Stunning. Absolutely stunning. Does it say there how big it is? Yeah, 178 by 178, I think it says, doesn't it? Yep. Yeah, that's 178 centimetres, Hannah. <laughs> okay, scroll down the page. That's all Delphine. There's your stripology. Back in stock. Don't know why that's there, but there you go. There, oh, thread, thread, brand new thread. Brand new thread from Tula there, from Orophil. Be oh, now isn't it funny that she's got an owl and we're doing owl cushions and hangings. Right, here's Becky's hour. There she zips on a roll. All your bits and bobs that you need for Becky. Right, right, hang on. Where's the alphabet one? Oh, it might be in a funny place. But anyway, we'll come back to that later. We'll come back to that later. There, there it is. So that's a deal we're doing. It's the basic builder block with your alphabet. Not been on air before that one. Not been on it. Then there's Delphine's Owl and Fox Patterns and Bundles. Beautiful. There they all are. And oh, and she's got the iron in her hair. Oh, and the, and the pressing mat. Then the Christmas fabrics. Christmas fabrics. Wasn't there something I was going to point out? Anyway. <coughs> oh, there's the, um, the Dachshunds, the Dachshunds with the one that's half undressed ready for Christmas bit saucy morning john hannah and team very great here this morning i'm staying in bed watching you uh susie duncan what's susie duncan saying morning very excited for the quilt i need another project making carrot cake this morning to cheer myself up as full of cold and sore ears loving the shirt well susie duncan i don't like carrot cakes don't bring that one in oh hannah loves carrot cake hannah loves carrot cake no you're not here bruce bruce on nine days holiday after day everyone and don't we know him Right. Yes. Well, is it a pattern or plain? Uh, silver and pale pink. Ooh, silver and pale pink. Oh, that's two different ones. Oh, I thought you meant I was looking for a silver and pale pink one. Behind my iPad. That one, pale pink. Number. <gasps> oh my, oh sorry, hang on. Is it on the bag then rather than the fabric? Uh, 45, I've got that one. Grey background. Yep, yep, right, that's it, right, okay. These have been super popular on pre-order. Oh, look at the width. Look how wide they are. I can't even fit it into the screen. 8 99 for half a metre. This is Utopia in baby pink. Brand new today. Right, I'll pop it, pop it down on the desk like this. Hang on, let's get it in the right place. Pop it down on the desk like this. Right. <gasps> oh my word, it feels fantastic. The thing is, you can make cushions out of it. You can also make clothes out of this and everything. It's 100% polyester. How wide is it? 148 centimetres wide. So that's just shy of 60 inches, isn't it? 
June says morning, very wet here, but very mild. Uh, Low says morning from the Isle of Wight. Beautiful, 8.99 for half a meter. Remember you're buying it off the bolt. Look at those, the pe beautiful peacock there and butterflies and strange plants. Lovely little Chinese money plant there. Don't know what that bud is there. Aren't they lovely? Right, that's in the pale pink. Uh, morning, lovely people. I bought the velvet fabric last time they were on and they are gorgeous. I made some very expensive looking cushions from Karen. Karen, they do, the, the one that um, uh, uh, Kate made for me is beautiful. It feels so, the cats love it as well, but they don't scratch it. They just go like that. Ooh, 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 like that. 8.99, 8.99 for half a meter. Actually, you'd only need half a meter. And how many, how many cushions could you make out of that? Let's have a look. You could make three cushion fronts out of that easily, couldn't you? <gasps> And then I just have a nice cotton on the back, I suppose. Because you don't need... Because that's the front. That's, that's definitely going to be the front, isn't it? You wouldn't even need to quilt it or anything, would you? Right, quarter of the stock of that's checked out and a quarter's in baskets. Brands banking new today. Um, I, I'm just going to say this to you. Go to a designer shop like Liberty or, you know, one of the, the, the nice... And see how much you pay... For, well, John Lewis as well. Oh, yeah, John Lewis. And see how much you pay for a velvet cushion. I only know this because um, Becky, um, Ken and Barbie bought me one from Liberty. Now, I've lived here for 11 years. They moved, so it must have been about 15 years ago, and they left the price tag on it was Christmas, and it was £86 then for a velvet cushion cover. I know. I know. Georgina says, morning all. Looking forward to all the velvets. Well, here they are, Georgina. I won't have time to do all of them, I'm afraid. Right, so that's the pale pink one. I've also got the same fabric, but in silver. Oh, now. Oh, now this, oh yes, the bag's in there. This one, third of the stock of this one's gone already, look. Now you see that one's a little bit more in depth, isn't it? Look at the blues. Oh, it's the same blue, isn't that funny? Isn't that funny? The silver background makes it look so different, doesn't it? Gorgeous, £8.99 for half a metre. It's like botanical, isn't it? It's like, what have they called it? Oh, Utopia. That wouldn't be my, that wouldn't be my um, view of Utopia, but... This is where Bruce is going on holiday, he says, to Utopia. I've got what? Have I? Oh, yes, yes, I have. Yep, yeah, I've got it, got it, got it. So now that's on the silver. All the utopias. I've only got three, have I? Yeah, I, I might have more, but I've definitely got three because I've got it on black now. Brand new. Brand spanking new today, this is. <gasps> Wait till you see this black one. <gasps> oh my, we're talking about expensive looking cushions. Imagine the front of a waistcoat out of that. That's the last one of Utopia. Utopia black velvet, remember 100% polyester. They don't feel like polyester, they feel like silk velvet. I only know that because I know I've used silk velvet for costumes before. This feels like a really expensive silk velvet. 100% polyester though. I wonder what the washability is. I'll have to find out for you. Oh yes. Oh, hang on. I might not be able to answer it. Let's have a look then. Morning, gorgeous. Would it be wide enough to recover a four foot six headboard? Well, uh, yeah, four foot six is 48, 49, 50, 51, 53, 54. Oh, 50. Ooh, nearly tripped over a wire then. Yes, but hang on, you've got a very wide selvage on it. So I'm going to measure, look, I'll show you here. I'm going to measure from the edge of the pattern, right, to the edge of the pattern, because it's all very well saying it's, yeah. But here you go, so this is, here you go. Because it might, it, mm, mm, they're all the same width, they're all the same width. Oh, ha hang on, what did I just, oh yeah, look, no, 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 no. This is 59 and a half inches from the start of the fat pattern to the start of the pattern. So how did she say four foot six? 48, 49, 54, 52, 53, 54. Yes, because 54 is there, so you've got that much leeway to, uh, for your seam allowances. So yes, you could cover a headboard in it. Good question, Jan. Was it Jan, did you say? Jan, lovely. Ooh, you're, you live in a posh house, if you have that as your headboard. 
very on trend and you can put buttons in it are you going to put some buttons in it i'm covered buttons be beautiful oh, just in the black felt oh you know what oh look if you did covered buttons in one of the greys just the plain on there be beautiful let's do the greys next then okay so uh would you which gray would you like first one looks a bit more minky than the other one okay let's do silver first then so this is your silver so this is your silver right i'll put all three of these with it so you can see what it looks like if you want to mix and match £8.49 this one £8.49 now look this look the silver goes beautifully with all of those that may be not that one because it's just slightly off just slightly off but the pink looks gorgeous doesn't it I think this one would be better with the oh no this one might be better with the green actually but let's have a look let's have a look let's have a look there goes the pink £8.49 for half a metre now look you can see on the on you can see the nap on the plain colours can't you look oh beautiful oh taste that what how what oh it's different let's have a look oh yeah yeah but there's no white border because it's not got digital printed on it. it's just plain isn't it just the plain so it goes right right from selvage to selvage that one beautiful so that's your silver then i've got pewter this is pewter Let's have a look what that looks like with the three. Oh, now look. That's the pewter with those three. £8.49 for half a metre. That's your, it's a, I'd say it was more mink than um, that. Morning all. Horrible thunderstorms going on here, but what lovely velvet is brightening my day, says Bex. Blooper reel activated. You need to put that cat impression on your page. Oh, he, right. I don't know how to clip and things do things like that, so I won't be able to do that. Right, next one, please. This is going to be fun now. With yeah, do Hannah's favourite. What's your background colour? Ye I've got yellow background trees. turquoise is that from that one yellow first these are hannah's favorites yellow has been on before oh isn't this the one rebecca reed made a skirt out of i think so i'm not quite it looks a bit like rebecca reed that doesn't it 8.99 palm springs summer velvet no animals oh okay jill says i love the look of velvet but can't bear to touch it my dad was the same would these suit velvets be suitable for a jacket? Yes, they would. They're polyester, remember, though. Polyester. Beautiful. Same width, same... Everything. Everything. 8 dollars It's 8 dollars The ones with prints are 8 dollars The plain ones are 8 dollars Because obviously you're paying for the digital printing to go onto the velvet. And... Oh, it's brand new. This is the same print as that, is it? But in the, oh, now, what colour would you call that? A makeup bag for holiday. Oh, the mess you make with your makeup, though. They've called it duck egg. Duck egg, they've called that one. Oh, cush uh, cushions on any of these would look beautiful, wouldn't they? Beautiful. Half the stock's gone of that one already. I can hold it up. This is all because it's her favourite. She wants it to get the best treatment from a distance. You could do easily three cushion fronts with that for eight ninety nine. Use some of your stash cotton as your background. Oh, but you have to buy some of the plane to pipe it with. Oh, imagine it with a gorgeous piping with that. I don't know which one I'd go with. Oh, I think I'd go with the navy blue piping. Wouldn't you? Navy, oh look, 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 look from upstairs. Navy blue piping with that. Navy coming in next. Let me just put that with that, that with that, that with that. That goes to Cat. Oh, this is beautiful. Is it, do we call it Navy? 
It's the richest, look at the colour. Oh, John, look at the colour. That was Tenor Denise, remember? Oh, John, look at the colour. Don't, don't you remember Tenor? Oh. Oh, wait, did you never work with them? So, I do apologise. How funny, he was the younger brother. Did you work with Tony then? Oh, that's why then. Uh, oh, I don't know, hang on. Yes, oh. It would work with the yellow, but I, tend, I think I tend to go for the green with the yellow. So I'll finish the navy blue first. You want to see the palm tree with it there. There you go, look, there's your, there's your palm tree. And so this one's 8.99 half a metre. That's 8.49 half a metre. That's the two together. Beautiful. This is Hannah's ultimate favourite. Brand new today. Brand new today. Make sure you check out on those. £8.49. I'm not saying that, Hannah. Hannah's saying, please don't buy all the duck eggs. She wants some. Gorgeous, that's the navy one there. Then let me put the yellow one back in. And then I would put this with the dark green, I think. Uh, I'd say it was bottle green, hang on. Oh, hang on, I've got a lighter green coming up. Hang on, let me just check. I've got to find the bag to tell you the number. 26, 426, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because if, if you take a photograph of uh, velvet in the light, it sometimes looks different, doesn't it? So that there is your, this is plain green velvet bottle green. I'll start that again. Plain velvet bottle green, 849 half a metre. That one there is Hannah's uh, favourite in the yellow. This is just my, this is just my choice. You might want to put pink with it or something like that, might you? That's lovely to see them together. It's called Palm Spring Summer Velvet. Well, if you imagine those two half metres, you could make three cushions and pipe it, or you could make four cushions and pipe them, you know what I mean? Use that as the piping on the green one. Team it beautifully. Gorgeous. Right, let's move on. Now, where are you going to go next then? White background with animals with tigers on it. And I've got this in another colour as well. Is it that one? Is it that one there? The first one. Oh, there it is. There it is. Where it is? Right, brilliant. Right. Okay. The green one's different. I think different leaves, isn't it? Yeah. Right. So this one's got a white background. And this has got tigers and leopards on this one. Where's that? Oh, yeah. But that is now one got zebras on it as well. Oh no, it's a different one. Oh, oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. That's later, All right? Hannah's got a plan in her brain. Uh, so hang on. Four nine eight. Was that this one? Oh, that's right. Oh no, no, this is four oh four. This is four oh four. Right. I don't. I'll wait for that one to find that one. Beautiful. Brand new today. Next one, you, this one here. Oh, that's very playful, that one. I'm just checking I've got the right one. 440, yep. Brand new today. Oh, they, they look like photographs, don't they? They're so clear. Beautiful quality on there. Oh, it's, do you know what? That's got a. When you get this home, it's got like a 3D effect. Like that one actually looks like it's behind those leaves and everything. It's incredible. It's multi directional, obviously. He says. Yeah, yeah, because that one's upside down. Beautiful. Then this other one I've got here. This one, this is more of a navy blue. Oh, it's got zebras. Oh, I'm, oh it's got all sorts on this one. Oh, oh, look at that one. 
Loads this one's gone on pre-order. So you've got a toucan, a parrot, a zebra, a one of those, leopard, peacock. I don't think you'd find all of these in the same vicinity, would you? Oh, they're friends. Oh, Judith says, John, watching from hospital. Oh, Judith, get better soon, my love. Oh, look at that as a picture on your telly. You see, you could get a half metre of this and stretch it on a canvas. That would be a lovely picture, wouldn't it? Loads of you coming in for that one. Check out, check out on the Royal Palm Midnight Velvet. Lots of people buying that in multiples, not just buying it by the half metre. Beautiful. The ones with multitudes of animals. Oh, hang on, hang on. I've got a white. Yes, I've got that one there. Have you got another one with animals on your side? Same prints we've just seen, but on a different background. Also, the peacock's going in the opposite direction. Yes, look, he's going in the opposite. Where's that one? How funny, it's back to front. They've done it all the other way. Have they? Am I being stupid? Yeah, I'm being stupid. Yeah, I'm being stupid. Beautiful with the polka dot background. That's, what's that fruit that looks like that? You can get a white fruit, can't you? Was it passion? No. Dragon. Dragon. Yeah, and then the white spotty on the inside. I don't think I've ever tasted that. That's beautiful as well, isn't it? Oh, when, when Hannah was, you know, single and ready to mingle, would have um, dragon fruit for her breakfast most mornings. Now she's lucky if she gets a bowl of cereal. Next. Is there any more with animals? Did you say, yes, another one with animals here. Oh, OK, you don't want that one yet, then. Right. No, that's all right. Yeah. Yeah. All of them are flowered now. <laughs> What's the colour of the background? I bet it's that one. Yes, we're in tune, Hannah. Oh, oh, this isn't like tropical. This is like a country garden. Oh, this it only comes in this colorway, this one. Oh, how beautiful. Is that maybe 60 inches wide or just have 60 inches wide? Beautiful. I made a, here you go, here you go. I said, didn't I, about, about clothes? Julie Vaughan has messaged in saying, I made a skirt out of the Palm Springs summer fabric. It's so easy to work with. Oh, Julie, I bet it looks gorgeous. This one's summer floral in turquoise. Oh, now a headboard out of that, Hannah would say. What, you'd have to have very plain sheets. Oh, do you? Oh, don't come stay at my house then. So I've got um, Strawberry Thief in the one bedroom. I've got William Morris Gold in another bedroom. I've got beautiful Indian print in the Indian Princess bedroom. Uh, and it only has white. Oh, and Bruce is moving into white sheets. With the what? Oh, with the blanket over the top at the end, like a bed runner at the end. You'll have to go and sleep in the other room when you want to sleep with your space cat duvet then, Bruce. Beautiful. That's gorgeous, isn't it, that one? I'm a bit late this morning. Yes, you are. Uh, glad I haven't missed out on the velvets. They're gorgeous. Got another two. Another fab shirt this morning. Thank you. Kate, I was just telling about the cushion you made for me that's got that, one of these velvets on the back, hasn't it? Yeah, we've got so many new ones today. Oh, that, once you've checked out, that one's gone. That one's gone when you all check out. Oh, yes. Yeah, is it the one with, like, long sticks? Oh, no, not that one. Right, Protea. Oh, yeah, because that'll be that one. That'll be this one. Yeah, Protea. These are South African flowers, these. Oh, what? Drama? Drama? Drama, llama, beautiful. So you've got your soft pinks here, your flames here, the lilacs in there, black background. Oh, that's dramatic, isn't it? I've just seen what that looks like on your telly. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, 
899. Keep going through, keep going through the very, 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 very popular. Stunning, isn't it? Proteus. Oh, when you've all checked out, that one's gone as well. Oh, selling out, selling out. Because when we see your name come in, it doesn't tell us how many units you've got in your basket till you've checked out. So you could all get half a metre or one person come in and buy however much is left and it'll all be gone. Oh, John, so many lovely velvet fabrics. Got the one with the animals. Oh, Laurie, they're beautiful, aren't they? They're absolutely stunning. Right, next. Yeah. Flowers and birds. What colour background, sorry? That one, is it maybe? And that one? I don't think that is it not. That one. That one and that one. Right, I've got the let's do this one first, because I've got the the, the like the blue one first. These are brand new as well. Oh, oh look at the background. Like geometric background. Now, look, uh, now, these birds, well, that's a magpie, isn't it? Is it? But then that one's got, like, scholar, oh, look, look, this is like an Anna Maria Horner um, bird thing, you know, where she's gone out and drawn loads of different birds, because there's an orchid, a cacophony of birds. I could indeed. Can you see this? Oh, hang on, it's so wide. Let me just do half of it. There you go. Can you see the background pattern in it? Look. Do you know what it's like? Do you know at Kew Gardens, when you go into like the exotic garden, but they're all in the old buildings and the glass has got like the leaded shapes in the glass and things. How, I mean, the attention to detail. Oh, do you want to have another one? Sorry, the attention to detail is incredible, isn't it? Look. Yeah, we've got one over this print in black. Loads in baskets. Yeah, yeah, loads in baskets. Beautiful. Then we've got that one in black. Now look, wait till you see the background pattern in this one. Oh, ho, 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 ho. look. How beautiful is that? Because the background is like a lovely teal. It's black with the, then the, the secondary pattern is in a teal, but then they've, they've echoed the teal in some of the leaves and the birds and things as well. And the magpie one. I need to sit on my hands now. Okay, there's so many more to go. There's a gorgeous one with like two little cheetahs on over there or pumas or whatever those animals are. Oh, a velvet lampshade. I don't think I've ever seen one of those, Hannah. Gold on the... Oh, sh you, yo, I know where you've been. No, not Oliver Bonus. You've been to that shop where we went for coffee upstairs. Where's that... You know, we went to that little... Um, it's like Mat... Not Matalan. TK Maxx, but for in interiors. Home sense. Because they have those with the with the fancy outside the gold on this. It's so funny because I looked at one the other day. It didn't have any of this on it. It was a velvet, but it had that geometric print on the outside, but it had a gold on the inside. Very nice. Didn't have a price tag on it. What's the matter? Eight ninety nine. Okay, Bruce is really worried about you sitting on your hands for this amount of time. Moving on. Brand new again, that one today. So what, oh, Carol, imagine if it was hung. I said that, Carol. I said that, putting over a frame or in a frame. It'd be beautiful, wouldn't it? Right, where are you going to go next, then? Yeah. Uh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, got that one. Is that this one? Let's just check the number. Oh, this is very tropical, this one. It's called Amazon, or Long River to you and me. Let me just check it's the right one. What's the number? Oh, nine. No, no, that's not it. That's not it. That's not it. Ooh, with a black background. Oh, this one. That's navy blue. 
Let me just... Oh, it is navy. It is this one. There you go. No, 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 no. This is the one I picked up. Look how cute these two are. But look at that. So you've got parrot, monkey, heron, flamingo. I don't know what that one is with the blue head and the green wings. We only have Amazon in the Navy. In the Navy. You can get your Amazons in the Navy. Barbara, will Amazon pattern go with plain navy or bottle green? Nice shirt, Barbara. Oh, nice shirt, John, from Barbara, sorry. Right, will Amazon, so hang on, is this Amazon? Right, so you said bottle green or navy? Oh, now the bottle green, you're not, oh yes, yes, the bottle green's there, 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 there. So that's your bottle green, that's your navy. But I don't know if you'd want to have navy because you've got a navy background, haven't you? No, 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 this, no, bottle green, bottle green. Beautiful, let me move the bottle green out of the way. There you go. Oh, 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 oh. Do you know what, at this rate, I think I might have to do my stripology in 12 o'clock, if that's all right with you. I'll remind you about it. Yeah, yeah, I'll do the stripology. Rather than cutting short the velvets, because I'm loving these velvets, they're all brand new. I'll do stripology at 12 o'clock, in the 12 o'clock hour now. Thanks, Kat. Kat's happy with that. We're all happy with that. Can we go close on a monkey, please? Be careful it doesn't bite you. That's, that's, that's like when you're in Gibraltar, isn't it? And you go up the, up the mountain. Would these vel... Oh, I've done that one. No, I've done that question. Sorry. Quarter of the stock has gone. Oh, who's that from? Tina in Kent, did you want jewellery maker? It's come through to us by accident. Well, she won't know, she won't be watching, will she? I wonder, I wonder how um, that we get their messages then. Anyway, don't matter. Oh yeah, we do have a text number here, do we? Anyway, moving on. That's Amazon in Navy. Right, where's next then? Oof. A, yeah, exotic on black and exotic on cerise. Here they are. Which one first? Cerise first. These were in stock, sold out, back in stock today. There you go. Oh, it's absolutely, no, hang on, has it got a direction? Yeah, that's the right way. 8.99. <coughs> £8.99 for half a metre. This is called exotic, exotic cerise. Beautiful. I've also got exotic in black. No, I'm all right, thanks. Oh, look. Look. Exotic in black. Loads in baskets. Please be careful. $8.99. That is stunning, isn't it? Okay, moving on. I'm going to finish all these velvets, so don't worry. I know we're running out of time, but Delphine will get her full hour. Don't worry. Right. Where are you going to go? Oh, I've got, I've, got, I've got a bag on its own there. Right, next. Leopard print on their own. I've got leopard and tiger, yeah? Or are they both leopards? I'm not very good at uh, animal history. Is this leopard and that tiger? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, no, maybe it is leopard. Maybe it is leopard. I'll start with that one, shall I? Right, okay. Let's make sure we get the right number. 
So this finishes 493. Yep, that's this one. Oh, now is that leopard then? It just says Bacora Tan. What's a Bacora? I thought that was a curry. Oh, it's a place. Look, I'll put my hand in so you can see. Oh, do you know what? Let me hold that up. Oh, look. Oh. Little top with a black velvet skirt for Christmas. $8.99. So what animal do we think it is then? Do we think it's a... I think it's a tiger, you see, but... I don't know if tigers have spotty bits. Maybe it's just a melange. Maybe that's what Bacora means. It means every animal skin tone there is. Eight ninety nine. Eight ninety. I'm going to move on anyway. You'll get that one if you order LKC four nine three. That's the one you're going to get. And then the other animal print here, which to me looks more leopardy, but it might be a puma, I suppose. This one ends 401. Very Bet Lynch. Oi, Jan. Or Jenny Jackson. More, that's more like it. Tanzania. Tanzania in beige, this one. Eight ninety-nine. <laughs> Maybe that's his subliminal way of getting you to fancy him. Because he knows that you fancy it. Right, just so I've explained at home what's happened. Anna's found a, a stitch and tear packet, right? And you know how it normally has Roger in his sweatshirt and everything? This is what she found, right? This is producer Ben, right? I know. I reckon that's from when he did the... Remember you had to do the home... Not the home stains, because that's on... Um, uh, what's it got? When you get married first sight. Like, I think that's when we did the... A takeover, it's the Instagram takeovers, and he went home. Do you remember? And he did all things on his page and everything. Anyway, just be sure your sins will find you out. That's what they say. Right, next. Plain, teal plain. Half the stock of this has gone already. This is your teal, £8.49, just your plain teal for half a metre. Glad to see you awake, Jan. Well, this is nine o'clock, after all, on a Thursday morning. Is it Thursday today? Yeah, Thursday morning. Chicka chicka, boom boom. £8.49. Beautiful. Keep checking out on those. Keep checking out. Now, there's very little of the teal left, I'm being told, down my earpiece. Right, hang on, let's just put these together then. So that one's the same as that one. That one's the same as that one. And that's one on its own. No, that's the same as that one. Right, okay, ready, Hannah? There's six prints left. Oh, I see, is that the same as that then? Yeah, so I've got that in four different colours and then I've got a jungle one. Okay. <laughs> yes, I'll just get those from over here. Comes in black and navy. Black one first. This is the one I thought was earlier, was Amazon, didn't it? It ends 470, yeah? Rainforest, this one. Black background. I've also got this in a navy background, if you want a navy background. Why is Yarn Lane just on Mondays? Because that's the only day we do it now, Ben, I'm afraid. Beautiful. 8 99 And it's on a Monday because Rebecca Reed is normally on on a Monday. She's on holiday this week, but she's normally on Monday, so she can still do Yarn Lane. That's Rainforest in black. 
Then we have rainforest in navy. Oh, have you? Lovely. This is rainforest in navy, this one. Oh, I like it in the navy. Personally, my own personal opinion, I love the rainforest in navy best. Kath. Morning, John. You're so funny. How can you mention Bette Lintz and Jenny Jackson in the same breath? Well, you never see them on telly at the same time, do you? Uh, Trudy. Oh, Strudels. Morning, John, Hannah and team. Loving the velvet fabric. You do brighten my day. Thank you, Trudel. I've got a letter here for you, Trudels, with your labels in, by the way. 8 99 What were your questions were you going to ask me, Han? Oh, 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 I see. I see. I see. I see. Okay. Oh, look at this. Good morning, John. Here is a lamp I made using the rainforest fabric for the shade, a cheap candlestick and a bulb converter kit. Which would be the best plane to go with it, please? Lots of love from Crystal. Crystal, I've heard from you in ages. Right, hang on. So is that this one? Is it rainforest black or is it rainforest? Is it black or blue? I can't. Can you put it on the big screen for me, please? Oh, I love your wallpaper as well. Look. Okay, oh, it's the navy. It looks like you've got the navy there, isn't it? Which would be the best plane to go with it? Well, I personally would put... It depends what you're going to make. I personally would put this with it. But let me show you. Let me show you the choices. Let, uh, hang on, hang on. Let me put them all in for you. Yeah, okay. So navy rainforest is your main graphic, right? So this here... I'll do them one at a time. This here is your bottle green. That there is your bottle green with it. Right, um, this one here is your navy with it. We see the navy does look nice with it. That one there is your net. Sorry, cat, I've just got that back there. That one's your navy with it. This is your teal. No, no, we decided it's not teal, but we haven't done this one yet. This is the last plain one we're doing now. That's your last plain. So either me, bottle green, navy, or sunburst. Depends what you're making it with. What making with it, sorry. This is sunburst. Oh, look at Crystal's house. It's lovely. I love your wallpaper. So navy rainforest on the right-hand side. And then this is your sunburst. But what are you doing with it? Maybe sunburst might be a bit too bright for your house. Do you know what I mean? Because you've got lovely... Oh, no, look at your birds down there. I'd go with bottle green or navy then. I'd go with bottle green or navy, personally. Depends what you're doing. I don't know what you're doing with it. So um, I'm going to sneeze. Oh. <sighs> Sorry. Sorry. What's, what's next then? Oh yeah, that's it now. This is the last print. I've got it in four different colours. Hot pink. Oh no. Oh, it's alright, Kat, you sure? <laughs> oh, they were the first ones, Kat. Right, here you go. This is the one in the hot pink. Got it upside down, I think, yeah. Hot pink. They're like bulrushes and, and um, such like. Hello, Gemma. Yeah, it came in pink, grey, and... Yeah. Right, so this one here is your botanical hot pink. 8 99 We've also got botanical in... Yellow. Oof. Oh, got a question. Well, I'm unfolding that one. Morning, John. Will these drape well with a slight gather, or will they be too bulky? Um, right, okay, they'll, they drape. Hang on, let me just take the bag out of that one. They drape beautifully, look. Look, 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 if I hold that up. They drape beautifully. Um, you could put a gather in, but if anything, I'd do knife. It depends what you're going to make, but I'd go with pleats rather than gathers. Because if you gather it, you're going to get, if you're making a skirt, they're going to go, oh, sorry, they're going to go like this. They're going to go like that. If you pleat, Whereas if you knife pleat them or box pleat them, You'll get the fullness, but then you won't get the you won't get all the bulk at the top. You'll just get the knife pleat in there. Depends what you're going to make out of it, but I get, I wouldn't gather them personally. Anyway, eight ninety nine. That's your yellow one, botanical ochre. Sorry, botanical ochre. Then we've got the duck egg. 
pretty. I'd call that spearmint rather than duck egg myself. Oh, it's lovely though, look. Isn't that a lovely colour? I know we've run over, don't worry Delphine, we'll get a full hour. And so will Becky. It's only me doing Christmas, It'll, we'll have to take it off later. Yeah, no, that's fine. And then I've got this last one. In, now, what colour have they called this? Pewter. Oh. Well, it's a dirty silver before you've put, got the silver cloth on it. That's what it is. There you go. That's the silver one. Hi, John. I want to make pouches. What can I line the velvet with so they're not floppy? Oh, I don't know what you mean. Hang on. Who's that from? Sheila Lucy. You can put interfacing on it. You can iron interfacing onto it. That's not a problem because the back is polyester. The back isn't velvety. So you could iron on an interfacing onto the back. That wouldn't be a problem. You, 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 well, that's what I mean. So you could line them with a normal cotton, but if you don't want them, so they're not floppy. But you could just line them with a normal cotton. Yeah. I'd put some iron on interfacing and then line them in cotton. Crazy Lorraine's watching. Right, now we've had a request to see Utopia again. All three, there's your utopias. I started the hour with these three. Yeah, I've shown you everything now. Velvet-wise, that's everything. Check out, check out, check out, because they're all very, very, very heavy in baskets at this moment. Right. Which one did they want to see? Silver to start with. Oh, actually, look, that's the same silver as, yeah. Like a dark, oh, it's lovely though, isn't it? So that's Utopia. Oh no, yours, that one was a bit dark, wasn't it? There you go. So that's Utopia on silver. Sorry to bother you. Ah, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Who's this? Laurie, it's not a bother at all, my lovely. Sorry to bother you, John, because see the three Utopia with the peacocks, please. Thank you. It's not a bother. That's what we're here for. It's what we're here for. It's a shop after all, isn't it? So this is your silver, Laurie. Crazy Lorraine says, morning. Oh no, Crazy Lane, sending lots of love. Sending lots and lots of love. So that's your silver one. Beautiful. So then it also comes in. Which one, Han? Pink next. It's a very, very, very soft, soft pink. Look. These ones we started the hour with. What do you think about using this to make a double-sided... A double-sided... Uh, does that meant say curtains, do you think? Using... Uh, what? Uh, Ellen, can... Ellen, can you resend that message? Because I don't know what it means. And then, uh, no, 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 because it could say curtains, but then it would say, do you think about, I've never heard of double-sided curtains using curtain wire. Oh, I know that. It might be a bit heavy, I think. Um, I bought the Botanical Navy last time and made two cushions and a footstool. Fabulous fabric. Would send photo, but can't send the email. Kate, his email. <coughs> Excuse me. Here you go. Studio at sewingstreet.com. Studio at sewingstreet.com. Get it in quickly, though. Get it in quickly, because we've got to move on. Righty-o. And then in the black. That was Cat, not me. There's your black one. Well, that was a quick trip to Greg's. Utopia in the black. Would the velvet be a nice heavyweight curtain with black outlining? Sue, it would be gorgeous as curtains. Beautiful as curtains. I don't think you'd need black outlining on it somehow. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah, maybe. Well, maybe. I don't think you'd need black outlining, though. Have I missed Delphine? No, 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 no. She's not on yet. We've just gone a bit over June on the velvet. She's starting now, but she will get her full hour, so don't worry. 
Don't you be getting me into trouble, June. One more question. Hi, John. Nursing a knee replacement. Oh! What plane would go with Proteus, please? Love the show from Sophie Charlotte. Right, Proteus is the pink one with the black background. No, no, it's, I can tell you what they look like. It's the Protea flower. That one, that's it, brilliant. Well done, thanks, Cat. Oh, she's so organised, is our cat. Not cat producer, I'm not talking about cat producer. So this is Protea here. Oh, that's beautiful. So let me put that in there so we don't get it confused. So that's Protea. Right, I wouldn't, definitely wouldn't put the yellow with it. Oh, now. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Right. Oh, <laughs> right. I can tell you that's the navy, which I maybe wouldn't go with. That's the bottle green, which I think looks really expensive. That's the teal one, which I wouldn't necessarily go with. And then these two, that one was, that's the lighter one and that's the darker one. One was called silver and then I called the other one mink, didn't I? But I, I, I do that one. If, so either of those two, pu yeah, pewter or bottle green are the two I'd go with Protea. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Is that silver then? Silver, sorry, not pewter. That's pewter. So silver or bottle green. It's personal chase. Yeah, now you need to check out, check out, check out, because I need to go and Delphine, let's get in. Oh, did that picture arrive? Did the picture arrive? We'll just sort it out now. Right, be, now be careful, be careful, be careful, because ne all, nearly all of them are down to like this much. They've all got stock, but this much. This much. Yeah, they've all got like half a metre or a metre left. So if you want it, you need to check out straight away. Here's a lovely picture. Oh, look, footstool and cushions. Who was it from, sorry? Kate. Morning, John. Luscious fabrics. They are Jacqueline, aren't they? Right, Delphine is coming up straight after. It's going to be a quick break. Four minutes. Four minute break and Delphine will be here making the most, can we show a picture of it, Bruce? The most gorgeous Tula pink quilt coming up. Look at it. Oh, Tula, 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 see you in four minutes from now. Brilliant, thanks. For protection. Knock me down with a feather. Crafter's Companion is turning a sensational 17. And boy, do we have a celebration for you. We are bringing the razzle dazzle and putting on the Ritz for a fabulous and very flamboyant affair. And of course, you're all invited. From the 18th of October, we're going to be shining the spotlight on a glittering array of spectacular new launches. Some amazing offers and so many show-stopping surprises. Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street, as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. Head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope, and you're done. Never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. Are you a fan of Sewing Street? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing community. See you there! If you're a Sewing Street customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. 
So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Follow Sewing String on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media. And pick up some top tips from us too. Missed the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. Head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope and you're done. Never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one PNP all day. Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. So Delphine says, where's the iron? Where's the iron and the iron? She only took it on Hobby Maker with this morning, didn't bring it back. No, I'm having to unravel it because Zena's obviously raveled it all up during on Hobby Maker this morning. But anyway, Delphine's here. Say hello, Delphine. Hello, everyone. Hello, how are you? Oh, yeah. yeah. You're having a morning, I'm are you? I'm having a morning. So um, hope, hopefully you can bring me not, like a calming vibe. Yes, now. exactly. Well, yeah. look at this, look at this, look at this. It's stunning. It's absolutely gorgeous, this quilt. It's from Free Spirit. <clears throat> it's the Sunshine Daydream quilt. So it is a Tula pink pattern using Tula pink fabrics. And boy, oh boy, oh boy, how gorgeous is this? Believe, What's the matter, Han? I believe it's a limited edition. Oh, limited. It's limited, 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 right? £299, split pair of 99.66. It could be paid for by Christmas. If you think you're buying a Christmas present. You've got 12.3 metres of fabric in here. I oh, know, all by Tula Pink. Uh, you've got essential solids by Tula Pink. You've got a full... Oh, well, actually, should we just open it? Move over, Delphine. I'm coming oh. over your way. Oh, no. How are you? <laughs> Have a hug. Mm. Oh, come on, Brucey. I needed that this morning. Having a hug it. <laughs> You need to hug this morning. <laughs> All right, get off now. Has <laughs> anyone mentioned about Because I've not been watching you this oh, morning. Oh, well, what's happened? No, that when you stood there, you got the fox yeah, oh, there. Yeah, oh, yeah. And then here, if you go like that. You've got an owl. Yeah. yeah. Right, look, you get it the bag with the here. zippy in it, right? Look at all this. Oh, right, so hang on. Oh, there's a picture. Oh, it's an old picture of Tula. 13 and a half yards, 12.3 metres of fabric. Right, look at this, right? We'll come to the instructions in a second. Look! You've got your beautiful fluffy clouds in the lime green. Oh, there's lots of that. Yeah. And you've got it in the orange. And, oh, look, you've got the ICU in the big. 
Oh, now he's, yeah, I see you. Mm -hmm. Now, these are Tula Plains, look. We don't often see those, do we? Beautiful, beautiful quality. Then we've got the Saturday Lazy Days, whatever that one was called, in the gold, the blue. Then we've got the lovely mini fruits there, in the lime, in the peppermint. Then we've got your Mick Jaguar in the orange. You've got, McCall, I'll McCall you later in the blue i never know what that one's called i'll have to look that one up in a minute then you've got your beautiful saturday lazy saturdays in the pink you've got your mick jaguars in your green just look on the selvage of that for me while looking and then you've got your fabulous flamingos there lucy it's called what that's not called lucy Lucy, Lucy. Called, I thought, yeah. Yeah. Lucy. and then you've got your jade fabric there you've got lucy in green or oh, chartreuse green and the pinky red all that fabric in there right then we also have the instructions now this is like a book in itself isn't it yeah there's loads it's so much just show you what oh hang on i'd recommend that you photocopy them and see if you can do it again because this because half of it's fpp some's pieced so there's loads of oh loads no look this is interesting fabric designed by <coughs> tula quilt designed by stacy then recolored by tula so yeah i was watching a video with her um tula actually talking about this quilt and she said that this is a limited edition so there's there's no what you what's out now that's it there'll be no there'll more be, there'll, there'll be, be no, no more. more so what's the main there are there are videos of tula talking about this what's the main because i'm seeing here there's per templates galore what's the main this, so you have um, so some of it's pieced, yeah, uh, FPP yeah. and inset circles. Crikey, so there's lots. Oh look, 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 look! Beautiful instructions. Look at this. Oh look, and it tells you where to cut them out as well mm -hmm. to get the effect within the quilt. Mm -hmm. Because obviously these ones here, That's the um, cloudy ones, the fluffy clouds, are ombre, aren't they? Mm -hmm. So you need to cut it out the way she says oh my word it's gorgeous look at all of that and that's where the ombre is all around there. yeah beautiful hang on what else is here so you've got all of those and you've got then you've got your layout here mm -hmm. this is the actual finished thing here oh my word there's so much beautiful 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 and all the templates that you need so obviously there points i mean not points there um piecing that one there is your fpp, FPP yeah FPP FPP, 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 FPP. So photocopy those. Do not, do not use the real thing. So two hundred and ninety-nine pounds. Split pay at ninety-nine sixty-six. It's limited, right? So what, what, what basically what Tula is saying? I just explain. When these sell, that's it. There are no more. She's not creating any more. We won't be able to get any more at all. They will have all gone. They will have all gone. That's not your price. That's not your price. So it was two, what was it, 299? Whoa! You just knocked 40, 30 pounds off. You just made 30 pounds off that price. Okay, already, right, it's limited. We've got less than 20 now already, the amount of people who've checked out. We've got fewer than 20. Uh, we've got a little video to show you before we do anything. There's no sound. There she is with the quilt. You, when you watch it, there will be sound with it. It's on her Facebook. All about the design process, putting it together and everything. Two hundred sixty-nine ninety-nine. Okay, now I also suggest if you try Google, googling it, Yahooing it, or binging it, because because it's limited, not that many people will have it. I think we're very lucky. We have a very very good relationship with Tula and Free Spirit and everything. So we've got ours. We haven't got anywhere near. We've got like a quarter of what we'd normally have of, of our big quilt kits, right? So please, please, please be careful and please go and have a look to see it right. Right, okay, so that's your price. It's split pay of 89.99. Um, if you've already checked out, you still only pay 269.99. It'll be paid for by Christmas because 20th of October, 20th of November, 20th of December. I love that starburst effect around the edge. It's, it's stunning, isn't it? really, really beautifully designed. Right, it? I'm gonna go and fold all this up. I'll leave you now to start. Um, showing oh. us what to what bit are you going to oh no before you start sewing i've got something else to show them oh, right. okay. sorry no brand fine. new today brand new today brand new today threads from tula 
And isn't it funny that she, we're doing an owl one today and you're doing an owl in the I next know, hour, isn't it? There you go, meant to be. Moon Garden, this one there, weight 50 weights, 10 small spools, 50 weight, 220 yards on each one. There's the still. Here we go. Obviously, the ones I've got in the studio have still got the cellophane around them, so they're going to look a little bit shinier than they would do normally. But look, beautiful. Actually, these colours are perfect for this quilt, aren't they? Look. Oh, he says. If you're going to do some top stitching on them, look at the colours in there. All the colours that I've got in this. Is it to go with it, then? Oh, no, not necessarily. Moon Garden, it's called. 50 weight, beautiful, isn't it? Look at the colours there. 36 pounds and 99 pence, you get, what well, makes them three pounds 69 each, doesn't it? 50 weight, beautiful. Right, they're brand new today, if you're thinking of a Christmas present for somebody. Now, Delphine, I'll be quiet and I'll let you get on with the demo. <sighs> you're all right, yes, calm down yes, now. Yes, yes. So why have you had such a bad morning then? Oh, I've had things break, I've had, I've, I went on Hobby Maker. <laughs> And they've got all the they've dressed the set all really nice, and I'm, things are falling all over the place. I what did you just walk into the set? No, there was some feather things. With oh all yeah, beads we saw on, it. And yeah, it went flying. Oh no, yeah. that wasn't on air. You weren't seen that on air on YouTube. That was before she even made it. Yeah, it's you know it's just one of those days. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But hopefully it'll get better it now. It'll get better now. Okay. Hopefully. Gorgeous, gorgeous quilt, and it's a lovely size. Look, one meter seventy-eight by one meter seventy-eight. Oh, that's me. I'm one seventy-eight. Am I not, or am I one eighty-seven? I'll have to. I'll look it up in a minute. I'll look it up in a minute. I'm one sixty-eight. I. One hundred sixty-eight centimeters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't. Are you gonna measure me? No, <laughs> no, <laughs> no. Well, so I'm six. So one hundred and fifty is sixty. Is six inch. That's five foot. So, oh, I think I might be a bit taller than that. But anyway, it's a bit double bed size anyway. Right, off you go then. Okay, so in the templates, like I said, I recommend that you um, photocopy yours. I didn't, I just went straight, uh, straight for it. So you're gonna start off with um, your ring number one. So the ring number one is made up of these segments here. So it is FPP, but it is really easy FPP. Um, so if you've never done FPP before, don't worry about it. This is really easy. Um, so you, you don't even need pins. It's that easy. Okay, so you're going to have all... It's g even giving you your cutting guide already. You're going to have quite a lot of excess um, left over. Lots of pieces, as you'll see in a minute. So um, you'll definitely have loads and loads of fabric left over. So you're going to start off with fabric 1D. And so all the letters of whatever the fabrics are they're all here so i know that d is the um orangey cl uh, fluffy clouds one so you're going to first of all i'm going to fold so you're going to need a piece of card i'm going to fold between piece number one and s get my two pieces so all of the fabric goes on the back right sides facing up so the numbers is what you sew on and the fabric goes on the back of your fabric. I'm already taking my next piece and I'm going to make sure I'm going to put it up by eye so I know it measures so it's about a quarter of an inch over. That said, I'm not even going to pin it. Okay. Donna says she's really looking forward to this demonstration. Have a great day. Uh, Viv says it's called Lucy because it's Lucy in the sky with diamonds. Oh, well, there you go. So thank you, Lucy. Uh, Viv, thank you for that. Uh, you're going to sew it with a, um, you're going to top stitch right over the line, but make sure you sh shorten your stitch length to about a one, so it's easy for the, for the paper to tear okay. away. But just bear in mind that if you, when you are uh, sewing it like that, if you do make any mistakes, the paper's already torn, which is why I recommend that you to make your own copies. Yes, yeah. You go back to as small as a one then? I do. That's where I go back to. Yeah. There we go. And then that's my first piece. Let me just get rid of that. Already in place. So I'm just going to fold that back and give it a press. So if you've got one of those little clovery things. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We've got a new one actually. So we've got a red one, ready pink one now. Oh, it's out of stock. Sold, I think I sold out on the first day. 
So press that into place and then I'm going to put the card over the lines between two and three, fold back and I'm using my adequate uh, adder. In oh yeah, we've got those on, on the website. So it just saves so much time. Yeah. So there's my first two pieces in place. And then I'm going to get my next one. So now I suppose you have to be a little bit careful because that fabric you've just cut isn't is on the straight of grain now. The one you're putting on, you have cut on the straight of grain because you've cut that at an angle. Yeah. Just be careful. Do you use pe best press to best press uh, it first? Yeah, before you cut any of your fabrics out, yeah, give it all a bit of a best yeah, yeah, press yeah. first. Yeah, yeah, So it just gives it that stability, doesn't and it? And also with the orange, the fluffy clouds, because it is ombre as well. So, that, so Tula clearly wants to get that ombre effect going on in the center of yeah, the sun. Yeah, yeah. So what I did was, um, when, when I cut them all up, I had a, I put them in a pile from the light to the dark. Right. And so with each one that I was using, I know I was gonna get that ombre effect all the way Perfect, around. Perfect, yeah. So it's, just, you know, just thinking about those, the smaller details. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Really. So I'm just lining up my next piece and then off I'll go and sew that one down. So if I put that one on. Yeah. And also in the cutting guide, um, they tell you exactly what to cut all your uh, rectangles out. Um, the, what measurements? And are they generous? Yeah, very. Because <coughs> I hate it when uh, you get a, an FPP pattern, it tells you to cut it out, and it's literally only just big enough to go no, across the thing. So, really generous. That was the first piece I cut off. Oh, okay. So, there's no worry. Uh, always check, though, when you fold it over, it's going in the right direction, yeah. don't you? Yeah. So, that's the next piece in place. And then. Fold your card. Fold my card, add my quarter inch, and trim. So the, the hardest bit for this is starting, but I've yes. got enough time to show you. Yeah, yeah. Also, Delphine will get a full hour. No, we were 15 minutes late starting. She will get her full hour. So this one here. And also, because this is a new quilt kit, there's very little, well, there's there's no demos on YouTube at the moment. Oh, well, there Well, there is, because I've, I've just checked before I came, yeah. before I came on. And there's, uh, because there's so much to this quilt, I can't do it in an hour. No, 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 of course so, not, no. Um, but there's, there is, if you put, if you put the um, name of the quilt into uh, YouTube, yeah. there's a lady uh, who's actually doing a step by, uh, like a week on week. Oh, wow. You know, so the first week you'll do the centre circle, yeah, yeah, second yeah. week you'll do the FPP. And it's updating as we go along. So oh, it's almost wow. like a sew along now. Yeah. So if you've got But they'll the be kit, there forever anyway. They'll be so. there forever. So by the time you get the kit, you the whole video, all the so, videos. So will you be just up. found it by putting in the name of the quilt. Put it in the name yeah. of the quilt and um, and it's a step by step. So even though I'm gonna try and show you as much as the, the tricky bits yeah, now. Yeah. It, you will have a helping hand. Well, and also with, with YouTube, you can fast forward, you can, um, you know, if you think, oh, I know how to do this bit, or you can pause, you can do all sorts of things, can't you? So yeah. if it's there to help you use it, by all means. So I don't want anyone to think, oh, you know, because there's so much to it. But if you quilt anyway, and you do the, the piecing is, is fairly straightforward. It's, I thought this going on the curve. Is, yes, yeah. Is a little bit trickier, but as you can see, it's quite comes together. Yeah, exactly. And also, I like with these bits. If you just fancy doing half an hour of sewing in the afternoon before the kids come home or something like that, you could do one of these sections and then put it to one side and come back to it the next yeah, day. Sort of exactly. thing. It's not like oh, I've got to make a whole block today. You can just do one of the sections, just like do a bit of bits. sewing. So next piece goes on, and as you can see, I'm not even using any pins. I'm just going straight to. The machine. While Delphine's stitching that, I'll just tell you, I've got the outer quarter inch rulers here. Got them singularly today, so I've got the 12, yours will come in a packet, obviously. I've got the 12 inch one. So these are brilliant here, because you've got the little, um, when you're trying to get your quarter inch, you've got a little step there that you can match it up against the step. And you don't have to use the cardboard, you could use this beveled edge here to fold your papers over and everything. 17 99 that's your 12 inch one. Delphine's using the six inch version. That, is it six or five? Oh, it is six. Looks like someone's shortened that one, his hasn't. Here you go. 12 99 for the six inch one. Doesn't that look shorter than six inches? 
12 99 12 I haven't got any best press here, but in stock, we've got which flavour? No scent. No, scent free, but it's not scent free. It costs you 3 95 to send it. 11 99 scent free, no, no scent. 11 .99. I haven't got it here, that's it. Sorry, Delphi. Right. So that that piece is all done. Oh, okay. So it will look like it will look like that once you've finished it. Yeah, it looks a bit weird, doesn't it? It does. And then you turn it over, and we're just going to trim around these edges here. Right. Which one do we cut to? We're going to cut on this out on the on the outside. The line, furthest the outside furthest line. The furthest outside line. So when you do cut yours um, pieces out, don't you don't have to cut them out perfectly. Just I've just as you can see, I've just done it quite rough. Yeah. But then when I come when to you cut, cut the paper ones out, you I'm mean? Going, yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And so you will notice these little steps here. Um, don't cut those yet. Yeah. Because that's when we're going to mark up. That will all become apparent. Yeah, no, no, no. A, I'm only minute. smiling because normally when somebody says steps, I go five, six, seven, eight. I thought, we've got loads to do today. I won't do five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> and in the gallery, they go five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. <laughs> so I'm You're not sure. a fan of steps then? That's going back a bit, isn't it? What do you mean? They're top of the charts now. Are they? Yeah, their album. Are they? The album they? chart, yeah. Oh, no, I was never a step fan. Oh, weren't you? No. I only knew them because I was on this morning. They were in every other week on this morning all the time. Oh, were they? Oh, I bet you used to meet so many people on there, didn't you? I had a signed poster, a steps poster on my dressing room. Because when we were at Roxco, we all had individual dressing rooms there. And I had a, a poster, signed poster. Vix got for me when she went to a steps concert, oh, right? Oh, really? So they all signed it and everything. And then when we left, when we left that building, we had a very bitter manager and he ripped it off the door and threw it in the bin. Well, that's not very nice. No, didn't like me. How, how's that possible? Oh, it's very possible. There we go. Lovely. So it's, kind of, it's actually really good because you're doing it all in little sections, right? You're not having yeah. to do the whole arch in one, are you? Yeah, so this is made up of eight. Right. So you need to do eight of these. Lovely. But Gorgeous colours. But take into account that... Um, You've got to bin now, by the way. Oh, have I? Yeah. So I don't just chuck it under me. Oh, that's not big enough for me. <laughs> well, other people have been using it, obviously. <laughs> got to say, I'll, uh, that won't last long, will no. it? No. So I just want to show you again, just so I can show you how it starts, because I think, because I've taught a few FPP workshops as well mm -hmm. of late, and, and it's always the starting that people... Yeah. So I just wanted to show you it again. So it's... No, no, that's good. That's good. That's good. So again, I'm just going to take the one and just give it a fold. And that just makes it easier for you to line up your fabric. Yeah. So I'm going to take my, let me just think, I'm just thinking of my colour placement now. That can go on that one. So I'll go, yeah. So I'm just trying to get my shade. Yeah, no, no, that's good. So when you when you go off your break, there's a question for you on the Facebook Live. We haven't got time to answer it now, but if so you have a look on the Facebook Live comments later, there's a question for okay. you. There we go. So there's my two pieces already lined up. I'm just going to line them up to the light. And I can see that that's a quarter of an inch. Yeah. Give or take a tiny bit. And then fold and press. So I'll be able to do this quite quick. One. Yeah. Now. Had your nails done specially again? Yeah, I need them doing. They were, oh, do you? Were, yeah, they were pale pink and they were really long, so I had, to, I had the infill. They're not pale pink. No, my other ones were, and it, they weren't very me. I oh, like, okay. Fine. I, I went pale for a bit, and I was like, oh. um, your kids will be on holiday soon. We we're talking yesterday. It's half term again soon, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. In Scotland week. and in Devon, they're already on half term. Yeah, next week. <coughs> so. Um, I know, where's the time gone? I know, it's frightening, isn't it? Yeah. End of October nearly. Yeah. How many sleeps was it? 67 sleeps for Christmas? Oh, 66 yeah. sleeps for Christmas. Ah, oh, humbug. Have the boys done their letters to Santa yet? No, Charlie's given me a list though. Oh, what to give to Santa? Yeah. <laughs> so, oh, bless them. A bit at school now. Oh, yeah, they will be school. Oh, yeah, thanks to Bex. She took the boys to school for me today. In the rain. So Not I'll... our Bex. No, no, my, my, my Bex. Yeah. Yeah, my back seat. Yeah, somebody mentioned earlier said it was foggy and I said, I'm sure it was raining when I left this it morning. It was raining this yeah. morning. It feels like hours ago. I'm not, you know oh, what course, I'm like. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think you should get in that early. <laughs> <laughs> So 
So, so I, I can't hear you, Hennessy. Oh, right, we're way, way lower than 20 now, the squirt. We won't be able to get it in again. It's almost like this will be like a collector's item if yeah, they're definitely. never going to be no. made, brought no. out again. This is definitely the most beautiful quilt that I've ever been given to. Oh, okay. But the, um, uh, and we're also saying don't, don't do this as your first quilt. If you're going to buy it and you're new to it, save it, do some other quilts yeah. first and then do this one. What I love about it is the processes are all so different because yeah. I think with some quilts, you know, that you could get a really cool looking block, but after, after so many, you're like, oh, yeah. But whereas you're not going to get that with no. this. Every piece is, and you're going to, it's a skill builder as well. You're going to learn loads. But I think just even just keeping the pattern to do with other fabrics. Oh, yeah, well. definitely. I, I think it, the pattern would look really cool as like, like a chrome. Monochrome. Like a monochrome. Like start really dark in the middle and then going like, out. Oh. That would look really cool, yeah. funky, wouldn't it? I'd do it completely differently. I'd be rainbows It'd galore. Be rainbows. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, a rainbow one would look nice, wouldn't it? No, I'm thinking like a monochrome with like some magenta. Oh yes, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Something yeah. like that. Yeah. Or with, with a bit of this turquoise, that yeah. would look fabulous, wouldn't it? There I've just had um, a piece of fabric that I bought in Swaziland a few years, well, quite a few years ago. I've just had that made into a quilt looks completely stunning I, I, I still want to come to your house I'll, I'll be like that walking around I bet you've got all sorts of lovely little trinkets it's a it? it's a it, well it, yeah it looks a bit like a trinket shop <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> the trinkets that the cats didn't break when they first arrived so if you do do EPP or you know you can keep oh yeah we'll just keep those anyway you get, you? You yeah just, yeah so it's a shame to waste it yeah I want to go into my darker shades now, I think. Hannah's going through a darker shade at the moment of clothes. Have you noticed my hair's darker? No, it didn't. Oh. Sorry. Well, she usually notice those I things. know, normally I would, wouldn't I? Yeah. Why did you go darker? Well, I just got a shade darker because I thought autumnal, but also because my eyebrows are quite dark, it looked a bit oh. with the blonde. Yeah. And more of my natural colour. And apparently I haven't natural. got many Natural? Well, well, that is. None of that's natural, it is, is it? It's only have a half head. Who are you waving at now? I don't oh, know. you missed yesterday. You missed cupcakes yesterday. I've heard I missed a lot of food yesterday. Apparently there was all sorts of Oh, no, they had, they had cakes in the morning for the peak because they had, um, what, what was the, they had some sort of competition going on on jewellery maker. But then, because yesterday was the 18th birthday of Gemporia, yeah. they had cakes. And I'd realised I didn't take mine home and it's still there. Nobody nicked mine. It's still on the sewing machine, though. Yeah, you can have it, Oh, Hannah. yeah. Okay, this is the woman who will eat something that's green from her fridge. And she's like, oh, I don't want a cupcake that's been out all night. Funny thing. I'll put my last piece on it now, and then we'll put the circle together. Brilliant. You could jump with the longer ruler there, couldn't you? Yeah, I have got the longer one. I don't know why I'm using this one. Never mind. Yeah. It's because you look at it, it looks like it's only going to be short. Yeah, yeah. I mean, these are... You know, I wouldn't be without them. It's it's one of those tools that once you've used it, you'll always. And you'll wonder how you did it without it yeah. beforehand. Yeah. Otherwise, you've got to take longer measuring it. Whereas that, you just whack it on and cut yeah. it off. It's. So did you do Ali Pally this year? Did, did how Ali was it? Pally. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, it was. Um, Although I was a bit worried about driving in to London, I think I got flashed by a. Uh oh, um, you'll soon find out. I know. Because the whole really of central London's it. 20 miles an hour now. It's sh I'm really worried about I'm waiting for the letters to come through to say that I'm banned from driving. I'm, oh no. You know, I've had a clean licence for years and then I drive well, to so London. As soon as you get a flash car, you see, that's what it is. Oh, it's, it was because I. I think everyone was beeping and I was panicking. And, oh. You know, we live in a village. I live in the countryside. Yes. You know, I'm not built for city driving. Oh, you see, I, I drove to London last week, or the week oh. before, and I drove down Shaftesbury Avenue and I felt I'm like home. I oh, just really? thought, oh, I oh. loved it, yeah. Oh, it took no. me four hours because I had to go on train strike day, but um, but it was just, it was, um, I loved it. Well, that was the, that's the problem with me. I'm not a, yeah. yeah. I, was, I was in a real, like, 
<laughs> like, time I you weren't even home. going in the centre of London. No, well, it sort of took me around. It was really heavy traffic, and you know, all the, the it was like beep beep, and I was like, so it was like, I was moving. You know, you move a meter, stop. Move a meter, stop. Move yeah. a meter, flash. Well, they weren't to flash if a, you were just a. I mean. was on a crossing. Oh no, you'll get a letter then. Yeah, and apparently it could be up to six points on my license. What, for being in a box. Yeah, and I think I did it twice. So I could be banned from Oh, drugs. no. It's not even funny. No, it's not. It's not, because I wouldn't be seeing you again for about, what, a year? If I'm banned? I don't know. Oh, I don't You'd know. You'd have to take me in. I don't live anywhere near you. I'll just take yeah, you out. Oh, oh, you have to get up early then. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'll come and stay with you, John. All right, then. Apparently, though, my sheets are common. Because apparently you're supposed to you should only have white sheets according to Hannah. My my um, William Morris ones are, are cheap looking apparently. William Morris isn't cheap though. No, I know, but she thinks they look cheap because oh. she only has white sheets on her bed. Right, so you've done all the sections. And then you need to make eight. Four, so you've got eight sections. Yeah. So you need to make four quarters. So you're going to sew these together like that. Okay. So this is where I mean that little step. Oh, oh yes. Because you need to offset them ever so slightly. I trim that one off. Silly of me. So you're going to offset them just ever so slightly. So that's where that point comes in handy. Because that's when you're going to start sewing. Yeah. And that way they're going to match up. So offset your um, triangle just just a little bit, and then when you come and sew the quarter of an inch. It's going to catch it all together. Uh, Lynn says, morning, John Delphine. I'm loving the quilt. Also, your nails. It's my birthday today, and all I'm doing is sewing. Make Aww. sure you buy a quilt first, then. Get him to buy your quilt. Andy, get his quilt. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Living in central London. <coughs> Hang on. Uh, is that how your message starts, June? Because you don't live in central London. Had all my driving lessons around Parliament Square, Hyde Park. Can't do country lanes now. Oh, you see, I love, li I love driving in London. No, it's not for me. Mm. I think, yeah, I'm, I'm really worried. I don't know how, will you, if you drive around London, if you live in London every day, how do you not, how do you keep your licence? Well, <laughs> uh, well, you do you drive properly. But also, don't, don't forget, most people who live in London just use the tubes and they don't drive yeah, into I London. Would, if it wasn't for the train strikes, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have used, I wouldn't have driven in. Yeah. So, yeah, can I use that in, can I use that in court? Yeah. I'm like, really sorry, but. Yeah. <laughs> Go in your police warden outfit. Didn't you used to be a, a, what were a police you? officer? Police officer outfit. I haven't got it anymore. Oh. But now I've been given an even because my car's now in the garage. Um, just what, being, hiding respray, <laughs> <laughs> being serviced, and um, so they've given me an even bigger car. Oh, to come into here with? Yeah. A so car. I, it is. It's. it's well, it insane. doesn't work like that in my garage. I get a really usually, manky one from I my garage. I think it's because Nick, Nick sort of put his foot down. Oh, okay. So. So there we go. So I've got two quarters. Yeah. Like that. And now we're going to make a half. A half. And again, offset your points again. So where on the quilt is this bit then? This is the central. This is. The, I'll just show you on here. If that. Oh, there you go. So it's on there. This is the. In the centre. You can't really see it on that picture, can you? I'll, I'll just show you carefully, closely on here. What we're doing is we're doing this. You see this inner the first circle that's what we're doing there so obviously delphine's got to put a circle in the middle but then there'll be another circle around that and then another circle around that so we're just doing that orange and green circle there in the middle at the moment so you're gonna it's fascinating isn't it so you're going to keep all your papers in yeah but, but do rip out the seam paper right it doesn't tell you to do that i don't <coughs> think this is just from experience when i've done other things yeah that it just helps you to um, press your seams flat so you have a nice flat circle. So some of them will start tearing anyway. Yeah, because you've used a 1.0 stitch. It means that it's not going to come undone then though, is it? No. I just find it so much easier to tear the papers out because they pretty much fall out. Okay. I'll do. That's okay. it. Message on the bottom. I learnt to drive in London in my lunch hour. <coughs> <coughs> First lesson I was taking along Fleet Street, says Reva. Oh, lovely. Oh, I don't I'm think I've ever driven along Fleet Street. If that was me, I'd never drive. 
Well, after I learned to drive in, in Mould in North Wales. That's where I, t I passed my test. And because it was Tuesday morning at nine o'clock, Mould in North Wales is a tiny, tiny, tiny little town. And because it was nine o'clock on a Tuesday morning, the, the instructors or the examiner said, oh, it's rush hour. We'll just do it around the uh, industrial estate. So I did my driving test around the industrial estate where the roads were this wide and no cars. So you could do a three point turn by just turning just around. Turning around yeah. So I'd learnt there and I drove around Mould and it was actually quite nice. And then I moved to London and it was like, I just put my car to once. I didn't drive it for years and years. Yeah, it I don't blame me. you. It's but then once I started in films, you have to drive around London. So I just... Oh, I don't know how you do it. Okay, so you now got a circle. Patching, so you can see how I've been quite... How I've done ombre, the ombre. Yeah. So again, <coughs> just think about that when you do your cutting. Just do what I did and just, start, you know, lay them all out in yep. the shade. And now we're going to sew the two halves together. Lovely. So quite nice seeing it all come together now, yeah actually. well it's only the first circle you've done so far but actually well, that means the circle in the middle is, that looks see on the picture it looks quite small in the middle that bit doesn't it but actually it's going to be quite big that yeah, little bit. yeah i've got that bit too yeah sure. and then also the outer circle yeah and again that's done slightly differently so I'll and i love the way she's also in the butterfly one the triangles are just big enough to have a butterfly in them so you actually yeah. cut it with the butterfly in the middle of the triangle yeah so you've got the, the triangle template and you just you just fussy cut those yeah. well you know what i mean place it over yeah them. what you do with some of the uh, template plastic that you can see through it then couldn't you yeah it does say if you've got template plastic oh, okay. to use that or f uh, freezer paper yeah if you've got that So I thought I'll just concentrate on more of the trickier. Yeah, 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 no, no, no. Because the, the rest of it, after, after the, there's, there's three FPP circles. Right. And the rest is just pieced. Okay, so the three FPP circles will be the one that we're doing now. Yeah. Which is the green and orange one that you're doing yeah. there. What's the next one then? That, that the, the small one. Rounded. That one there. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to show you how to do that one. Brilliant. And then that one there. Yeah. And then that's it. The and then all of this in the middle here is piecing. Yeah. Brilliant. Thank you. So I thought. Oh yeah, because the quilt doesn't finish there, does it? Obviously, you've got this bit on the outside. I was thinking that's funny. Are you going to bind that? Because it's just a circle. But of course not. You've got your sun rays coming out of there. <clears throat> there we go. So let me just. See, I did quite. A, I would prepped quite a lot for this one because yeah. I just wanted to make sure. I, and also, it gives you an idea of the finished size of it. Well, yeah, exactly. That's a shock how big that inner circle is. Yeah. So I'll I'll do the. Um... Oh, now please be careful if you've got it in your basket. Limited, limited. We cannot get any more. <coughs> Either you pay your two hundred sixty nine ninety nine today, or you can have split pay eighty nine ninety nine over three months. No interest charge. And then that is, that is just the centre. Look how big that is. Morning, it's my birthday today. Live on my own and need a John hug. Oh, Aww. Hazel. Look at this lovely on the table now. So that middle circle's quite big, isn't yeah. it? So you get, you get the circle templates and every, everything is included. Yeah, you haven't got to do anything, really. Hannah's just caught up with the conversation. Hannah's just saying, what colour co co colours would you do it in? She'd like to do it in different colours. Delphine would do it in monochrome with magenta. Yeah. And I'd do it in rainbow. Alison Glass fabrics would be gorgeous. And so yeah. there's, there, that gives you an idea of the centre. Wow. So I'll come to show you, I'll show you the next circle and then I'll point out how you piece it together. Okay, brilliant. Because it is... That's in, just the centrepiece. That's just the centrepiece. Cent and yeah. you can see how big it is. Yeah. It's going to be huge. 178 uh, by 178. That alone, to me, if you could, do, you know, you could even put a, you could do that as a big, like, uh, floor cushion. Oh, yeah, yeah, that definitely. That would look beautiful, yeah. wouldn't it? So which bit are you going to show us next, then? I want to show you the, 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 next more, the, the more dainty one. Right. I've done quite a bit already. All right, brilliant. But it's that foundation paper piece again, is it? Yeah. Yeah. And then this circle is the exact same, apart from the... Th the, the width yeah, of the... as the outside circle. So that's why... So the method is the, the same method as the outside. is yeah, exactly yeah, the yeah. same. Brilliant. So we're going to be making these quarter arcs. Right. So this is actually made up of six pieces. Right. Uh, six, six, six templates. Yeah. Six templates yeah. that, that make up the one 
the one quarter. So we're good. I've already done quite Just straight a lot. lines, Hannah. Isn't it? Hannah said, when we, look, when we looked at the pattern this morning in prep, it looks really complicated. But actually, that's just, I'd maybe start with that one because it's just straight lines, that one, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, really, really easy. The main thing is, it's just paying attention to your template. Yeah. Uh, sorry, the, the, um, the diagram of yeah, like yeah, making yeah, yeah. sure you use the correct colour fabric, you know. And so we'll chain piece these together and I've shown you how to put them together. So you make eight, did you say, of those? Eight of each. Yeah. Yeah, so so quite a lot. But I say that, I, I did these last night. Well, yeah, yeah, but once you've got, once you've got your pieces and your papers ready to go, it's not going to take, and your little iron or your, or your roller, seam roller, you're ready to go, aren't you? Yeah, exactly. And it's, um, there we are. Like I said, there's, lo there's loads of them, I'm like this. Well, be careful. Lots of people checking out now. Lots of you checking out. Colours are beautiful, aren't they? I mean, this is just really showing off how, the t how beautiful yes. tulip yeah, fabric exactly. is, isn't it? <coughs> it's gorgeous. I wouldn't need a rainbow one, really. I'd just do this one, wouldn't I? Because it's like a rainbow in yeah. itself. So, there we go. So, that's our segment. So, I'm just going to show you how to do each one. So, right. again, it shows you on the back. So you've got 2A, 2B, and 2C. Right. And again, the exact same thing, it goes on to the back. How do you know fabric. which fabric's which? It's all in the die, it's okay. all in the pattern, yeah. yeah. So again, you just give them a fold. Between one and two. I mean, you don't have to fold it, I just find it just helps. Yeah, when exactly. Because we're not pinning, it just helps to place your first piece. So you take your fur, your two pieces. I'm going to chain stitch these just to make it nice and quick. Gives you an idea of how to work with it at home. So I've got my right sides up and the other one's right sides facing. Brilliant. Down. Yeah. And Why is that moved? I want it shorter than that. Donna, uh, message Delphine directly with your question. There we go, so that's that one. Oh, so you're doing FPP and you're doing chain piecing at the same time. Yeah. You'd have to do this at home. This is just, it gives you an idea of how to make it a little bit quicker. Yeah. She says, at, at home, you'd have all your little piles of your fabric all laid out, so you just pick one off each one. Yeah, I was really organised at home. And, and then, then you threw it all in a bag. <laughs> yeah. You know me very well, John. Yeah. Well, it's going to move in. I'm going to have to, aren't I? <laughs> Finally getting me carpets done. Kieran's doing me carpets in a couple of weeks. Kieran's yeah. doing your carpets? You know Vic's is Kieran. What's he doing to them? Um, I thought he put down stone floors and wooden floors. Do you do fitted carpets as well? Yeah. I didn't know that. I haven't got any carpets in my house. Have you not? No. Uh, I will have to have carpet on the stairs. My stairs are still bare. Your stairs are bare? Only because the people before me had cats that obviously used to do their business wherever they fancied. So this car and they used to scratch on the stair because I, I, just after I moved in I ripped it all up. Oh. I suppose if you've got cats, yeah. yeah. but then I never got round to putting it, so it's just wooden stairs at the moment, they've been like that ever since, because then I'm thinking, well I'll get the hall and landing decorated before I have a carpet fitted. How long have you lived there then? 11 years. Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> then you haven't got much of an excuse there, have you? I haven't got any excuse at all. I've still got a hole in the kitchen ceiling that needs blastering. Oh John. I know. I, you don't see it after a while though, do you? It's not like your house, not like a show house, like your house. My house is really tatty. Mine's, mine's not a show oh. house. <laughs> I'm just very tidy, but if you open a cupboard, everything falls out. Yeah, it's a show house. <laughs> there we go, so there's those pieces all in place. You'll have to come down to mine, then we'll go to the barn for a coffee and a oh, cake. Yeah. yeah, we keep saying it, but we must do it. I'm not in now after today for ages. Aren't you? No, oh. so, so I'll, um, 
Yes, the, not until the 11th, I don't think. So I'm around. Okay. Yeah. Please. Say that again, Han. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. How much time do I? Have? Uh, well, you've got another 15, 20 minutes. Oh, okay. 15, 15, 15, 15, 15. 15 oh, the Tula, pink, the Tula Pink Quilt fell into my basket. I had to buy it. Can't wait to start, says Deborah. Deborah, you're going to love it. Deborah, let me just, this is just the centre, right? I, I can, I'll hold it up. It won't be the best way of showing it. But look, that's just your centre, Deborah. Look, isn't that incredible? Oh, sorry, that my bad, I dropped it. That's just your centre there. Look, it's incredible. We'll show it lying down in a minute. So, and the, how easy was that to create that sunburst around the edge? And now we're doing the, the narrower one that goes around the edge of here. So, will we sew this all together? Well, hopefully, all we'll, right, I'll show you at least how to pin it. Or half, together. or half. If we could put half, if you can make half of it, then we yeah. can just put it around there. Is yeah. that all right? And then yeah. you've got to do a bit of piecing, have you, after that? So I didn't do, I thought I'd just put this, this one, because okay. this is the hardest bit. All right, then. Is that okay? I thought you said there were three things you were doing. Well, yeah, I was going to show you this. Oh, put then, the circle in, put yeah, the circle in. Yeah, because the circle's... All right, get on with it, then. It's bossy today. Don't speak to Delphine like that, they <laughs> saying now. I've lost my piece. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it's... Um, so it's what are you doing between now and the 11th, then? Oh, but loads on. Oh, okay then. So you're not around every day then? Uh, no, but I've got, you know, I've got, you know, do me, you know. Are you allowed to say that? She's doing her book, everybody. She's doing her book. <laughs> doing a book. Yeah. Um, finally. Oh, yeah. How's your website? It's doing really well. Oh, uh, go no, check. hang on, hang on. It, there was it, only an opening page, a landing yes, page. Yes, I know, but I've got a... Yeah. You got an announcement? No. 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 Not yet. Not yet. Oh, she's been very cryptic, isn't she? Not yet. But I've some really cool stuff happening. So, yeah. But go and check out my landing page, though. Well, it's only a page, yeah. isn't it? At the moment, there might be a gallery on there. Oh, right, though. Huh? Is there? Yeah. And what is it? What do we look for? Uh, just uh, DelphineBooks.com. Just go, if you just put that in, you'll it's see. It's only taken. It's only taken. Don't do it now. Don't do it now. There's nothing there but a landing page. No. But no, I've got stuff, lots of stuff going on yeah. in the background. Good. Well, don't, you can't come to mine on a Monday because the barn's not open on a Monday. Oh, oh lovely. Uh, yeah, well, I, mean, I am going to be start being free on Monday soon, actually. Oh, are you? Well, I'll have to come to you then. You can't, oh, yeah. We can go somewhere else. It's just the barn's easy, that's all. Yeah, then, because uh, I'm leaving, the, I've, I'm doing my last uh, shift at the gym next week. Oh, why? Um, because I'm too busy. <laughs> no, I feel really bad. They're really upset about me going. Oh. And I do feel bad about it, but I've got, you know... Got to get your priorities I've right. I've got to get my priorities straight now. Yeah. And I've been doing that for... I've been teaching for over 13 years. Yeah. And it's like... It's, I just feel like it's my time to... Move on. I, yeah. Um, you know, when I first started sewing, it was just... I was. I thought I was just playing at it. Yeah, and, get now. Look at and it. And now it's... I've got to... For me to really give commit i've got to really give give it everything i've got i also now. don't think people don't realize how long it takes to write a book or write a pattern or something like that yeah. there's so much involved isn't there yeah loads involved so it's uh yeah got a lot of which i can't I've got, i can't complain i'm no. really, i'm really happy well you're not no no you're not complaining but life as your as your life changes like it would have been like when you had children you had to make you know not sacrifices but your life had to change then didn't it that's you know what it. I mean? so your careers are moving on so you have to change that as well and it's hope you know hopefully going in quite an exciting direction oh and, yes um so i'm just yeah i just want to it's like i'm finally starting to think oh i, I can sew a bit i might yeah. try and do a couple can't of, drive my car anymore so i can't, can't go anywhere, anywhere. <laughs> so if anyone wants to see me or do any workshops it's uh, you'll have to come to wellsbourne i'm afraid yeah exactly <laughs> in the shed yeah. no i shouldn't even joke about it no imagine. you shouldn't oh, I'm hot, do, oh no but I'm never driving. If any, I'm never driving in London again, ever. Okay, so if you're going to come, and, if you're going to come and live with me, right? Yeah. I'll be moving back to London. What are you going to do then? Don't mind and go back to London, John. You're not. Are you? I am. Where? Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. But I am. No. Yeah, I am. 
what you can do. No, no, no. What do you want to move there for? Come and stay here in your lovely village. You've got a lovely... You live in a lovely village. Are you talking to me, Hannah? Oh, OK. Sorry. Talk shit. No, no, no. You're not anytime soon, No, are you? gosh, no, I can't afford You've it. You've got to sort your, sort your floors out first. Got to sort, sort my decorating out, the kitchen out, the bathrooms out, everything out, really. There we go. So that's my last piece sewn now. Yeah. And then I can create the arc. Right, lots of you got this in your basket now. I mean, I understand you want to see more, more sewing done, but I'm just warning you, you're fine at the moment. You're fine at the moment-ish, but I, I, I know you want to see this circle in and then how to put the circle in the middle. I understand all that. Um, Susan, it's my 75th birthday day and I love watching Sewing Street on this dull and drizzly day. Susan, happy birthday. You don't look a day over, what, 60? So oh. that's... Uh, oh, and hang on. Uh, Delphine, the penalty will purely be financial. Local authorities cannot add penalty pots to your driving licence. From Christine. Oh, I hope so. I hope so. Christine's a dinner lady. No, not dinner lady, isn't she? Is it the same Christine who's... um? What's this? Lollipop lady. How do you know that? I went like that. She went lollipop lady. Yes, I did something yesterday and I went like this. And Hannah knew exactly what I meant. It was nothing cathedral windows I went like that oh it'll make a lovely it's like cathedral windows so I was like yep so we're sadly sadly in tune except we were out of tune about something else yesterday oh yeah <laughs> right, yeah, yeah you were watching yeah. yesterday right we came to a very abrupt end of the show because I was busy chatting about what hobby maker doing and Hannah said something about it said say goodbye and I went bye like that and we just went we had four minutes to go and she meant do your normal goodbye, but she said it in such an aggressive way. I just went, oh, bye! Like that, we suddenly just went off air. Anyway, so it's I'm fine. Just sewing me the eight hearts <sighs> together now. Lovely. As better you explained to Becky, we're only a bit late. Huh? Okay. Oh, no, no, it's fine. It's because Becky's supposed to be on at 10, so we're just telling her that she'll be a bit late coming on, that's all. I've done the tricky bit, so it comes together quite yeah, quick yeah. now. I'm not rushing you, but you've got about five minutes. <laughs> All right, true. Look, it's ten penny for whatever time it is. Will you be able to help me with a bit of pressing? Oh, come on then. I do ruin things when I press them, just so you know. If I'll give you the hose. I'm going to shuffle out. I'll shuffle out. So, yeah, so you don't have to watch me do it. Yeah. Oh, let me... In your own time. There we go. Thank you, John. Do I have to rip the paper off between them before I press it? Yes, no, John. Yes, John. Remember, this quilt should be £299. Hannah took £30 off. It's limited. We're not getting any more after these have gone. So I'll just do a half arc and then you can see. Okay, what do you need, sorry? I'll have that one, please. Oh, want that one? Thank you. I'm not going fast enough for you. Oh, <clears throat> only 12 left once you've all checked out. Oh, sorry, you wait for me. Yeah, but it's good. You're very, you know, very precise. You, you know, well, no, attention to detail. Just, I can't ruin a Delphine Brooks slash Tula pink quilt, can I? <laughs> so, there we go. Lovely. Oh yeah, that'd be good. Bruce is going to do a bit of CGI in the break and he's going to make that, that owl behind Delphine's head fly. And as it flies, it'll pick her up and t remove her from the studio. Oh, I'll see get out. Yeah, it could be like Peter Pan, you could go through the window. <laughs> right, there you go. Have there more? And uh, uh, those two, I've just done those. Thank you, John. Oh, hang on, I'm confused. Hello, love. Oh, well, that bit's <laughs> just come off there. No, no, I've got it. Oh, pfft. Oh, it doesn't matter at this stage if bits of paper fall off. Yeah. It doesn't matter. 
Right, now I'll sew my quarters together. Oh. Right, there you go. There we go. So once you get your, your, your segments, you're going to put, piece them together in your threes. And then you're going to make four quarters. And then you'll make your two halves just like before. So I don't know if we'll have an awful lot of time. So I really want to show you how to do the circle. No, 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 that's right. There you go. There's that one. Oh. That's that one. So I don't have time to press these. But there we go. Thank you, John. Okay. There you go then. If I sh so that's a half already. And then it's another quarter. So you give me a job, it shuts me up because I can't talk and <laughs> work at the same time. There we go. So we'll just show you with that and then I can show you the quarter. Okay. So yeah, so you'll make your, make your segments, make four quarters and then your two halves. So we've got a half here, so let me just lay this out, it's going to look stunning. Really oh wow, look, <coughs> that's just the centre, that's just the centre, right. So just very quickly then, so yeah. you're, you've got to think of it as back to your four quarters, your north, east, south, west, yeah. right sides together. Mm -hmm. So you'll find your point from your fabric D point. Yeah. And what you'll do, uh, imagine I've already marked all this out. This is where you really have to take your time. You'd already yeah. mark your points out. You'd put, you'd go right sides together. I'll, d I'll just do this very, very quickly. Yeah, yeah. And you would do, this, this looks more complicated than it is. If you've ever put a foot pad in a toy, it's the same principle. Oh, okay, okay. And then you fold it back, and then you put your other pin right sides together. Around there, yeah, oh yeah, so, yeah. So it's just literally like putting a foot pad in a toy. And yeah. If, if you can do that, which is really easy, yeah. all you've got to do is make sure you pin a lot, that's all. Yeah. And then you do the exact same, to here so yeah. you first always do north south four, east west and then everything else in between and it will all fit make sure you use plenty of pins yeah but do each bit evenly so do your four points then do your quarter points the quarter points yeah. and then everything else in between and then you sew it right sides yeah. together and then give quarter it a good inch press. Seam, and then you press towards the circle because it will na it will naturally, naturally want go to that go way, that yeah. way and you do exact same on here yeah you'll go in between the i and the j points that match into the triangles yeah and by matching those that all the yeah it will work and if they don't match you've done something wrong along the way so take it off and just double check but because it's fpp it will be match perfect you know exactly because you have you haven't been able to slip and wait at piecing sometimes you can go a little bit bigger a little bit smaller than quarter inch yeah. on this because you stitch on the line it's precise it, isn't it it's so precise. It's really really precise brilliant so, right delphine that was fantastic right this is the kit now i've only got 12 left i've only got 12 of these left we cannot get any more say that again we've only done the center we've only done that bit there can you imagine how how it's going to look with all of that and if you can come in close look in the in the center of each of these triangles look there's a butterfly in the center of each of those triangles how beautiful is that so in the kit you get 13 and a half yards or 12.3 meters of all this beautiful tulip pink fabric uh, you get loads of look you see there that's how big those triangles are going to be look because each one has got one of those butterflies in it. And you know, you've got enough fabric in there. You've got two planes in there. You've got a lovely silver gray and you've got a jade. You've got all your other tulip pink fabric there. You've got all of your templates for your FPP. And you've got your templates for these bits here, which are your piecing bits there. And a book 
with your instructions there. All of that for 216, it should be 299.99. Now, even Tula, you can get to a Facebook page. You can look at Tula saying, this is limited. I am not making any more of these. When they're all sold, that's it. It's going to be a li So really, if you think about it, you're going to be one of, I don't know how many she made, but it's going, you're going to be one of a certain amount of people who've, who own this. Then that is it. That is it. She will never, ever, ever do it again. We were lucky enough because we have a good uh, 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 relationship with, uh, with Tula and with Free Spirit to be able to get the amount that we got, right? Some people, some shops would be given one or two. I bet you any money, if you look at it elsewhere, I bet they've only got one or two of them. We are down to 12 now. Was it 12, did you say? When you've all, oh, nine. Nine now, that's it. At uh, quarter past 10 on Thursday morning, there are nine left now. Nine of those left. I'll remind you about it. When Delphine comes back on later, I'll remind you about it and do a, a thing. Because we've got to move on. Because you know it's Crafters Companion. Oh, thank you, Delphine, by the way. Oh, no worries. I'll <laughs> see you in an hour to do your owls and your... And foxes. And foxes. There's no yeah. giraffes today. I kept saying giraffe in prep. Oh, do the giraffe one in the blue. We've not got giraffes. Uh, in, in four minutes' time, Becky's here, finishing off what we did yesterday. We've got deals. We've got deals because it's the Gemini. It's, no, no, the Crafter's Companion, 17th birthday. So we've got special deals. We've got a competition. We've got all sorts coming up. Uh, and we've got the, the things that sold out yesterday. We've been in touch with Sarah. She's not giving us too many, but we've got more things back in stock than we, we sold out of yesterday. So uh, I'll see you back here in four minutes from now. Surprise! Well, knock me down with a feather. Crafter's Companion is turning a sensational 17. And boy, do we have a celebration for you. We are bringing the Razzle Dazzle and putting on the Ritz for a fabulous and very flamboyant affair. And of course, you're all invited. From the 18th of October, we're going to be shining the spotlight on a glittering array of spectacular new launches. Some amazing offers so many show-stopping surprises. Are you a fan of Sewing Street? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your mates, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing community. See you there! If you're a Sewing Street customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Follow Sewing Street on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media. And pick up some top tips from us too. Miss the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. Head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope and you're done. Never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done.
You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals, and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one PNP all day. Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. Are you a fan of Sewing Street? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your mates, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing community. See you there! If you're a Sewing Street customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Follow Sewing Street on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media. And pick up some top tips from us too. Miss the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Now, don't worry. I know it's 20 past. Becky will get her full hour. Don't worry. Don't worry. Everyone's getting their full hour today. I know we're running a little bit late, but you will get your full hour of it and everything. Now, before I do anything, say hello to Becky. Hello. Hello, everybody. Looking back very again. refreshed today. I, I did have a, a very long sleep, actually, Good. when I got back to the hotel. So. After you've been out boozing all night. I didn't go out boozing. I just went out for a very civilised meal last With night. With red wine? No, I didn't have any wine. No drinks at all. Yeah. Oh, yeah. what's true. happened to the Chiswick girl? No, true professional. I've got work today. Okay, I can't drink fine. on a school night. Uh, yeah, because I'm lying. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, before we go, we go to the demo, I need to tell you about a few things. First of all, if you buy anything, because it's 17th birthday, if you buy anything from uh, there's this week from Crafters Companion, that's Gemini, Threaders, all that sort of stuff, your name goes into a competition. And on Tuesday, I'll be announcing the winner. There's one winner, and one of you will win... £500 worth of goodies. £500 worth of goodies, right? You will get, uh, one of you will win that by just buying something. You have to do, put in a password, you have to do a code, you don't have to answer a question. Just buy something from Crafters Companion this week and somebody will win that on Tuesday. Right, this, we had this deal yesterday. Let me just move that out of the way. We had this deal yesterday. We weren't meant to have it, Hannah stole it. <laughs> she pinched it from another... I yeah, know, she's been told. She's been told. You pinched that one. Anyway, we've got more. We messaged Sarah last night, or Sarah's team last night, because we sold out of these yesterday and we've got them in again. Now, if you buy these separately, they're normally £99.99 £99 each, right? We've got a special price. If you're just going to buy the plus on its own in a minute... But, but this is if you've already got so if you've already got the, 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 the this one, then you can get a special price on this. But if you've not got either of them... This is the biggest saving, 149.99, because you think they're 99.99 each on a normal day. So that's that, first of all. You're wondering what they are. Well, in this one, you get squares, they're dies, right? You get squares, you get half square triangles, and you get quarter square triangles. That's your builder block regular. And then your builder block plus, 
you've got oblongs, you've got isosceles triangles, and you've got half rectangle triangles in all of these sizes, four, six, eight, nine, and 12. And then the square is your three, four, six, eight, nine, and 12 sizes, right? 149, 99. Look at all these blocks you can make. That's not all of them. That's one, that's from the plus, is it, that one? Yeah. That's the plus one, but you're using some of those we just checked. Some of those have got squares from the uh, from the straightforward one as well. But if you look on the side of the box here, I can show you the side of the box. Here, mm -hmm. here you go. This isn't all of both boxes, both boxes, both boxes. This isn't all of them. This isn't all of them. You go to the Crafters Companion website, you will see loads and loads more of blocks. These are just the ones that we got in the books in here. And for a right, this is it now. If you missed out on it yesterday, right, we cannot get any more at this moment in time. This is all we've been given from Sarah at Crafters Companion or Sarah's team at Crafters Companion. This is it now. We weren't supposed to have them, but because we sold out yesterday, we said, we've got Becky on, we need more, we need more, we need, so we got more, right? That's the best way if you've not got any of them. You will need the Gemini cutting machine, obviously, because these are dies. But 149.99, three split payments of 49.99, be paid for by Christmas. Only 67 sleeps till Christmas. Right, on its own, now I haven't got this one on its own today, but I have got this one on its own. This is the one that the cushion that Beck is making. Now you see, normal price. 99.99 because it's the 17th birthday we've got a special deal for you but that just shows they're normally 99.99 79.99 so if you've already got the this one and you just want this one the plus which has got the isosceles triangles the rectangles and the half rectangle triangles 79.99 i know that's only till midnight remember that's only till midnight and again, so look, you can see there, they're all the, the shapes that you get. These are the blocks that you can make. These are some of the, oh, that's just one of the ideas there. You can't make the teacup, I don't know, that texture. That's from Ikea. <laughs> anyway, 79.99, or other shops like that. Now you can make the blocks in four inch, six inch, eight inch, nine inch, and 12 inch. Look, I'll just take, show you, because it's so brilliantly designed. There's the box, right, with three little drawers in it. There's your instructions book. And if you look in here, any block that it, it tells you about, it tells you what you cut, how many you cut, and how to put them together. And then in here, as you see here, you've got your uh, rectangles, half rectangle triangles, and isosceles triangle. Pull the drawer out. Inside there, this is your little uh, map to show you what sizes you've got in there. And then when you open this one up, there are your actual dies. Oh, I've been using this one this morning. That... There you go. There you go. I've been that, that's the one I was using at 8 o'clock this morning. That one in there. So $79.99 will get you all of those in the Builder Block Plus. Right, so you can either... This one here is your bundle, 149.99 for two, uh, the, the, the regular and the plus. This one here is just for the plus. Right, now uh, this next bundle is one, that I've got this next bundle, I have got this one, right? So we've got this bundle where you can buy, this has not been on air for the birthday yet because I asked for this one specially. Right, so you can get the builder block regular, which is your squares, your half square triangles and your quarter square triangles in all of those different sizes, plus the alphabet, plus the alphabet. You pass me a pair of scissors. I've got some scissors for oh, you. Can I, right, can I cut paper with them? Or you, the, the yeah, you can, you can cut anything with those scissors. Okay, fine. Just so I can get, I, want to show, I just wanted to show you inside this box, that was all beautifully packaged oh hang on where's the look look how much 35 pounds you're saving it would say so but the graphics have got too many words in them look saving 35 pounds here we go so this box here you can do letters six eight six inches eight inches nine inches ten inches and 12 inches how does that work do you say well i'll show you Oh, hang on, there we go, that comes off there like that. Again, these can sit on your shelf like this, look. Look, there's the, there's the. Right, build a block, there's your instructions. Here are all the shapes that you will need 
to make all of your letters. They're brilliant, they're brilliant. And they're, they're nice big bold shapes. So you're making a kitty quilt with their name on or numbers or anything like that. You've got extra, you've got extra as well, look, because you've got, oh, I've gone into, I've gone into Spanish again. <laughs> I'm always ahead of myself, look, there we go. So we've got numbers, you've got numbers there, then you've got uh, cross star, hearts, corner flowers, postage stamps, home sweet home, lovable bear, forest tree, flower star. I think that's it. Yeah, and then you go into the, the numbers in a different language. But look, that's what you can make. And more, and more, and more. Obviously, it's beautiful, isn't it? So you get the builder block basic, which is squares, half square triangles, and quarter square triangles, plus the alphabet for 134.99. You're saving 35 pounds. You're very welcome. First time we've done that bundle. And again, the letters you can do from six inch to 12 inch. There you go. And I've got both of these. I've got both of these. 134.99. Uh, two split payments of 67.49. I, I tell you, you'll realize that you use the letter, once you've got the letters and the numbers, you'll realize how often you're gonna use them because they're so, so versatile. You can use them in so many different ways and you get the extra blocks in there as well. And again, you can do a six, eight, nine, 10 and 12 inches versions. Oh no, brilliant. Right, to do all of that, you'll need the Gemini machine. So, I'll give you those back. Thank you. The Gemini machine offer we've got at the moment is the Gemini machine, which comes with, automatically, comes with your two, I showed you this at eight o'clock, I did cutting at eight o'clock. You get your two pl uh, outer plates, you get your metal plate, you get your shim, you get your magnetic one for paper and you get your embossing one as well. Now, this should be 260 396. No, that's not right. Yes, I remembered. Two. What did I say? 23696 is what it should be. 23696. But look, you, hang on, before you do that, let's have a look at this because you need to see all the freebies you get with it as well. There you go, so you get all of these freebies. You get the, the, the ribbon um, swirly ones, you get the pineapple, and you get, I always call this kaleidoscope, it's called Catherine Wheel. You get all of those, plus you get some embossing tools as well. Look, there you go. All of that comes with it, 179.99. Now, 179.99 is how much you pay for the machine and the plates on their own normally. But you get this as a whole bundle. Saving, how much was it, over 50, was it over 50 pounds? Saving over 50 pounds. Yeah, and I wasn't too sure then. 179.99. It's more than that, isn't it? At 230, oh, hang on. Yeah, yeah. So there's your deal, there's your deal, there's your deal. I know. So you need a Gemini cutter, obviously, to use the Gemini. Now, you don't have to use just fabric for this. Use paper, leather, felt. It's a multi-purpose die cutting machine, Absolutely. isn't it? And embosser, and embosser. So you can emboss leather, you can emboss faux leather, you can emboss papers, you can do all sorts of things like that. So it's not, don't think, oh, well, I don't do that much fabric cutting. If you, if you watch at Hobby Make all the time, you do, they use them all the time on there. You can cut your papers, everything. All those little dies with the little flowers mm. and everything. You, you get your pokey tool and push them out and everything. 179.99. There it is, the Gemini by Craft Companion. And remember, by buying that, your name will then go into the virtual hat to win one of you will win in a chance to win the gift of over 500 pounds. Oh, that's busy, isn't it? It's very busy. So, what are you, so yesterday, on yesterday's show, yeah. you did two blocks from the Builder Block Plus. Yes, yeah, so that's right. So we're, and, we're yeah. working our way through all the Builder Blocks over the next however many months yes. it takes. And so I'll do, I'll do a little project over two days, but this particular one, um, because I'm here yesterday and today, and um, we're doing it over exactly two days. Brilliant. So we did two of the blocks. So we did, um, which one did we do? We did these two at the bottom. So we did the honeycomb, and we also did the um, mill, mill, mill block. block, mill, mill block. block. 
Um, so the Millblock block, block. Mill block, block, that's right. So we're going to do the Ninja Star and the London Stairs now. And then I'm going to um, show you how to do the sashing. And we also go at the back, I've put a little, um, a little piece of fabric here to hide my zip. Um, but I've used one of our zips on a roll on here. Which we've so got, got coming up on today's well. show as well. Yeah, exactly. So They're it, all on the website now. If you want to start checking out on them now, obviously. So if you've never seen um, the Gemini, I'll do a, a quick recap yeah, 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 to show yeah. you how it works. Um, as John said, um, you know, it comes in this great packaging, so everything's all sort of secure, um, and you're not going to lose anything. Now, you're going to find that if you invest your money in the Builder Block system, it's going to cut down the time that you spend doing patchwork hugely i mean massive difference and it's going to mean that everything's cut um exactly the right size you're not going to have the situation where things you know you've just sort of gone off at a funny angle with your rotary cutter at the very end uh, you can't cut through multiple layers of fabric you can maybe do two with your rotary cutter yeah, yeah. you can't do you can do eight sometimes ten if but you also can. it also it's actually drop but it also helps with your sewing as well because your seam allowances and everything all match up so perfectly yeah. that you haven't got that worry about it. it's just all done for you it isn't does it? it makes it really really yeah. easy and I think it opens up um, different designs that perhaps in the past people may be reluctant to do particularly when we go to when we start doing next week next week yeah next week um, we're going to be doing build a block with curves we're going to be Rob Peter to pay Paul right so obviously then you know that really come you really see the huge amount of value there is in using a die cutting mm -hmm. machine um, and then you're going to have um, your um, your little booklet as John says and it in this is really invaluable because you will find that there are so many different designs in here now some of the designs that we've got in the booklet will say requires the original build block system to use um, because I'll use a shapes that are only available in the, the original builder block yep. but there's so many other things you could do with Look at that anyway. message there. Hi John and Becky, got the Gemini machine and the builder block dies. I'm making a star quilt and like 2,000 wow. 200 squares and triangles much quicker and easier from Anne in Gloucestershire oh looking Thank forward you. to seeing that what yeah. a chance Dan yeah have to send us a picture of that yeah it does it, it makes it so much easier yeah. and I, I start, I've started doing quilts that, but whereas before I'd go oh, I'm not doing that, no, that cut, that's going to take me six months to cut the, those yeah. pieces out and now I'm like thinking well I've run them through the machine I'm done in an hour um, so it makes it nice and easy so we've got all the inf information you could possibly need here and it tells you the different sizes of the dies to use in order to make different blocks now whilst we say you can make multiple different sizes of blocks you won't be able to make all of the blocks in all of the sizes so just bear that in mind because some of them won't quite work oh, okay, out okay. so for example if you're doing the faceted jewel you could do that in a 12 inch or an 8 inch but you can't do it in any of the other sizes Fine, okay but so we've, just we've read it, it yes yeah, we've written it, it all down yeah. there so i've already pre-cut some of my fabric um, but i do need to cut um some more now i'm using um my fabric plates which come which are separate from okay the now fishing. we'll just check because they were the early birds this morning and they sold out yeah we've got four sets of these left right <clears throat> you get two plates now why should people invest in these because if you're, <coughs> if you're going to invest in the builder block system you're going you're you you're inevitably going to be doing a lot of cutting out yeah. of your fabric and um, now these are much sturdier than the plastic uh, than the metal shim you that's get. a normal yeah one. this is a normal shim so it's very it's quite flexible and you can see it's got a lot of markings on it where we've used um the through the machine that comes with the machine when it you does. buy it you have to buy that separately and you can absolutely use it for <coughs> some fabric it's just that these are sturdier now the dies that we've got here are our multimedia dies there are the copper colored dies they are thicker than paper craft dies to enable them to cut through multiple layers of fabric. And that is the reason why uh, we suggest that you use the, the metal fabric plates because they're not gonna warp, well, not, not warp they're not gonna mark <coughs> so much. Now these ones I've had for, how long have I been working for Crafters Companion? Oh, um, long time. Over a year, yeah. over a year. I use these every day, mo no, multiple times a yes. day because obviously this is what I'm doing. Um, so you can see there's, I mean, I've got, look, they're, they're a bit filthy where I've got tape on them, but they are, they've got marks on them, but nothing like they would have done had I been using just that normal metal yes. plate. But you can use it and it's, and it's absolutely fine if you're not able to get hold of these yet. But I would definitely say if you're going to invest your money in the Builder Block system, it's definitely worth getting those as okay, well. Okay, Chris, when you use yours that you buy, you only get one metal plate. Oh, they've sold out, they've, these they've have sold gone. out. Okay. But, so basically, like I showed you earlier you make your sandwich with the two plates the shim the metal your fabric and the die you only have one piece of metal you can use this even when it's all might you should see I should bring mine in one day they're, they're like this they're really gnarled man but they still work right so you only use one piece of metal when you use these plates you use two pieces of metal but you don't need the shim 
That's exactly right. Yeah. Now what I'm going to do is I've just folded my fabric over and I know somebody messaged in and said, oh, you know, it looks like you're wasting a lot of fabric. Um, you, you actually waste less using the Gemini than you would do if you're using your rotary cutter. Because obviously when you're, when you're doing so a triangle, for example, you're going to go over here when you're cutting you no know, that because you've just you've just got to cut over to get yeah. that little that little point and so i'm just lining everything up and i'm going to use some low tack tape um, to take this in place so i'm actually just cutting some shapes to finish off both of the blocks that we're doing now um, so i need to do some of these triangles now um, if i was going to be um, you could probably use some of those other half rectangle um, triangles in these little spaces here to really sort of make it well worth Yeah, your, if you've got a big up. piece of fabric, you can yeah. put the whole piece of fabric in and put all the different shapes yeah. all over it, can't yeah, you? Yeah, exactly. So I've got four layers of fabric there and then I'm going to do um, four here and I'm going to do those four there. So I'm going to do eight on this oh. piece here. Oh. I'm going to throw it on the floor because yeah. you need to do that when you're you're yeah. working and <laughs> um, just line that up there and then run it through my machine and um, now if you were go you don't have the fabric plates and you're just using your um, plates that you come with your Gemini you will use the clear plates because the clear plates are like the bread in the yeah. sandwich um, you would use your metal shim so you want your metal shim and you want your dies facing down so you want the metal going cutting into metal effectively so it's almost like a pair of scissors you, that, that, the, the, the cutting of the metal goes yeah. in there so we've got the die facing down on the fabric or you'd have your metal plate and then over the top you put your um, that frosted plastic shim and then you put that clear plate over the top but because I'm using my fabric plates I'm just going to put my sandwich everything between those metal plates question here question here. question yeah for me for me for me yeah. if I obviously when you've just got the one sheet in yeah. you have to have them pointing down towards the metal sheet if I get one the wrong way up with this one because you've got metal above will it still cut or do you always need to make sure they're always facing down do you know what um it doesn't really matter because right. they're metal pieces Both but sides, I yeah. think it's easier for you to have your fabric and then lay your die over the top to see exactly where you're yeah. fitting. Oh, of course, especially yeah, because it wouldn't work because the fabric's underneath it, yeah, of course. Especially yeah, especially if you're doing any sort of fussy cutting because yeah. obviously these are perfect because mm. you can get everything completely lined up. You could cut multiple layers of your fabric um, and tape each one down so you're, you and then pop your, yes, your, course, your die yeah. there and you're getting a, a perfect cut Lovely. every single time. So I'm just going to run that through the Gemini. Right. I'll just come over to your you side. You come over to mine, it's all ready to go. So you just um, pop that through the machine and it may make um, some crackling noise, it may make a bang as it goes over that die, it's all totally normal. Now if you, you don't be afraid, no, you no. made that noise, it's absolutely fine. Do you know what that is? Can I just explain to well, when you've got a straight line, oh hang on, let me move into shop. If you've got a straight line, it'll make that noise. Now, Sarah taught me when I worked with her that if you put it slightly on an angle like that, not the fabric, you keep the fabric straight to grain and everything, but you put the die on a slight of an angle like that, it won't make so much yeah. noise because it's going over a point rather than a whole line sort of thing. And that's just one little thing. And I can never remember that because as far as I'm concerned, I'm line up, I am line it up on the yes. thing, but you're absolutely right. If you put it yeah. at an angle, it works much better. And actually in the bundle that we've got with the Gemini, that big um, Hawaiian applique die is a really big die. Um, and you can imagine as it goes over the top, if you have got that all lined up inside on your Gemini plate, yeah. it would make a really large bang. Yes, So exactly. definitely that is well, one that's well worth putting it at an angle. Brilliant. So I've run that, run that through the machine. So I just take the tape off and I've got my perfectly cut eight layers of fabric there and my perfectly cut four layers of fabric there. Brilliant. Um, so you can see how quick it is. I think it's 19 seconds for it to go through the, yeah. the machine. Um, now, um, where I've got my waist here, obviously here, with, these are the, the little rectangles, hardly any waist at all. Um, here on my larger one, I would end up using these other pieces for other triangles. Yeah. Um, so you can definitely um, make it worth your while. Um, you know, you're not going to end up wasting fabric. It's definitely mm -hmm. going to be the way to keep it all uh, going together nicely. Now, I'm just going to find where I've put all my pieces of fabric. Um, so what I'm going to do, um, first of all, I'm, I'll start doing the London stairs first, I think. Um, so this one is a really, really simple um, design. So you just have rectangles on this particular one. Um, now if I find, oh, you've got the little book. Oh, sorry, I was just looking for it up for you. So London stairs, there it all is. We, all we're doing is we're sewing these two rectangles together. And then the next one will be sewn exactly the same way, but we will just put it horizontally. And then you have this kind of zigzag effect here and this looks super effective on a really large quilt yeah um, so this one we're going to start stitching through and then i'm going to go on and do the ninja star which is the one at the front here 
which is just made out of isosceles triangles and half rectangle um, triangles as well. So it looks really effective. Uh -huh. um, but again, John, I've bought um, the all those little sheet little designs. So I can just give those to you so you can flick through while yep. I start sewing. Of course. So these are the ones for the Builder Block Plus. Yep. But right. I've also got them for the Builder Block Original as well if people want to have a look okay, at those. Okay, brilliant. Two. So I'll, I'll show you these as we're. Um, so the bundle here, this $149.99 is the bundle where you buy the box of Builder Block Regular and Builder Block Plus for $149.99. They both sell for $99.99 normally. <clears throat> so you say making a really good saving there. And then that one there is to buy the machine to do the cutting with. So these are all the shapes that you could do from the plus, right? Because you've got the rectangles on the plus. Look at this one here. They're so effective, aren't they? Aren't they? Then you've got your, your isosceles triangles there. Then you've got, your, now is this London, what's it that we're doing now? Yeah, that's London Steps. Yep. Yeah. And you've got more isosceles like triangles work, there. Doesn't it? It looks like, um, you know, um, if you've got sort of nice ornamental brickwork. Yeah. That one's in several colourways. That one, I think someone liked the London Steps. Then you've got a ladder one there. Then also in the block, uh, build the plus, you get the half rectangle triangles to create that one. And again, that one there, just by putting them in a different order, create different, look at this one. Now, imagine if you were cutting all of those to piece that. It, the machine will just cut all of those perfectly for you. And there was always that margin of error, isn't there, when you're yep. cutting them by, by hand? Totally. There's your half rectangle triangles again. Pinwheel. It's lovely, like a Harlequin pattern there. It's just the way you place, and all the different sizes as well, just the way you place everything, you can create all the, oh, here we go. We're doing one of these in a minute. We're gonna do one though. That's what we're doing in a minute, yeah, isn't it that is, one? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Then look, this one, you can make kites. Let's go fly a kite. Ladder. Let's see if I've got any more. I didn't bits. know you sang, John. I, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I do notes, but not necessarily in the right order. <laughs> Beautiful. I love musicals, though. Do you? Yeah. What's your favourite musical? Wicked. Oh, yeah. At the moment, anyway. And then the other night, they had... Um, the Les Miserables 25th anniversary oh, okay. thing on, like the concert version with Alfie Bow. Uh, and it was brilliant, it was just brilliant. And then they brought on the cast of 1985 and my friend Aileen was in the original cast. And it was so funny, there were all these famous people like Michael Ball and all that, everyone, Aileen was there like this at the front of the stage. <laughs> that, she was only playing uh, one of the ladies of the night and everything, but she was there in the front <laughs> of the stage. It's a bit like the one they did for um, Phantom where they brought everyone back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I love, I mean, I love all of them. They all have their different, um, so when I was at, at Wimbledon School of Art, every morning, because I had to do a lot of walking where I lived, I used to have cats on in my, on my Sony Walkman it was in those days, wasn't it? <laughs> Little cassette and your battery, oh, that's nice. And your batteries would run out. And stretch the tape. What? They'd stretch the tape, And you it? stretch yeah. the tape, yeah, exactly. With a bundle, only, what we've got today, that's it, we've got no more. And back in stock because it sold out yesterday. We had to ring Sarah's people last night to get, um, what is that? Sarah's people last night to get more of those for you. But what we've got is that's it now, that's it. I remember you'll be entered into the draw to win, one of you will win 500 pounds worth of goodies. I'll be announcing that on Tuesday's show. So I've already stitched, I've stitched, I've started doing this. So I've done um, those little triangles and I've stitched the two triangles together there. Yeah. Triangles, they're not triangles, they're, they're rectangles. They're rectangles, those. Gosh, I don't know my, I don't know my shapes. I'm like a small child. No. Um, then we've got um, the, uh, the rest of these. I'm going to sew those together and then that's going to make that block. So that comes together really, really quickly. Yeah. And so I'll just go ahead and carry on doing that. Right. Do and then I'll stop doing that one in a moment. Um, and I also brought with me, John, all, all oh, the Build yes. Block original um, samples down here Oh, in there, well. I'll get those out so for you in a second. they're in there as well. Um, unfortunately, I didn't have any of the alphabet ones in my car. Oh, don't worry. Uh, Sussex Seamstress, who we all know is a dressmaker and dressmaking pattern. In fact, I think Adele's doing some of her things on Saturday. She's, she said, uh, what a fabulous product. I'd love one in my stocking this Christmas. Blimey. <laughs> Big stockings, Jane. <laughs> 
I'm like, you're looking svelte today. I thought I looked fat today. It's funny, isn't it? Right, which box am I going into? In this that, one. In this box here. So that actually is one of the uh, samples made with the squares and the half square triangles. Oh, there you go. So if, you do, if you've got the bundle, that side, and you're buying builder block, no, uh, both of them, the regular and the pro, the regular one has squares, half square triangles, and quarter square triangles. That's what this one's made out of. And then I've got more here. The whole quilt here. And that's got a different blocks all the way through. So oh, has it? Hang on, there you one, go. A little bit like, you no, know, sort of doing a blocker, block a day kind no, of yeah, thing. sample quilt Everything, or something, yeah. yeah. Are they all made from the, the, I don't want to call it the basic, but the first one. The first one, yeah. All yeah. of those are made from the first one. The builder block, yeah. The yeah, builder the builder block. block original. Right, and then original, that's the right word. That's the word I was looking for. They look at all these. All these that you know you'd normally have to be cutting out or whatever. Look at this one. That's so effective, that one, isn't it? Isn't it just? I wouldn't oh. even bother attempting that no. if I couldn't cut it out and not have to think about it. I keep holding them in the wrong place. I? Hold it up. Hold it to you. There you go. They look so intricate, don't they? But they're just using half square triangles, squares, or quarter square triangles. Look at this one. Now, as it's our 17th birthday, I was thinking, do you remember what you did for your 17th birthday? I was trying to remember what I did for my 17th birthday, and I think I was in a strop because I wanted to have a driving lesson, and it was my aunt's 60th birthday. On the um, same day. On the same day, and um, I wasn't very happy. I what? think that's what most people do for their 17th. Okay, don't they? 17th, no, I didn't. No? I'd have been uh, at the end of my lower sixth, I'd have been, because it's June, mine. Yeah, yeah, because oh, we're, we're the round about the same time, aren't we? I'm the 20th of June. Of June, yeah, yeah. not the same year, obviously. <laughs> um, I'm much younger than she is. <laughs> Cheeky, I don't know. Well, hang on, I, uh, 1977, I was 17, in 1977. Yeah, I was two, John. All right, thanks. You know, she said she was coming back every Wednesday, which might not be now. Um, I don't know what I did for my 17th. I know what I did for my 18th birthday. I was working at Browns of Chester as Mr. Caribbean Connection on my 18th birthday. <laughs> and my mum worked at Browns of Chester and she came down the stairs. She went, what's all the fuss? What's all the fuss? And they said, we're just celebrating John's 18th birthday. And she went, oh, yeah, I'll I, I just get your card. And she went oh, running off, right? She'd forgotten? Yes. <gasps> anyway. Do you know, what, um, a few years ago, I had a phone call from my mum on my birthday and I was out with some friends. And um, I, I was like, hi, thinking she'd phoned me to say happy, happy birthday. birthday. And she had she had phoned me just to tell me some random facts. And I went, do you remember what day it is today, mum? She was like, no. I said, it's my birthday. She's, I've, I've never let, let her forget it. Oh. Um, she was mortified. So I'll bring it up as often as I oh, can. Yeah, of course you do. Mum, yeah. if you're watching, I've just brought it up again. Yes. <laughs> But, you know, it's, um, I, I, think, I, I always think um, it's only really yourself and your, your parents really oh, that yes. celebrate your birthday, isn't yeah. it? And your, your partner. No, no, Hannah expects presents from everybody on oh, her really? birthday, yes. Expensive ones. When's Bruce's birthday? January. Oh, June. June. <laughs> That's why you have named, because we thought it was January. <laughs> June the what? 22nd. 22nd. Oh, okay. Six, 26. So he's the 26th. You're yeah. the 20th. I'm yeah. the 19th. And um, Craig and Debbie, uh, Crafter's Companion, the 21st. No. So um, Obviously, we're very creative types then. When's yours, Hannah? 8th July. Just a bit a bit out of the... More creative, <laughs> yeah. You're, you're and left-handed, you see. So you've got it both. You've got double whammy. Oh, Bruce is left-handed as well. Oh, so okay. is Kat. Oh, surrounded by them. I don't think they used to exist sort of um, 50 years ago because if you were left-handed, you were forced to write with your right yeah, hand. Yeah, oh yes, you? or use right-handed scissors yeah. or something, yeah. Simple nine patch, get it exactly right. That's pretty. Uh, this is the same as the background on, you know, when you do your, your statuses on Facebook page, you can choose the background. There's one of these like this in purple. <laughs> That's weird. I know that, isn't it? <laughs> that is sad. really weird. Oh, I'm just okay. sad. 
so my phone's been fixed everybody by the way you'll be pleased to know so i can oh don't oh no it hasn't it hasn't let reloads any of hannah's messages surprise surprise oh no there were haley's no no there were haley's that we that were spread to both of us only hannah got them oh look you see look you can do really look, imagine cornerstones doing perfect cornerstones with this beautiful you're right over there yeah I, was just, I just had a few floor. things on the floor I've managed you to mean I dropped a few things on no, the floor no I, I think I dropped them actually okay. I'll, I'll take the hit for that all right then. um there's so many there's so many you can see that I'm waking everyone up and that's the thing you know it's um it it will open up a, an opportunity for you to be a little bit more creative yes and i think we all get with anything um you know any if you're creative even like cooking we tend to do the same thing over and over again you get a little bit lackadaisical don't you i leave my cooking to marks and spencers <laughs> <laughs> um, but i just think you know it, this means that you can start trying something that perhaps you've not done before yes, exactly um look at a, no find a, a project online that you you think oh gosh I've, I've always wanted to do that but i don't want to cut two and a half thousand tiny triangles like that that lady that messaged in yes um, but, exactly you know, that makes a big difference right uh stock warning stock warning stock warning we'll always have the gemini machine we'll always have the gemini machine but this bundle this bundle we got for the 17th birthday we've got less than 20 left now you don't get this box obviously it's because you, otherwise you'd end up getting that horrible old man kill cushion behind it wouldn't you this is just cat doing a bit the window display right so what you do get is you get the machine you get all the plates that you normally get with it so you get your metal cutting plate you get your two bread to your sandwich you get your piccalilli yeah and then these that's a magnetic one for paper and that's an embossing mat there you get all of that anyway with the gemini machine but with this one as a free gift you get the curly uh, ribbon one you get the um, Catherine wheel designed by Karen Lewis and you get that lovely big Hawaiian man she make one of those lovely cushions with that all of that if I can show you the still because there's something else oh and you get the embossers you get the embossers as well would normally uh, you'd pay 179 pounds just for the machine on its own all those goodies extra 50 pounds worth of goodies in there 236 pounds and 96 pence and with the Karen Lewis builder block that we've got on there, yes. it actually, not only will it show you how to make the block, it will show you how to make those three different projects in there as Which well. Which is a bag, a wall hanging and a quilt. Okay, go on, message to Barbara. Let's have a look, see if we can do it. Uh, so, are you all Geminis? Yes, yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah. You're not, are you, Hannah? No, 21st 20, 20 is cut off, or 22nd yes, 20, is cut 21st, second, yeah, because yeah, I'm yeah. I damaged my thumb for three months cutting layers of fabric. Smugly, I bought my Gemini in April, plus my blocks. <laughs> it's my best friend, says That's Barbara. That's brilliant. Oh, I hadn't even thought that, so we're all Geminis. Yeah. Yes. When's yours, Kat? February. February. You are uh, Pisces. Uh, and then uh, Bruce is just over the other side, isn't he? You're in Cancer, aren't you, Bruce? Yeah, Cancerian. But we, yeah. Yeah, we are all Gemini's. Yeah. We should have got our Gemini's for free, shouldn't we? We should say, just that's just Sarah. If you're born in June, you get a Gemini for free. Wouldn't well, that yeah, be lovely? I've got mine for free. Yeah, me too. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, maybe, well, maybe that was why we got them for free. Yeah. <laughs> Um, so I'm just going to carry on stitching. So this, these are the ninja stars. So if I show you here, this is the um, isosceles triangle that we've got here. Yep. Then we've got that half rectangle um, triangle. I'm going to stitch this one onto here and then I'm going to sew everything together. So I've already um, stitched the other pieces together. So this is what I've just been doing while John's been talking. So you, the fact that you have um, everything cut out uh, by using the, the dies it means everything matches up perfectly so if i just pop that there against that piece of fabric you can see that that matches up absolutely perfectly when i use my quarter of an inch seam allowance i know that i'm going to have a really good finish to it yeah and um, so i'm going to carry on doing that and then stitch those together and then i've done those two blocks i've already done the two blocks from yesterday brilliant um, which i put here and i've already started the sashing so i've done a small piece of sashing in the middle sh yep. sashing, sashing. sashing and i've put another piece here and then this is just the border that i've put on so i'm going to carry on with that now if you watched the show yesterday we had the fabric cutter on the show didn't we the, like um 
Oh, oh yes, it was like yesterday's a, early bird. It's like bird. a guillotine yeah. um, kind of thing, which is really good. If you manage to get hold of one, it's, it's brilliant. It makes things a breeze, but you absolutely can just use your rotary cutter and a ruler in order to cut that yes. out. So you're just cutting long strips. So I'm going to carry on stitching that together now. Um, but I just wanted to show you how that sort of matches up yeah. um, with those points. Now, because it's um, a triangle, you've already lost those sort of dog ears. We've already cut off those little dog ears by using that um, Gemini um, die. So it just makes it a little bit easier for you to sew everything together. When's Sarah's birthday? Um, oh. Oh. I was just wondering, is she a Gemini? I was, I, no, I think it's March. Oh, OK. I just um, wondered why, why she called it a Gemini. That was all, whether it was after her or one of her kids. Do you know, or... I don't know. Um, no, I think... No, I don't think her children are. I'm, I'm not sure. I have to ask that question. It's what? Isn't that St George's Day? 23rd of April it is, probably. Oh, OK. Uh, March, April. It's March, same. April. March, near, April. Near, near, same, same season. Same, same. Same, same yeah. season. I knew it was a while ago. Um. Uh, Jane says, morning both. I already have both the Builder Block starter set. Oh, yes, yes, you keep watching, Jane, because, uh, because Becky will be bringing special deals with more Builder Blocks in the coming months, months won't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, different one e each month. So but what, she, what she's asking is, will you do two, like, two together like we've done today? Will you do special deals for us? Maybe. She's shrugging her shoulders. Maybe. Yes, she will. Yes, Maybe. She will. Uh, I'll see what I can do. I'll, I'll ask. So you, are you in every Wednesday then? Do no, um, but it's every other, okay. every other Tuesday, actually, I think, pretty much. So it's this is what you do Wednesday and Thursday? Yeah, because we had the takeover. Oh, sorry, over. Did Tuesday. Yeah, yeah, sorry, sorry did Tuesday. Tuesday. Yeah. Um, and then I, I gen I'm generally at um, head office doing softer side on a Friday. Oh, OK. So, okay. so where do people watch that if they want to watch that then? On Crafters TV, yeah. yeah. Um, so Facebook or on um, YouTube. Yeah. Um, so now I've just put those two together. So if I look now, you can see that it is all going to um, just pin... Um, or just pin, just match up perfectly um, just here. Um, so I'm just going to fold those over. Now, when I put those together, I tend to match that center point together. Right, you First have. of all. And then um, make sure that you've got a few pins in there. So the other ones I haven't bothered pinning together um, because I know that they're going to match up. But um, when once you start stitching them together, obviously you know, the fabric changes very slightly, doesn't it? Good um, morning, says Jean in the West Midlands. Good morning, all, she says. Morning. Bought my Gemini, went on a special before. Have ordered the Block Plus now. I am a Gemini. Oh. 17th. Great demo, she says. Thank you, Jean. <laughs> We'll have to have a big birthday party, a we big will. June birthday party. Before before the pandemic, before COVID happened, everything, I was organising a John Scott like tea party thing mm. that was going to be in a big field. Yeah. And all the um, like people like Mandy Shaw would have a stall and Sarah was going to have a stall and everything like that. So you come have afternoon tea and champagne if you want to, but also buy from all your favourite designers, like a little a mini festival of quilts. But then, and I'd just be there, you know, me meandering and mingling with everybody <laughs> and everything. And, uh, we, and then it all got postponed and everything because of, um, of COVID and oh. things. I think you should do that. No, no, we'll do it. We were trying to decide where would be the best place to do it, though, you see, because there's a lovely field in my village. But then I was saying, oh, we'll have to put on mini buses to the train station, all that sort of stuff. So, um, but anyway, we'll have to think about it, do it. But I don't know where to do it, because I won't just do it in London. But then oh, but we were that, like. That would be really convenient for me, though. Be perfect for you, because <laughs> it would be in West London. Yeah, exactly. Um, uh, or my village, or wherever. So, like, and then I was thinking, well, maybe Birmingham, because it's in the centre of the country, sort of thing, isn't it? Centre ish, sort of thing. So, uh, well, I think unless we did several and we did one in Scotland, one in Wales, one in, you well, know. sounds like a great idea. I'll yeah, be up for that, definitely. Yeah, I can imagine. I and you'd imagine. have to have a stand at each one I, then. I would, yeah. I could have, we could have a crafter's companion one and I could have a stand for my Yes, stuff. yes. Yeah, so that'll all be, that'd be great. I like that idea. If you didn't know, if you didn't know, Becky has a company called, am I allowed to talk about it? Uh, yeah, yeah. Chang's Fabric, yep. basically. We used to sell it at Sewing Quarter. Obviously, because of the pandemic, yep. it all had to stop. But now it must be open. Yep. The doors must be beginning to open yeah, again Yeah, and now. actually, I am due to do a show in November. So next month, so I'll here? be bring, Yeah, here, With Chang's Fabric? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yep. fantastic. Oh, yep. it's lovely. You're going to love it. What is it? Shiburu and... <laughs> Shib um, sh <laughs> Shibori. That's the one. Not Shibari. Yeah. Um, and it's, um, it's sort of handmade Chinese indigo fabrics. Oh, it's gorgeous. So they're I made by a minority group. Yes, and um, they not, China. they just, these people sit in a village, right, and they get fabric and they just stitch it and the different, and then they dip it into indigo and everything. And then when they open it all up, it's made these incredible patterns. We shouldn't really talk about that, but we'll talk about it in November. But it's just fantastic. Keep an eye out for that. Yeah. 
so I definitely. And that was your auntie, wasn't it, that set that up? Yeah, so my auntie um, started doing the, sh um, you know, going over to China to get choosing the fabric. Yeah. And then I took over from her. Yeah. Um, but actually, my family are all Chinese, even though I don't look Chinese at all. Um, and when we did one of those DNA tests, we discovered we are actually descendant from the minority group that created that the, the fabric. Yeah. No. So it's almost like it was a. You know, a genetic desire when we looked at the fabric yeah. and fell in love with it. So, have you got brothers and sisters? I had one of each, but they they sadly passed away oh, when no, I was sorry, twenty. I didn't know. Oh no, no, that's right. Um, but I was thinking, do they look more Chinese than you do? <laughs> no. Did they look so more Chinese? So basically, out of all of the family, um, my mum is the least Chinese looking out of the whole set of brothers and sisters. Right. And consequently, I, I am. Um, I don't. I don't look Chinese at all. I mean, I'm. My hair's. My hair's not blonde. My hair's grey. Yeah. Um, but, but in this heyday, it was yeah. blonde. No, no, oh, it's dark. It? But it's just easier to dye it <laughs> blonde ah. because I'm so grey. Okay. Um, so actually, I don't. I look more like my dad, who was bl blonde hair, blue eyes. Right, okay. um, I'd look far less like my uh, my mum. And um, actually, all my aunties, my cousins, they all look very Chinese. It's just me that doesn't. How funny really, when you have a family yeah. resemblance? But like, no, who are no. those three in the corner? We, we all have big mouths. Well, yeah. So a couple of people did say, well, actually, I can tell that you're related because you've both got a big mouth. Um, and, and not as in, you know, Loud. actually, literally, they're yeah. physically a big mouth. Okay. Um, but yeah, I, lots of my cousins look far more Chinese than I do. It's just how it it's, how I happens, think it's, isn't I it? think it's fascinating. All that I just find fascinating because it starts off, like, like I will say this, where Mike and Julie have got three kids, so all from the same gene pool. You couldn't find three more different children. Well, not really? children anymore. But they're so, they look, you can tell they're related. But what do you mean that just in, you can see that Alex has got this work ethic from her dad and her mum's sense of humour and all it just did the way it kind of worked I just think it's fantastic mm. it is amazing how different people are and in fact I was at um, Festival of Quilts a few years ago and I was talking to a lady who was a quarter Chinese like I am and you could see it on her yeah um, and and then she brought her mum over and um, my mum was there and the, the two of them are like peering at each other because obviously they're as Chinese and as English as each other. Yeah. One looks, you can absolutely 100% see that she has got Chinese genes. My mum, no, 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 definitely not. Um, but yeah, my aunt um, started the business, it doesn't look very So the aunt that started the business was, business, was it her that was having her 60th birthday that day on your 17th birthday? No, it was another one. Another. <laughs> It was another but one. it's funny you've got they've all got created because your mum's a costume designer yeah mum's a costume designer um my cousin is a, a, st a stylist uh -huh. for um, pop stars oh yes um my other cousin is a very famous graffiti artist now, pop stars pop stars yeah um, you're, you're he, the one what? the one's a very famous graffiti artist oh really he's not banksy that no. i always have to say he's not yeah, banksy okay, okay. um but um yeah um tv producers um uh, all sorts of everyone yeah. does a little bit of something yeah. um, you know whether it's um, um, it's, there's everyone's creative in some way shape and what or about form. Your, children, your children got the creative uh, well, my gene. daughter when she went so my daughter's doing her last year at university uh -huh. um, now but she she went on her first year she took a sewing machine and um, she it was during COVID so she wasn't there for very long yeah. because obviously they were you know they were sort of ho not homeschooled but you know effectively yeah, homeschooled yeah. um but she did a, a roaring trade in doing costumes for the local theater um you know, group um and you know altering people's jeans yeah, and yeah, clothes. Yeah. so she yeah. did quite well so she's quite um she's quite adept adept and she's more she's a very sort of um I don't know, like creative in a way where if I was going to make a dress, I'd need a pattern. And she just, she's very slight. So she just drapes it over herself and then does a couple of seams and she's, uh, and she's, she's done. done. But she's, she's slight. So yeah. I think, you know, that's the, that's the that difference. Helps, yeah. But yeah, she's, she's quite creative. My son, not particularly. Um, he's not, he's more into sort of computers and that kind of okay. thing. But I still think that's quite creative anyway. Isn't he doing military? Isn't he somebody doing, doing something with the military? No, he was going to um, go into the army, but he has actually decided to go and work for my husband. Um, so he's he's started working as a, an estate agent. Oh wow! And he absolutely loves it. I bet he does. Yeah, I love to really be an estate enjoys agent. it. Um, I think it's quite good if you're nosy. Yeah. It's quite a good yeah, thing yeah. to go and do. So I've just trimmed off while we've been <laughs> chatting. Be nosy, those little box, those, yeah. uh, those bo um, blocks. Box. And then I'm just going to put this together here. So that is going to form. I've put the sashing in the middle, and that's going to form that other part of the sashing. And then I'm going to put some of the fabric around the outside um, to sort of finish it off, and then put Brilliant. it back to it. So I'll show you what I've done on the back. Um, how are we doing for time? Well, we've got about ten minutes. Okay. Ten five to ten minutes yeah fine um and it's um 
Are these kind of projects that I'm doing over these you know, few weeks, months, yeah. that I'm doing sort of different things each time. So I'm doing some things that would take a little bit longer. So we did one um, a while ago with our foundation paper piecing pad. Um, and that's obviously foundation paper piecing takes, takes a fair amount of time when yeah, you're yeah. putting it together anyway. Um, so last month we did a, um, a, like a fall table runner with right. maple leaves. Leaves? Leaves. Um, and then um, next month we'll do Rob Peter's paper corn. I'm doing kind of a Christmassy um, item there. Right. Um, so we'll do different things each. Um, twice each a month. Time. Yeah, twice yeah. a month. Just to show you the kinds of things that you can you can make because we can show you how the Gemini works and how the builder blocks work. But actually, our, it's quite our, nice to see you, something being made. Are the development team, because when you go into Crafter Companion, it's a big glossy glass and chrome building everything you go into these like it's got sliding doors which are circular like that anyway you go in there's a receptionist sitting there and then you go and then the, all the tables everyone's in the same big room but you've got development you've got printing you've got accounting you've got all of them yeah. all in the same and the development team are there just constantly developing things. so they must be developing new build a block patterns all the time mustn't yeah they? yeah absolutely so we've got and um, we've got a lot already i mean we've got things like um i think we had bay leaf um on the show on tuesday when sarah was here um we've got rob peter to pay paul we've got um pineapple we've got um all sorts of other yeah, different yeah, yeah, ones yeah, yeah, i mean yeah, yeah. it just goes on and on plus we've got those ones by karen lewis and joe avery yeah um where they've they've each one whilst you're doing a block they actually include three different projects yeah, exactly. um, in there as well so we've got loads of different builder blocks and you know when we start going into like we're saying we're going to go into curves um next month that makes a that, that, I mean, I just wouldn't do curves. I just wouldn't. They would make me cry um, if I was doing curves yeah, before. Yeah, but they're not going to make you cry next nope, month. No, definitely not. I need to just update you on this, I'm afraid, because I, how many are left? 14. There's only 14 of this bundle left. Obviously, I'm not saying we're never going to have the Gemini machine again. Of course we are. But this is a special deal we've done, or Sarah's done, for this week, for the birthday week, right? So what you get is you get your Gemini machine, you get all of these. Yes, mind you, we've, got, we've still got, what day is it? Day Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday to go, yeah. So um, we most probably have sold them all by the weekend. So what you get with this machine automatically is you get your two um, plastic plates, which are the bread when you're making your sandwich. You've got your metal plate for your cutting. You've got your shim to make it wider then if you're going to do a uh, paper cutting uh, some paper cutting needs a magnetized sheet and this is for your embossing so you can do fabric leather felt paper cardboard all sorts of things in this machine uh, now for that 170 pounds that's how much this normally costs but look what you get you get the dies to make the ribbon you get the dies to make the catherine wheel you get the die to make the hawaiian thing you get some embossing i don't what's the top two at the left there i don't know are they instructions they, yeah, no, the, the, the two at the top in the top left hand corner, what are they? Are they part of the embossing thing as well? Or instructions and things like that. Anyway, so you get the whole bundle for 179.99. Should be 200. 36.96. 236.96 is what it should be. But you, while this, how many are left today? 14 or 12? 14. For, while those 14 are still around, that's the price you'll get all of that deal for. Get it on split pay if you want. Uh, 59.99 three times. So it'll be paid for by Christmas if you're self-gifting or indeed if you're buying it for uh, someone for Christmas. So that should bundle that you'll need. Actually, you'll need that for all of the Builder Block projects that um, Becky's going to be coming in to do because you'll need a die cutter to do all of them. Then what you do is just top up your stock top up your stash because today you can get this bundle which is your build a block regular and your build a block pl plus right now we sold out of this yesterday we got hold of sarah's people yesterday she gave us some more right but that's it she said you can't have any more pet <laughs> yeah you can he have any more pet is what she said <laughs> 149 and where's the purple blouse I bought you? That was the other thing she said. 149.99. <laughs> Beautiful. Split pay 49.99. So this one, you get your squares, your half square triangles, your quarter square triangles, you get your oblongs, you get your isosceles triangles, and you get your half rectangle triangles. 149.99 for that bundle. While stocks last, that should be 99 pounds, and that should be 99 pounds. So you're actually saving a lot of money there. Right now we have we haven't got this one on we haven't got 
that one on its own today, but we've got this one on its own, which again, we've done a special birthday deal for you. This is just your builder block plus, so that's your oblongs, your isosceles triangles, and your half rectangle triangles, which is all the ones that Becky's using today. That's 79.99, should be 99.99. Split pair of 39.99, twice that one. And again, look, blocks four, six, eight, nine, and 12. Now, what you must do, <clears throat> Becky reminds us earlier, is look in the booklet that comes with it, because not all the blocks can do all the sizes. So you just have to read it to check. Now, the one I picked for you is this one, because I've got this one. This one's not been on telly here, this one, right? So this one, you get your normal builder block, your original builder block, which is squares, half square triangles, your quarter square triangles, and your alphabet and numbers. Alphabetti spaghetti, do they still make that? I'll tell you what I bought recently, I bought some baked beans with Branston pickle in it, thinking they'd be lovely. Ugh. <laughs> 139, 134.99 for that bundle. Uh, you're saving 35, I think that one was, wasn't it? Because it's fallen off. Yeah, 35, it's just dropped off the bottom of the graphics, I couldn't remember. 35 pounds. Uh, Delphine is coming, don't worry, and she will get a full hour. Don't you worry, don't you worry. We've just, we just got, everything got waylaid a little bit. It's only Christmas fabrics in me at the last hour. You'll be bored of me by then. I love Christmas fabrics. Oh, no, no, no. I, it's brilliant, but I'll get, I'll get them all done. But I don't want you to miss the demos. Basically, it's just me on my own in the last hour, so I'll get them done. But I don't want you to miss out on the demos. Can you see what? Oh, zips on a roll. Of course you can, because we, we might not get to putting it into the cushion, actually. So let, I'll just do the zips on a roll. We've got a bundle of all... Oh, have we, though? Bundle of all three. Cream, black and white, because these sold out yesterday as well. You buy two, you get one for free. Isn't that right? Am I right? Yeah. Yep. You buy two, you get one for free. I say, you buy two, you get one for free. Oh, no, that's the window advert. £15.98. Uh, you get one of those free. What it is, you get five. Oh, actually, we had a question afterwards. Yes. You might not know the answer. Yep. Somebody asked, can you buy the zip heads on their own? We don't stock them. OK, I said you but wouldn't. You but... might be able to, because they're like a standard zip. Yeah, yeah. So I think if you got them, you could try. I can't get them to thread back on. Oh, you need a oh. fork. Um, well, um, Stuart Healy, I said, I'll, I'll show you, and then we've got, oh, um, yes. because I've always struggled with them, and I end up just cutting yeah. more. But anyway, you anyway, um, you get 10 heads and five metres of each colour. Once you've started using them, it comes out this little hole in the side there, so you can just dispense it as you need it. You pay for two, you get one for free. You get a cream, you get a black, and you get a white. They are available separately. Oh, underneath, we're not going to do them. OK, then which colours? Black first. Obviously, you don't get one for free if you do it this way around. Beautiful. There's your black one, seven ninety nine. There's your cream ones. And they are invaluable, aren't they? Having them on a roll. Yes. Now, you, what's really funny, right? So when I'm just going to tell you, I don't know if I should tell this story, but when I was at Crafters Companion and then the COVID happened and Sarah said to me, will you do a Facebook Live from your house every week and we'll send you something just to sell that day. And the first day um, they sent me these sips. And I was like, sips? Sips? Like that was really <laughs> like, anyway, we sold thousands of them. <laughs> so thousands and thousands of them. Because they're so brilliant. They're absolutely brilliant. 7 99 That's the white one. That's the white one. But I would personally, this is just me, but I'd buy the bundle because if you buy all three, you pay for two, you get one for free. Yeah, you can use it on anything. You can, like that. oh, actually, um, I've got Lucy Pixley on, no, that's not how I say it, is it? Lucy Pixley, Pixley? Anyway, she'll be watching, she'll message in, complaining. Um, I've got these on, well, if they haven't sold out, I've got these on her show on Friday. But also, if you were making the Jenny Jackson pouch we were doing the other day and she needed two little zips like that, they're already, you know, you cut them off to the size you want them. They're, they're absolutely brilliant. You would be able to put them in this cushion, but we've run out of time, so we're not yes, going to yeah. do it. But if you have a look now at the cushion front that's on the table there. So this is what I've done over the last two days. Yep. Now, I've just got my, um, a bit of um, wadding at the back. Um, you can use either of our sprays. So we had, um, we've got two sprays. We've got stick and stay, which is a permanent um, spray. Yeah. And we've got stick and spray, which is a repositionable one. Right. Um, so that, this one, it's got a blue lid, but I lo I've lost all my lids, um, but it's got blue, navy blue, blue lid. here. 
and um, that's the one that I use for basting my um, my quilts together. And actually, it's um, it's the same stuff as the as five hundred five. Yeah, I can say same, five same five, yeah. stuff. Yeah, same uh, stuff. Sorry, but you also so what's what's this one? This is a permanent one yeah. then that the orange so one. So great for applique um, and all that sort of thing. These are these are so good. I I don't use anything else anymore. When okay. I used to baste, a, I used to use all the pins for basting. I don't use them anymore. I just use the spray. Very quickly though, you can buy them separately or you can buy them together. There you go, save a little bit of money that way as well. Special price, £14.38, you get one of each in that, in that bundle. Right, Becky, it's been a nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, if you can't see the mess behind you, know, we've got it, quilts, we've got everything out here. I'm terribly messy. I'm no, a messy it's perfect. I'm it's lovely to see you, so Thank we'll you. see you next. Um, I think it's next Tuesday, I've lost track. Next week uh, sometime. Ne next week. Uh, next week. Oh, Tuesday, you're on with me then. If it's, yeah, think, if it's Tuesday, because it, we're doing the winner, the we're doing the winner of the competition on Tuesday. So the next Tuesday or the Tuesday oh, after? Oh, I so it might not. I can't. I can't Fine. remember. Well, anyway, she'll be back soon. one day soon. doing Rob Peter to pay Paul, which yep. is a quilt pattern. We're not going to be doing any crime. Uh, don't go anywhere because in four minutes, time, <laughs> I have to just say these things. In four minutes time, Delphine's back. Oh, they're not there. We've got owls and we've got foxes. Two brand new designs and two reissued designs. Wall hangings and cushions. Don't go anywhere. We'll see you in four minutes. It's from now. Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. Head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the home page, type in your email address, click the envelope and you're done. Never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one PNP all day. for ideas for the perfect gift, why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. Are you a fan of Sewing Street? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing community. See you there! If you're a Sewing Street customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Follow Sewing Street on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media. And pick up some top tips from us too. Missed the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favorite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again.
Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. Head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope and you're done. Never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one PP all day. for ideas for the perfect gift, why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. You, if you only could see what it's like when we have to try and get everything done in four minutes, it's just... Right. And uh, what turns into an owl in Midsummer Night's Stream? The donkey. I look like the donkey in Midsummer Night's Stream, apparently. <laughs> the things we have to put up with here. I have to do this first, because it's about to sell out, right? It's about to sell out. This is, a, a, I don't want to say old, one of your originals. It is, about a year and a half ago. Yeah. yeah, have we got a date or not for it? 13th of July. Oh, last year, 2021. It's only ever on once, sold out. At hundreds and hundreds of this sold, right? We've got it back, right? It's all about the pattern, right? So you get the pattern for Oakley the Owl. You then get a metre of your white fabric or uh, ivory fabric. That looks like a fat quarter of brown, mm -hmm. yeah. And then you get the panel. We're not demoing this today. So what date did you say? 20 something of July, was it? Oh, 13th of July last year. 13th of July last year on, on Facebook, on uh, YouTube. So there you go, you get the strip panel. You get the instructions. You get the fat quarter of brown and you get half a meter. Three left, there's three left. Three left. We have got the instructions on their own. We've got more of those done for you. So you can do your own, you can do your own colourway, couldn't you? If you've got a design roll. Oh, do you know what? If you bought one of our panels yesterday, right, go, go on to, uh, if you go on to um, TV Guide, go to yesterday, go backwards a day, go to 12 o'clock. We had a whole hour of exclusive of panels like this. You could find one of these in your own colourway and do it in your own colourway if you wanted to. $9.99 is Oakley the Owl. So in there, you've got everything that you need. There's your temp. Oh, hang on, let me go to the beginning. Instructions. Lots of instructions, lots of pictures. There's your um, main picture. There's all your pieces. There's your template. Beautiful. Everything you need in there. $9.99. You get a lot with Delphine's patterns for $9.99. So uh, the, the bundle itself is going to sell out. The bundle itself is about to sell out. The pattern on its own, a quarter of the stock's gone like that. I can't click my fingers. Got new owls coming up today. But we need to do the fox wall hanging first. Felix, right? So Felix is slightly diff different, obviously, because it's a uh, fox. Half the stock of the bundle of this one's gone already. What date was this one? There you go. Oh, we don't have a date because that one must have been, was that? That was probably around the same time. Oh, around the same yeah. time. If you put in, in YouTube, put Delphine Felix and see what comes up. Right, so in that one, you get one and a half metres of the white and you get a 10 inch charm pack. I think that one is, I can't remember what that one's called now. 
Anyway, that's all you get. That's all you get. Plus the instructions. $64.99. dollars Oh, the single figures of that one already. Single figures of that one. Has it got a scrappy binding? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you'll have loads left over. Well, no, no. I'm just thinking, yeah. she hasn't got a long piece oh, yeah. through binding. She'd have to do a scrappy binding out of that, though. And can I just say, with those instructions, because they are full, thick set of actual colour instructions, those oh, are supposed to be a lot more expensive than that. I actually took a pay cut for that. Oh, OK. That one. Yeah, you're not supposed to say that. No, not pay cut. <laughs> as in, like, I didn't want to overprice yes. it. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I made sure that, to make sure it's easy for you to understand, I did full colour. Right, Felix. So he's worth a lot of money. <laughs> 17th of March last year. Yeah. Nowhere near July then. Oh, I don't remember. It's about to sell out. It's about to sell out as a bundle. Right. I've got instructions on their own though. Half the stock of the Felix. No, you see, now that is wrong. Because we sell your bigger instructions like this for like 12 99 normally, don't we? The ones that have got lots and lots yeah. of pages in like that. This should not be $9.99. You're going to get it for $9.99. Just if Delphine can't feed her kids this month, then, you know. I'm sure. <laughs> yeah. So I'll come to your house. Oh, all right, then. <laughs> I'm very good at uh, eggs, chips and beans. Now, what are the kids' favourite food? Oh, no, I bet they're like curry. I bet they're really no, sophisticated. No, Louis is really bad. He'll eat, like, nuggets and chips. He's yeah, whereas, well, that's fine. Whereas Charlie will eat anything. Oh, they're vegetarian. There's no meat allowed or fish in our, at my house. Oh, I can eat veggie. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, and I've got my nephew's ninja cooker, ninja oven, oh, yeah. in the oh, in the fancy. garage, which I still haven't got out yet. But um, anyway, nine ninety nine. I've got to move on. Don't no, move on. So those two bundles have gone. Right, I'll give those to Cap. That they're the returners. These are the brand. Which one should we do first? Owl first. This is a cushion, right? Now this is you can buy this in two different colourways, right? So is that the one with the bright blue? This this one, yeah. So, to make this exactly like that, you want this kit. So you've got Felicity. This is Felicity. That's the fox. This is Oliver. This is, I thought it looked like a boy. This is Oliver. Well, it's because I picked up this colourway, because what's confusing is you can buy Oliver in both colourways and you can buy Felicity in both colourways. And it's not a giraffe. Now, I didn't think it was that one that was a draft, which was the other one. Anyway, look, let's just concentrate. So for $29.99, you get the instructions. You get the, f how many? Five left. Five left. You get half a metre of the blue, so you get enough for the front of the cushion and the face of Oliver. There's three left. Have I got the pattern on its own? Oh. Oh, yeah, I've got a different version as well. So that's this version, which will make that, and that's this, right? But that's about to sell out. Right? Okay. Now, if you want it in this colourway, now this is, don't get confused. That's the. <laughs> Where did that come from? <laughs> oh, I do apologise, Duffy. <laughs> I didn't even know it was up there. I thought we just had glitter up there. Not I'll anymore. fix that for you afterwards. <laughs> oh, my word. See this colourway, but in Oliver the Owl is this here. <laughs> Who put that there behind the glitter? <laughs> Somebody trying to sabotage my show. Twenty nine ninety nine. So that's this colourway. It's the owl. <laughs> Oliver, yeah, Oliver. It's that owl, but in this colourway. Oh my word! I'm going to have to sit down or go home. I've got to film an advert. Do you know what? I've got to film an advert after. Then nobody's told me about this. I've got to film an advert at one o'clock for Amber Makes. I know. I said that's Rebecca Reed. Oh, she's on holiday. It's on holiday. Right. Okay. The other bundle has sold out completely. The, that bundle, that colourway, has sold out completely. How am I doing with this colourway? Quarter of the stock. It's because you can't see it made, isn't it? Look here, are all the different colours. $29.99. So you get uh, half a metre of the blue, the, fa the five inch charm pack, and the instructions for Oliver the Owl. $29.99. Instructions on their own. Here we go. For Oliver the Owl cushion. 
nine pounds 99 pence again beautifully printed up loads of photos there's all your placement there's all your templates for oliver the owl 9.99 that one is so he sold out in the blue sold out in that colorway if you want to make your own colorway now any oh also yesterday we had loads of five inch how, how many do you need into of the squares do you oh, need? Not an awful lot. so on our panels you know we have like 20 mm. is it 20 we have on, on the um, panels the, on the panels of five inch squares the ones you know the, the ones we had yesterday is it 20 or 40 it's 20 oh it's 40 oh you're fine then you're absolutely fine yesterday if you go to yesterday's show you'll see in the last hour yesterday in fact we might have had some of yours you know the five inch squares that you've designed we had to stop yawning i don't sneeze oh it's a sneeze it was yeah it was a silent sneeze so no I'm no you shouldn't do that it's bad for your pelvic girdle i know <laughs> i learned that at school anyway 9.99 shall we move on to felicity now so this is felicity oh i can see it now it's a girl tail <laughs> eyelashes right do this one first then so that's this colorway so you get felicity the fox instructions you get half a meter of the pale blue and you get that five inch charm pack to make that 29 uh, you'll have loads of fabric left over yeah, won't you yeah 29.99 it's enough to make the front of the cushion actually you know what you could do you could use some of those five inch squares patch them together and make the back out yeah, of those that's squares what i would you? have done but i just wanted to uh, i only had the one pack yeah no that's fine i shouldn't have time either too busy going for a sausage sandwich around the corner 29.99 <laughs> or shout it who's who's, he, who's they shouted at who's your husband shouted at recently uh sorry <laughs> i don't know what's the matter I do apologise for my guest. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. She's not even on talkback. Nobody's talking to her. It's just her standing there giggling. You tickle me, John. Hey? She's fine. She's fine. Right, Kate, okay, did you want Felicity the Fox in the other colourway? Yes, please. So if you want Felicity the Fox in this colourway with the bright blue background and the darker shades... What is the matter? Have you not eaten? She's crying. She's crying. Oh dear. Sorry. 29.99. It's because she had to get up early this morning. So her, it's midnight. Right, 29.99 Felicity Fox. Beautiful. So that's in the that colourway. Remember that colourway sold out of Oliver the Owl now. Okay. Then we can do Felicity the Fox pattern on her own. Half the stock of this has gone already. Nine ninety nine. They're very noisy out there doing that. Um, they're prepping our green room, aren't they? I blame Cat. She's got a lot of guests on today, isn't she? There's a lot of people next door. Nine ninety nine. Felicity the Fox. Okay, so what are you going to demo then? I can demo both of them, but they'll be in the same kind of ways that I made them. No, we're not doing those. We're doing these. Yeah. The, the, oh, you the, sorry, you pointed at the cushion. Yeah. 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 Do you like a chair? Do you like a chair? Do you like to sit down? Do you like a <laughs> tissue? I've got a clean hanky here. You it just, is clean, I you promise. You just make me laugh, John. I'll have to tell you later. Oh, <laughs> okay. Right, okay. Can you, well, you better sew or do you want me to sew? I'm not going to... It's only got a bit of mascara on there. <laughs> uh, Debbie Shaw did that once. Remember, she, when she cut herself with a toy needle, she took my, and then she, she meant something, she's going, I've got your hanky at home, I'm cloning you. That's what she said. <laughs> right. So what are you doing first then? Oh, what would you like me I'd, to what make? What would you like her to do first? Fox or owl? It's up to you. You choose. In whatever colour you fancy. Oh, okay. Well, I'll do the fox. Right. Because he's nice and quick. Okay, she, she. She, she she's nice and quick. Yeah. I'm going to spend a bit more time going through the owl. Oh, just sitting there. Oh, you'll need some bonder web, by the way. I've got it on a roll. Who's that? Who's just... Oh, we haven't got that yet. Sorry, my bad. We will, but we'll get it in a minute for you. Do you want the other mat? Yeah. 
Which one do you want to do it the other way around? In fact, I'll do it the other way around. Yeah. That's easier, isn't no. it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, oh, it's a long day. What day is it today? Thursday. Thursday. It's only 20 to 12. It's not even lunchtime. Yet. It feels like, uh, yeah. So what time do your alarm clock go off this morning? Five. Oh, that's a lie! That's late for me. I'm Did you wake all the kids up and everything? No, but the thing is, I can't sleep properly. I don't know about you. I know, no, I would, but yeah. you, I'm worried about the alarms not going off. Yeah. Or um, so, yeah. We went to bed early, and then I still can't get to sleep because you, yeah. Yeah. No, I left. I tiptoed out the house this morning. So house was in darkness when I left. Yeah. So, Welcome to my world. So yeah. <laughs> so yeah, left my baby sleeping. Checked in on them, but they were both fast asleep. Oh. Yeah. Did you put your clothes in a different room then? No. Oh, that's selfish. What? He, Nick's asleep. Did you not wake him up with you stomping around the bedroom? I, I don't stomp around. <laughs> um, you've got bother boots on. Yeah, but I, I don't know what, have them upstairs. Oh, okay. Oh, don't you? No, I tiptoe around like I'm light as a feather, John. I bet. Like she's a lady. <laughs> right, go on, you've got your square of blue then. Yeah. Then what do you do? Stick stuff on it. Brilliant. <laughs> That's what we want to hear. The fox looks so feminine, she'd be a perfect partner. For the one behind Delphine on the same scale. Oh, what, make her bigger? Yeah. Yeah, you could do. You have yeah. to f get Felix a bigger photocopier. Yeah. Delphine's making me laugh, says Becky Alexander Frost. <laughs> could do it from a picture. The Bond web that I've got today has sold out, but I've got that lovely big roll. I don't know how many I've got in stock. I've got it here, it's in the warehouse. Oh, it's brand new, brand new ink because they sell out every time. You got this one. It's 30 meters by 45 I centimeters. I need this one in my life. It's yeah. brilliant. It's mm. absolutely brilliant. I'll probably get through one of them a month. Yes. <laughs> I've got small packets. But they'd be no good for this, would they? You'd need, uh, you'd need, well, yeah, for the yeah. One, if you did one, they'd be, be. they'd be fine for each project. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. this is the most affordable way of buying your bond web if you're going to use it lots and lots and lots. When you open the box, there's about 100 leaflets inside it because those boxes are actually designed to have in a fabric shop and people come in and buy it by the metre and then they're given a, a leaflet of how to use it. So you will get lots and lots of leaflets inside there. £117.99. Now, I know it feels like a considered purchase, but every time they come in, they sell out straight away, just to warn you. Right, off you go then, Delphine. So the Fox template... So you've got, um, so I've basically given you half a head. So the fox itself is actually symmetrical. So right. there's no point overloading you with too many templates. Right. Because all you've got to do is trace round one half of it on the glue side and the other half on the non-glue side. Oh, okay. All the photographs, step by step of how I did it, it's all in the instructions anyway. Right. So he's checking on me now. No, no, I'm not. See, they're all there, so of how you... Put it all up and yeah, 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 and the placement guides and everything. Lovely. Yeah. Yeah, got it. So I've cut out all my pieces, and then you, you basically you could use this um, to um, use up your scraps by just sewing loads. Of, my favourite way of doing this, uh, doing some applique, is by sewing sewing all your scraps together to fit the template piece. Yes. Because it just looks really cool. It's a way of using up all your uh, pieces. Little and, bits, yeah. And also with your applique, you don't want it all. Some, you don't always sometimes want it too matchy matchy because yeah. otherwise it looks a bit meh. Also, so. also, don't be thinking, oh, I've got all those pieces together. You make it into a square and then put the pattern piece on top of it, so you then cut it out. Don't be thinking, oh, I've yeah. got to put a bit here and a bit there. You just randomly sew them together and put your put your bond web on the top on the back of it and just cut round it. It'll just be a random. So just to show how far this goes, I've made. The one behind me. Yeah. And the I've already cut out my pattern pieces for this fox already. Yeah. And I've still got all of this left. I've got loads. I've got enough there to make at least another two. Exactly, three. exactly. And piece the back. So just so you know, that's how far. And there the graphics are in twenty nine nine. So if you say you can make so you think you can make four. Four easily. So that's gonna make them four into thirty, six six was the two five pound fifty each or something like that. Yeah. So if you got the bundle. Obviously you need the, the back half meter for the background and things, yeah. but yeah, that's all good. So if you did like the bundle with one and then got a pattern on its own, you could do both. Other, yeah. You could do both in mm. the same colour way. Should look nice. Yeah, lovely. Do owls and foxes get on then? I've no idea. No. They're nice woodland creatures. Woodland. Yeah. They should be the fox, the owl, and my cat Luther, because we think it was a fox that bit him. Now, not a fox or a dog that bit him. Not a. He got squirrel. bitten. Oh, do you not know? No. Oh, we came in one day, 
And he'd been, he was asleep on the bed. And I went up straight when I got in from work. And I thought, was it, the ba- was, it a bank ho- was it a bank holiday? It was a bank holiday, wasn't it? And um, I went up and I stroked him. And I thought, oh, he's not really. He normally goes, oh, hello, hello, like that. And he didn't. He just laid there. Anyway, then oh. I put these afternoon fishy treats out. And oh, sorry, I'm not in the right place. Sorry, it's my bad. Oh. Sorry, there you go. And then um, he came wandering down and his left arm was, he was like, hop, hop, hop. And his left oh. arm was about this huge, like this. Oh, look. Anyway, it turned out he'd been bitten. Well, they thought he'd been bitten by a squirrel or a rat. But then he had to go back and the, the, the mouth was too wide, the, the bite mark on his, on his arm. He was fine, he had two jabs and he came home and he was out playing in the woods again that night, but he was fine. Aww. But um, he just kind of, he likes, I said, they were going, oh, poor squirrel. And I was like, no, poor cat. And I was going, poor squirrel. Because he was probably like that, in a headlock yeah. out in the woods or something. Because he likes, likes playing with all the animals. And now Ghost has decided he likes climbing trees. So I'll go out, the neighbours will go, oh, I think Ghost. And he'll get halfway up the, like that and then he'll go, oh, they're stuck. And he's stuck there. So he's just like, I go in the, on the <laughs> village green outside my house and there's just ghosts just holding onto a tree like do you that. Do you uh, climb up there and get, I get in a, there? I get a brush. Oh. Well, he's I, fine. Oh, OK. Poor thing. He's not. I don't hit him with it. I just t- <laughs> taunt him. That's what it sounds like. To <laughs> back the brush. Oh, anyway. dear. Right, so all I've, I've put the neck bit on. Right. So you want to make sure that when you put that on, you just want it slightly off the end of the... Um, work uh, leave your seam lounge basically yeah yeah and everything it, apart from um this whisker piece like the bottom part of the fo- uh, fox's face i didn't even have to sew anything together i just use the five inch oh, okay so it'll all fit into a five inch yeah. square apart from that yeah bit. and all you do with that is uh, cut two strips sew the ends together which is that seam there yeah and then put your template pieces on it's really easy so this is quite a nice fun quick yeah an easy project to do so I'm just making it up as I there we go but you follow the template do you in the, in the pattern the to template, where you put the yeah. bits yeah obviously I'd like to think I know where all the pits go because I, yeah. I made it but I still, I still check in yeah behind me there we go so if you're new to a plique or any of my patterns, this is a lovely one to start with. Oh, okay. Good beginner one, this one. Yeah. Can you go and tell them to be a bit quieter, please? Mm-hmm. I like the way you've off- offset her a little bit as well, as so she's like, because that's what foxes do. They go like, what's in here? Yeah. Like they're looking through a window going, what's in here? Oh. Yeah, just being inquisitive. Inquisitive, yeah. My nails are too thick. I need to scratch it off. Oh dear. So when are you get them redone, did you say? Oh, I only had them done the other day. Oh, I thought you said you were getting them redone. No, I only had them done the other day. These are. You have um, to be putting your Christmas nails on soon. Oh, I don't do Christmas nails. Oh, I don't. Yeah. I'm not really a Christmassy person. I want about a humbug. No, I do when I get a bit closer. Yeah. I think it's, for, for me, it's all about the boys. Yeah, of course it is. Yeah. 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 Boys, books fizzing for breakfast. And yeah. A, a good roast dinner and and you have all the family around yours it's just you i have done the last two years um but we're actually having it on our own this year which is oh lovely fun. that'd be nice it's gonna be quite nice Wait, so she paint they're going to her cousins and with, that's, with, that's your in-laws yeah, yeah with nick's brother and his partner yeah, and yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. they're all going there so we, it's just going to be me nick and the boys oh nice so i can just chill out in the morning yeah I haven't got to rush around getting everything, you know, and I can actually spend some time with the boys. How early do they wake up to open Father Christmas They've presents? They've got a rule that we don't go downstairs on Christmas Day till seven o'clock. Oh, okay, that's good. Although I might be a bit more relaxed this year because... Well, you're used to getting up at five o'clock now, you see, so... <laughs> well, it's not that, it's because usually I'm getting up and then I'm straight away cooking and... Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, and it's like it's non-stop day. That's why we used to have our Christmas dinner on Christmas Eve night time. Not because we were, like, European or anything like that, but my mum could then not have to run round cooking on Christmas Day. Yeah. So she could get on the gin as soon as she got up, you see, then, rather than, you know, waiting. Yeah, it's just it's 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 just a lot, you know. Yeah. And I think, you know, we've 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 got busy lives and we haven't really spent an awful lot of time Be together. together. Yeah. Uh, so I think, you know, I can get up Christmas morning, they can open their presents. Do they have to get yeah. dressed before they're allowed to no, open their presents? I'm not that mean. No. And uh then we'll have a nice breakfast and yeah. then we're eating out actually oh are you i'm eating out so i haven't got to do any cooking no nice. i mean i love i love cooking but i just think you know that's the whole point of, of us having it on our own mm, so i'm mm. not going to cook we're just going to you go local yeah we're going we're going to stratford I'm oh going, are you yeah i'm going with my best mate as well oh so my best mate and her 
her kids. Yeah, do you want to use my house cooking in my house? I won't be there, I'll be here. Oh yeah, so yeah. we're going to have a party house, a party round your house. party round my house, I wouldn't know, because then I'm going straight up north. So my, yeah, so my best mate Bex. Yeah, who um, took the kids to school this morning. Yeah, she does, she's amazing. I don't know what I'd do without her in my life, if I'm honest. Oh. Um, so her eldest, so her son, Austin, he's in the same class as Charlie, so right. they grew up together, yeah, really. Yeah. And then Iris is a year above Louis, and she's really amazing with... Oh, so you're all going out to have a So nice we're Christmas all going time? out for a meal together, and then when we come home, we'll both go to our own houses and sit and watch Christmas films. Oh, uh, you have to that watch The King at three o'clock? Oh, of, of course, I'll watch The King, although we, we might be out there. You might there. be out, you'll take We can, video. Watch, we can yeah. take it, I'll watch yeah. it on my phone. Because um, it'll be quite prestigious, it'll be quite historical, it'll be it his will first be. one, yeah. won't it? And everyone will be thinking, we've watched The Queen for the last 70 years, so that'll be interesting to watch, won't it? So I'm quite looking forward to that. Nice, oh no, it sounds idyllic. And then I think we might go away at some point. Yeah. You know, just have a break before reset. It all starts again, yeah. Before it all starts again, another busy year ahead next yeah. year, Ho hopefully. Yeah. So. Well, hopefully you'll have your website up and running by then. It's, it's getting there, John. You've been saying it's that since I met there. you. And who's been the person texting you all the time going, is it ready yet? Is it ready yet? I like what you put, the comment you put on my page. Well, yeah. <laughs> she, put on, she put on Facebook that she'd got a website. It's just a landing page. And I just put about blooming time. And then she said once then, that's what Hayley said. That's exactly what Hayley said. Yeah. yeah. So literally just p placing all the pieces so according to your placement guide. Placement yeah. guide. And all you will need out of your stash is a little bit of black, like barely like a three inch square piece just for the nose. You, I mean, you don't have to, but I just like the way it stands yeah, out. Yeah, because if you use the one that you've got there, there's no dark, there's not a dark one that you could possibly use, is there? You know what I mean? They're all of that pale. Yeah, but if you had both. If you've got both, all, everyone's got a bit of black in there, um, yeah. a bit of black fabric in their stash, haven't they? Mm -hmm. uh, John, you never fail to cheer me up. Spend my money, spend my money, and really make me laugh. Oh, Sharon, sorry. Uh, Kath, when we used to go away for, with the family for Christmas, we always had Christmas dinner on Christmas Eve. So, oh, get this, get this, right? So we could go surfing and play cricket on the beach on Christmas Day. Awesome. Were you living in Australia, Kath, or somewhere like that? Have your cats brought you any presents? They bring nothing in. They kill nothing, my cats. They, um, they, 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 even if they're in the garden and the bird, the garden is full of birds, they don't chase them, they don't go after them or anything. I don't know if they, I don't know why. But no, I don't know, they don't bring, I'd rather not because Norman used to bring mice in at night time and drop them on my chest in bed and everything like that. I didn't want, I know. There we go. So there's the face. Lovely, Oh, So when you first start putting it down, don't be put off because it doesn't look like a face to be, you, you know what I no, mean? You you've put your first three or four bits down, you're like, this doesn't look like that. And then when you're happy, you just press, not iron. Yeah. The Aliso iron, which gets lovely and hot here, which you got in the show today. Aliso smart iron. I am the only iron that automatically lifts and lowers with your touch. I'm qu quoting, that's not me, I'm, that's not me saying that. And it's the only iron that I've ever owned that gets hot enough. I yes. haven't got to keep going over well, and over. Well, it's because it. there's all these European rules, because that's an American iron, and right. there's all these European rules about how hot irons can get. Oh, and I bought, I bought one uh, before I got my Aliso. I got one. I thought it was quite, going to be quite a good iron. Yeah. I plugged it in. It was just nowhere near hot enough. No. It's useless. I don't use it, obviously. No. And then I put it, you, the, the little extra tail bit's optional. Oh no, I think it's a definite, you have to put that in. I just think it looks quite cute. So is your Aliso in your workroom then? Always. So Nick doesn't do shirts with it then? Nick doesn't iron at all. Who does his iron in there? Who, me? What's the matter with you? He doesn't iron a shirt. I don't think I've ever known him to iron a shirt. <gasps> no. no. But is he ex-military? No. Oh, he's not? Oh, I thought no. he was. That's why Because my get, dad was ex-military. That's ex -military why he gets me to do it. Yeah. That was, um, I remember having my ironing lesson when I joined up, actually. Yeah, that'd be Ursula's fault for not teaching him how to iron when he was a child. Yeah, just doesn't iron. She watching. Ursula! <laughs> I'm only joking. We've got the wine in the fridge, it's Wednesday. Oh, just Thursday today. <laughs> Thursday today. Thursday today, no wine in the fridge today. So... That's it? That's it, there's your fox. Oh. And then 
you, to sew it down, all I did was go round each bit with a blanket stitch, if it was my favourite, or you can do a zigzag or a straight stitch, whatever you like. Did you put anything behind it? What? I put a bit of 80-20 behind it. Oh, normal, straightforward wadding? Straightforward yeah. wadding, and, uh, but if you've got any wadding will do, you don't have to put anything no, no, no. wadding behind it. Well, no, some people like to put stitch and tear behind, don't they? Some yeah. people like to just put a, a, um, an iron-on interfacing just to give it a little so bit extra. Yeah. yeah, so you can do what you like, so it's up to you how you finish okay. it. But that's the nice and simple one, so I thought I'd show you yeah, that. Yeah, brilliant. But, you know, you can see these nice... Oh, I haven't peeled the backing off that one. OK. It's got a nice uh, let me just uh, tell you then, that was Felicity the Fox. Have we still got Felicity in both colours? Which one have you put in? That one that we're using there. So that's this one with the pale blue background. Then the K... Oh, it's upside down again. K facet beautiful like kind of golds and greens in there uh, and the instructions 29.99 that's one you've just seen uh, being demoed if you want it in the other colorway however you can get it in a darker colorway which is the um, bright uh, turquoise aqua color plus the darker um, K fabrics 29.99 remember you can get four about four foxes out of that you will obviously need more background fabric but we've all got half well, it's not even half a meter it's a fat quarter yeah. for the background 29.99 that's felicity the fox that you've just seen being at uh, demoed okay are we moving on to oliver the owl now then yeah so say it again han oh sorry yeah felicity fox instruction on their own sorry my bad Oh, fewer than 20 of those left once you've all checked out. No, 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 it was my bad, my bad. I was racing along. I'm getting confused by the time because I looked at it and I thought, oh, we've only got five minutes, but obviously we haven't got about 20 minutes, haven't we? Right, and then Oliver the Owl. Um, I'll let Delphine, we'll put, which graphics are you going to put in first? Oh, I think that one's sold out, actually, isn't it? The darker one sold out, so I've only got Oliver the Owl in the colourway that you just saw Felicity the Fox being made in. Twenty nine ninety nine. Both would look stunning there. Yeah, exactly. Or if you want to do your own fabrics, have we got any instructions left? Because they've been very busy. Only just, only just got those left. Nine ninety nine. I think actually, if I have a look at fewer that. than twenty of those. What what? Up, up. But if there's, I think did I add the other picture in? Of me doing it in a few, yeah. So, this is I actually did this before, yeah, this was a while ago, right? And you can see that's me doing it on a dark background in lighter colors. Oh, yes. So, if you did it, if you did that colorway, you know, the orange colorway, yeah, yeah. that on a dark background, that would look like a chocolate brown would be lovely, it would look it? wicked, yeah. that would look really, really cool. So, um, if you do go for that light colorway, and you don't like the, the light background, I'd go it, really yeah. dark. Oh, yeah, definitely. only because it, the owl would be quite, it'd be really dramatic. Yes, yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, no, a pole Z thing, Cornwall is where they went, it was always mild and even sunny. Anyone would think I've been on the gin already, she said. Well, nothing wrong with that. Viv says maybe they're vegetarian too. What, the cats? Oh, yeah, the cats, they could be. Well, no, no, because they, they love their four o'clock fish treats. They have these very expensive fish in a sachet at four o'clock. And if I haven't got it out by four o'clock, they're both like, um, like this. Where's the fish treats then? Have we still got rulers behind here? Am I like? Oh, I don't know. Watch it doesn't fall on top of you. I wasn't anywhere near it. You all right? Yeah. Is that big enough? Yeah. What do you need a ruler for? I'm going to cut up some fabric. Oh, OK. In fact. Oh. So this is, uh, I just want to show another way if you, because obviously these pieces are bigger. Yeah. And I quite like sewing up, sewing together random strips of fabric to create the final Right, piece. like you were saying earlier. Yeah. So I'm just going to show you what I mean. And you can use any width, you can change the width. I did a workshop a while, um, not so long ago, yeah. where we did it in this method. And um, it was really cool. People were like doing some in just tiny little strips, adding in a thin strip of like only a quarter of an inch. And it looked really nice. Oh, uh, 9 that's the instructions on their own for Oliver the Owl. Oh, it's not for Oliver. Oliver didn't make it to the uh, graphics. Just Delphine Brooks Owl. <laughs> so yeah, you just keep sewing together pieces of fabric until it covers your template piece. 
Say that again, hand sorry. So I've got all my other pieces cut out. I just yeah. wanted to show you what I mean. So these are all different prints, but from the same collection. But you don't feel that you have to do it all like that. You might have some of your own that you might want to yeah, add yeah, it. Because yeah. it will still work. This method mm -hmm. always works just with random fabrics. How long have I got left? About how long? About 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Oh, lovely. Is that all right? Mm hmm Then I'll, if there's anything left, I'll do a roundup of what's, uh, what's left. Talk to me. OK. My uh, talk back keeps cutting out, so I don't know who's talking to me. I don't know I can manage. But I um, don't know who's talking to me. No, I can hear you saying that, Hannah. <laughs> one day Delphine you should have uh, talk back and you can just hear what they rubbish they talk down our ears <laughs> I can sometimes hear it well yeah most people at home can hear it yeah. as well uh, what's the matter Hannah She's going on holiday this week anyway, she doesn't care. Oh, where are you going? She's going to Amsterdam Ooh, next week. Next lovely. Week. And then she's back and then she goes off to Iceland. Oh, fantastic. Next year, next year. Hi all. This is Francis from Orkney. <coughs> and I'm watching you with my friend Anne from Shetland. Together by phone. Love these, trying to decide which one. Francis, get them both. Hang on, I'm Francis from Orkney, and I'm watching you with my friend Anne from Shetland. Oh, I see, so you're both watching, but you've got your phone going at the same time, going, oh, look what she's doing with that bit of fabric. Oh, Anne, isn't that lovely? Yes, did, uh, Francis, it's lovely. That is that what you're doing? I don't know. But thank you for watching. And thank you for getting in touch. What have you done there? Oh, you put your bond web on the back. So I've put my pattern piece on the back. So I've ironed all my strips together. Yeah. Whenever you do this, though, uh, press your seams open because it reduces the bulk when you come to sew it down. Yeah. And then I'm sort of cut it out. You can use a rotary cutter or you can use scissors. I'm just. What's the matter? Nothing. You can cry it again. I always worry. I'm just <laughs> watching a master at work. Oh, I wouldn't go that far. Oh yes, here we go. Sorry if I've asked before, but what is Delphinius's selling policy? Uh, Delphinius's. <laughs> if you put, if you put that, they are her designs. Out. Oh, Lucy, what's your what's your um, angel policy? Uh, as long as uh, yeah, so make to sell, make you know, make them for craft fairs or for you know friends, charities, charities. Churches. You can even make them and sell them on Etsy as long as you say that, that it's my pattern. Oh, that's what she asked. That's what that, that's what as she long, asked. As long as you yeah. just say it's my pattern, then and you know, all we ask is that you don't hand the pattern to other people no, because obviously that's no. where, as a designer, Delphine makes her money by selling patterns. Yeah. and I don't mean to be crass about it or anything like that, but if you buy one pattern. And then you photocopy and give it to all your friends and everything. It means Delphine has done all that work and she only gets paid, obviously, for the amount of patterns she sells and things. That's all we ask. And the same with every old designers, you know what I mean? If somebody's designed a quilt and you photocopy it and pass it on, it's just a bit unfair, isn't it, really? Yeah, and it's, yeah, it's got to be... But, but you're happy for people to make as... As Absolutely. long as you're not like John Lewis's and you want to make 10,000 to put in all your stores, she's happy to work with you, but not for free. Yeah, so John Lewis, if you would like to... Uh... Yeah. <laughs> There we are. So, and there's a pattern piece. Right, and what bit's that then? That bit. It's muzzle. This bit. Oh, I see. So in that one, you used all the same fabric, but you still yeah. did you still get together in strips? Yeah. I but you used all exactly the same fabric. They're for slightly it, different shades. Oh yes, 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 yeah. But you used that like, kind of crisscrossy yeah. one, yeah. So now I'm going to lay all the pieces on. Right. How do you know where to start? Oh, because you've got the, the thing behind it with all the, um, where yeah. it should all be. I've got my placement guide here. And my placement guide's all colour coded as well. Right. So, well, I'll say I did it. Nick did it. He's very clever. Oh. So make more of a mess.
There we go. Yeah. Chuck that in there. So that goes about there. In fact, I'm going to turn this around. That's that's better. I haven't got to wiggle it around too much then. Right. That one's there. Let me just got to be careful I don't lose anything. You know what I'm like. I'll, yeah. I'll lose an eyeball or something. Um, not your own, obviously. <laughs> so I prepped this a few days ago, so I'm just like, what did I use for that piece? And um, have you settled into your she shed now then? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I love it. It's... Do you know, it's been an absolute game changer for how I work. Well, you don't have to get the kitchen hand. table or anything out, do you? No, it's... Oh, I love it. Yeah, I wouldn't be without it now. Oh. Yeah, it's been... I've been in there a while now, for that, I think. Yeah. So, yeah. But sometimes it takes a while, doesn't it, get used to a new space and everything. Because yeah. you don't know where everything is. And once you've settled into it, you know you can put your hand on anything, can't you, then? Pretty much. And I'm quite pleased that there's not too many creepy crawlies because obviously I was worried about it being in the garden I was worried about having creepy crawlies it's only the same as your dining room it's got a French window into the you know like into the garden or whatever yeah. so it's only the same as that isn't it yeah <laughs> oh. is it's it? got three walls yeah it hasn't got any outside thingy is it yeah what's it mean it's like, yeah. only like part of your house yeah you're funny you are she's not she's not convinced is she yeah I uh, know or do you think they're coming from the garage I worry about the garage because our neighbours have oh. got like really overgrown, so Nick's had to cut some of the hedge back, and it's right. all because it's a double garage, but it's got all the cobwebs on that side of the garage. Oh, I don't go it? in the garage. Nick would have a woman hiding in there, and I wouldn't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't go in there. <laughs> you can't say that. Well, you know, you know. Okay. I don't go in there. You can have anything hiding in all there. All right then. He's all motorbikes. Right. Yeah. So he yeah. hides them in don't there. Don't go on the motorbike. Not now, we used to. Oh. I used to go on the back. Yeah. What's it called? There's a name for it. Side right. <laughs> What's it called? What's it called when you go on the back of a bike? Well, no, no, it's <laughs> my friend Koki, who's older than you are. She and her husband have just went all around Norway on theirs. Yeah, I, I, I've, I've toyed with the idea of having it, you it's know. It's a bit difficult when you've got two kids, I suppose. Cause I, well, it's that, really, because Nick used to have two motorbikes. He used to do a lot of enduros. In what? And Joros, like races and stuff. Oh, okay. And um, I used to go and do his petrol, and mark the car. You're the girl in the, in the little um, boiler suit, and you like that. What are those called? Lap girls, like that. Really? <laughs> you see something? What? <laughs> what are they called? The girls in the pit stop girls. The you pit know, the, stop yeah. girls, yeah. But no, I, no, I didn't, John. Okay. <laughs> Pillion is what the word you're looking for, is it? No, she doesn't look no. Uh, probably. Viv, she's not saying things. Sue, she's not saying. Kath, she, everyone thinks it's pillion. Probably. I'm, I don't know. But uh, no, we used to, but not for a while. Oh, well, I guess I was thinking of a horse, wasn't I? Side saddle. That's what I was thinking of. Oh. In your Edwardian walking skirt or riding skirt. You see, at the moment, you can't, I can't tell what that is. No, you will in a minute. I know. I trust you. And I don't trust many people. Okay. It will come together in a sec. Yeah, we'll, talk, <laughs> say, we'll talk about that later. So that bit... Oh, bang, bang. Oh, it's you, not Bruce, today. Yeah. That bit goes... There. So I'm looking at my own drawing here. There we go. <laughs> it was a while ago when I d designed this one, so. You've got lots of new projects on the go. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Got some really exciting ones, yeah. So uh, I think one of them I think we're we'll bringing next time I'm on, actually. Oh, okay. Do you know what that date that is then? I think it's the 11th. Of November? Yeah. I think it is. 11th of November. Do you want me to get Hannah to check? Well, I think it's the 11th of November. 11th of November. Is Delphine in that day? She'll check. She'll look at the wrong month to start with. And this pattern? On that day. Oh, you've got a dreadful presenter that day. 
I've got you. Yeah. <laughs> Not sure I like the quickness of that answer. <laughs> well, no, because you're not going to be mean about anyone else, are you? No. Oh, so you oh, we've got Jules Fallon on that day as well. It's all the Stratford oh, wow. girls. Oh, wicked. Oh, that'd be nice. And who? Oh, and it's Remembrance Day as well. Oh, so is it? Oh, no, it won't be a project for Remembrance Day because you've done that already. I've done it? that already, but yeah. I think... Um, it's themed. Yeah. So will we pause at 11? Yes. Yeah. It's what? Delphine's on to be confirmed. Oh, you're to, to be confirmed, apparently. Oh, well, what have I done? <laughs> oh, that'll be projects to be confirmed. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Projects, yes. Yeah. yeah. I know what they mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So we'll, we'll, we'll need to get some black fabric for this as well, then, as, for yeah, the eyes. Yes, just because it's all about the eyes. It's it is. It is. That immediate, as soon as you put that on, it automatically, you know, makes it come alive, doesn't it? Look. Yeah, Bruce is going to see Giant in a minute. It's going to fly off the page. Yeah. Bruce. I thought Eric taught you everything you knew. Sorry, I'm fiddling. That's all right. Look at that. Isn't that incredible? Had just putting the two eyes on just brings the whole thing together, doesn't it? Oh, like his hair, his hair's a bit like mine, isn't it? And then, once you're happy with it, you sew it down, but I want to show you the extra details oh, okay. that I put on that I think really makes it... So did you sew it down again with, what stitch did you use? But I always, I always use a blanket, blanket stitch. Blanket stitch, right. Uh, with a, I think I used a variegated thread right. for this one. And then, if I get this one down. Yeah. So that's. And then you, I really wanted to have a play on the white of the eyes. Right. So the first one I've done, I've, done, I've given you the, uh, the instructions of both, the images of both, of me doing this by hand and by machine. Oh, okay. So the, other, the one in the uh, instructions, I did all of this white bit. I don't know if you can see it all along yeah, here yeah, with yeah, the feathers can, yeah, yeah. and all along there that i did with the machine right and the images i did on the other one that have in the instructions i did by hand but just a little play on the hair of the owl i think it just ties it all in really nicely yeah yeah you got close-ups yeah excuse me close-ups of it in here fantastic and then also just on both the fox and the owl, if you just add a tiny little, I do this on all of my applique projects, if you just add in a tiny little white of the eyes, it just makes them sparkle a bit mm. more. Gorgeous. Is that it you're done now then? Well, Till the 11th can, of November. Can, no, it's fine. Oh, I'm not done, I've got, I've got, yeah, busy. I've got to make it all yet for the 11th. No, no, I meant that you're done for today. Because I can round uh, up. Do you want, you want me to be done for yeah. today? Okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you want to send you Christmas. No. Uh, no, she hates <laughs> Christmas, not Christmas. <laughs> right, what have we got left then? We've got very little left to show you. Right, so. Oliver the Owl has sold out in that colourway, but we've still got in this one, which is the one where you saw Felicity made out of. 29.99, but there's enough fabric in here to do... F oh, no, hang on. The owl takes more, doesn't it? How many owl's faces could I do, do you reckon, out of there? I'll probably say about three. Oh, there you go. So you can still do three faces out of that. Uh, you'll need, other, obviously, more background fabric because that's just enough there to do. But this is, this is half a metre, isn't it? How big is that square? Uh, I did them. This was just left over. It, you'll use a 16-inch. If you ah, That's worth pointing out. I did the centre square 16-inch square. Yeah. But then I added a little border around. Right, so you're going to get two out of this then? Yes. So I, I, all I, I was only ha I only had half a metre. That, but that's when you get half a metre. So you could either yeah. put the back of the cushion yeah. if you're making one, or you could make two using that as your two fronts. Yeah, because yeah. that's all I've done. I was I basically had a kit, and I've made all this yeah. with one kit. One kit. Right, okay. Yeah. So that's Oliver the Owl in the paler colour. That Not paler, more um, yellows and greens. The yellows and greens, basically. If you want the instructions on their own of Oliver the Owl, you can have the instructions on their own of Oliver the Owl. Only 19 more you can do though. Okay, so that's Oliver the Owl. Then we also had uh, Felicity the Fox. 
Now in the cut this colorway here that you saw being done, or the colorway she's in up there, the blues and the greens with the pale blue, $29.99. Now, we think you can get four fox faces out of yeah, this, Yeah, easily, if not more. He if not more. So yeah. think of that, that, you know, how value for money, it's brilliant. And you've still got the instructions forever. So whenever you need to make one in a different colorway for anybody or anything like that, you've got them there. $29.99. Now, we still got Felicity Fox in the brighter blue as well. Yeah. Felicity Fox in the brighter blue with the darker purples. $29.99. And then you get the brighter blue, the aqua at the background of that one. So that's Felicity Fox. Then we've got Felicity Fox on uh, an envelope. This is instructions on its own. $9.99. We also have instructions only now because these sold out, the wall hanging sold out with who you saw within seconds of starting. First one, Oakley the Owl, instructions only. $9.99 and then Felix the Fox wall hanging not cushion now this should be way more than $9.99 look at all the, the instructions here are incredible they've got all the colour and everything oh sold out sold out well there you go bye yeah. thank you <laughs> see you well if you don't see you before see you on the 11th uh, hopefully see you before because we need to catch up don't we yes Yes. I guess the barn, or I'll come to the sausage sandwich. Yeah. I can't remember what's the place called that we go to for the sausage sandwich. The garden shed. The what? <laughs> we go to the garden shed. The garden shed? Is that what it's called? Yeah. I didn't know. It's not in a garden, is it? It's on a roundabout, isn't it? It's on a main road. Anyway, we've got to go, because I've got to be back in four minutes okay. uh, with Christmas fabrics. Do not go anywhere. Thank you, Delphine. I'll see you in four. Mike's Are out. you a fan of Sewing Street? Why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing community. See you there! Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one PNP all day. Sewing Street customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Follow Sewing Street on Facebook and Instagram to keep up to date with what's coming up on the show, as well as being the first to know about our amazing offers. Get involved with our competitions that are exclusive to social media. And pick up some top tips from us too. Miss the live show? Don't worry, we recorded it for you. Never miss out on your favourite presenters, guests and makes ever again. Head on over to our YouTube pages to watch back the day's live show and enjoy your favourite demos over and over again. Subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you never miss a show or video ever again. Keep up to date with what's on Sewing Street as well as all the latest news and special offers by signing up to our email newsletters. Head on over to www.sewingstreet.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, type in your email address, click the envelope, and you're done. 
never miss out on the latest news and special offers ever again. Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 4433. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals, and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one P&P all day. of Sewing Street, why not join our growing Facebook fans pages? Just search Sewing Street Fans on Facebook and click Join Group. Never miss out on the latest news and updates from our presenters and guest designers, special offers and plenty of chat with your fellow fans. Share photos of your makes, ask for advice, interact with your favourite guests and presenters and be a part of the ever-growing sewing community. See you there! If you're a Sewing Street customer, no matter how many times you check out in one day, you will only pay one postage and packaging. So don't wait to add the item you want to your basket and check out. You will only pay one PMP even if you check out multiple times in one day. Sewing Street have our very own app. You can now watch and shop from anywhere. Simply download the app from your app store onto your smartphone or tablet, then log in or create an account and you're done. You can watch us live from anywhere, browse all our recently played items and pre-orders so you never miss out on any show deals and message the studio to say hello at any time. And remember, you can check out as many times as you want and only pay one P&P all day. Christmas fabrics, Christmas fabrics, they're gorgeous. I haven't seen some, that's lovely. I've not seen some of these before. Beautiful. I've got the Daxon going like that, but I'll show you that in a minute. Right, so I've got these X-ray backings, Christmas X-ray backings. Uh, which one first, my lovely? Navy, navy. There we go. Look at this, look at this, look at this. The thing is, right, you don't have to use it as um, a quilt backing. You could use it for all sorts of things for Christmas, couldn't you? Because look, oh, a tablecloth. If you want a big tablecloth, 12 99 it's first frost, navy extra wide backing fabric, 274 centimetres. Look at this, watch this, right, ready? Look. Look, you see all of that? Loads and loads, that's beautiful. I'll pop it down so you can see the pattern. Gift bags, little Christmas, oh, you can make Christmas dresses for the family. Christmas waistcoats for the family. If you see, at the Paver family, they all, all the ladies wear the same dress on Christmas day. So they could make them all out of this. 12 pound 99, Bruce says he's thinking of doing that. Well, it depends how many people you're inviting around, Bruce. Oh, okay, well, you won't need one then. 12 99. Twelve ninety nine, twelve pounds and ninety nine pence. Beautiful, gorgeous, quilting weight. Oh my kitty aunt! These ear, these ear pieces are so sensitive, and Hannah's just sneezed right the way down it, but not like a little delicate lady sneeze, like a proper 
That was not a lady sneeze. That was a great big builder sneeze, that one. Anyway, let's move on because I've got this one also in black. Yep. Well, the, um, the, the girl on um, Married at First Sight, she's a lady builder, isn't she? Here you go, 12 99 the black one, black and white. I love it because it's still got little tinges of lilac and lavender in there as well. So it's not just straightforward black and white. 12 99 for half a metre, you buy it off the bolt. You can have as much or as little as you want as long as it's in increments of half a metre and you'll pay £12.99 for each half a metre. First Frost, it's called. First Frost. Oh, the black one's about to sell out. Black one's going to sell out today. So if you've got it in your basket, make sure you check out. I'll just read in the... Um, whoop, I'll read in it, the television. Right, next. Pre-cuts. Mode of Warm Wishes 10-inch charm pack. Oh, okay then. There's so many people got this in their basket already. I'll show you the corner. Oh, uh, 39.99, that's not right. 10-inch charm packs are 40, about £47 now. Anyway, I won't get it out. I'll just show you the corners of the fabrics. It's beautiful. You've got your lovely fur green. Oh, uh, one left, one left, one left, one left. Oh, it's beautiful. It shouldn't be 39.99. That's for certain. Oh, sold out. I'll just put that one back. Beautiful. Is it a what, 10 inch charm pack? Yep. Yep, Christmas morning. I've only got single figures on this one. Yes, I had something falling over and hit me on the leg. Never mind. Christmas morning. I'll suffer. Uh, it's still quite sore. I got bitten by something yesterday, but it's got two, whatever it was, it's got two fangs because there were two definite holes in it. Here we go. So you've got holly with the white berries and you've got mistletoe with the red berries. You've got dots. Oh, that's nice. That's like a quilt pattern of its own, that one, isn't it? You've got chevrons, silhouette flowers, holiday peace. Oh, come let us adore him. The bells are ringing, deck the hall. All is calm, all is bright. Then we've got, do you wonder why I don't get asked to go carol singing? Um, uh, stripes. And then your other stripes. And you've got that lovely silhouette one there. There's the, there's the songs again. Spots, stripes. Look. Oh, look. I thought those were strawberries then. Oh, look at that. That's lovely, isn't it? Why are these 39.99? Might be a spider bite, says Carol. Carol, it happened in here. It, Carol, it happened during, don't tell Delphine. She's terrified of spiders. It happened mid-show here. I felt it go like that. Then I looked at my hand and it was all, it's who here? Um, oh yeah. Oh no, I'm not Spider-Man. Here we go. Or did you do it like that? I don't know, that way or that way. Right. Red, Holly. Now that's not on there, that one hand. Now you're getting two songs muddled up now. You're getting a song from Les Miserables that they sing at the end of Act One up with a Tommy Steele song then. Beautiful Christmas morning. Lella Boutique from Moda, 39.99. Right, which one? Oh, Red Barn. Yeah, cause I've, oh, yes. Now, I think I've got a design roll to match this one. Mm-hmm. $39.99. Brilliant price. Brilliant price. £10 off a 10-inch charm pack. $29.99. You've got 40 pieces. I love it. Love it. Love it. Look. So there you've got the, um, oh, I don't know what that, they must be different kinds of Christmas trees. Beautiful.
Look, beautiful. Oh, look, I wonder what that, are they bird houses, do you think, or churches? Oh, barns, because it's called Red Barn. <laughs> but they're not American barns. No, they're not. American barns have that funny shaped roof like it, like that. You ask Cindy. Yeah. Labels. The Christmas Red Barn Party. No, I've not been invited either. Plaid. Herringbone. Look at the price. Twenty nine ninety nine. Excuse me. There's four left. Four left red barns. <laughs> John, you're such a ray of sunshine. I don't know where my head would be without Sewing Street from Michelle. Oh, Michelle, you're very kind. I just come in and shout, that's all I do. And then I get told off at one o'clock. I get called up to the office and get told off. They can't tell me off today because it's their day off today. There's nobody in today. I've got to go and film a thing though afterwards for, um, what's it now? Yeah, Alan, tall Alan's filming a thing for Amber Makes. I've got to film after the show today. Two left, two left. You make my day, you're so cheerful, says Pauline. Oh, you're very kind to me, thank you so much. I can't buy enough cut velvet for my curtains. Will you be restocking it or is it one off? Oh, so. Some lines are completely sold out. I know Hayley's onto it, so maybe she's ordering some more. When did she say she might be able to do it again? Don't know if we're going to get more in by then. Well, we'll f I'll ask. Oh, she's not upset. She's day off. Day off. Okay, moving on. Red Barn Design Roll. I've got this one open here for you already. You've seen all the fabrics. You've just seen them in there. This is how yours will arrive. Uh, 39.99. Nah. Nah. I don't know why you do it. You, who do you think you are, Ben? <laughs> 29.99 you just don't buy design rolls for 29.99 hannah they're not in don't worry they're all off today oh no 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 uh, jess is in and that we got a new schedule have you seen oh, oh i did oh i didn't get an email might maybe it's stuck in that lot that you got oh i didn't get that i met her yesterday here we go the gorgeous fabrics 29.99 What do you mean? <laughs> Didn't. <laughs> Beautiful. Gorgeous. Single figures on that one. That's how yours arrive. It won't arrive looking like that. Single figures. Do have your vacuum cleaner around when you open a des design roll or a jelly roll because it's very fluffy. Okay, lovely. Something I've not seen yet. Hannah's house. That could be one thing. No. All right. One, two, three, four. This is the pile I just picked up. I've never seen these before. Jason Yenta, Christmas. Thank you very much. Right, I need to say something. Yeah, but look. Isn't that lovely? It's only they call that lollipop when it go, does that. What's Bruce going on about? Look. Six fabrics from Jason Yenta. Christmas. 47.94. It's called Winter Blooms. I've got each of these fabrics by the half metre. $47.94. What's Bruce going on about? You can tell Bruce is going on his holidays in 25 minutes. He called me Spider-Man earlier. And now he's talking about another superhero now. Not Hannah. Oh, he was saying, talk about Hannah. She's an anti-superhero, he said. What, like an Auntie Joyce, you mean? 47.94, I can do these by the half metre. 
Anyone in particular? Oh, the striped one. <laughs> Here we go. You can get this by all of these by the half meter now. There you go. I love this one. Look. Uh, table runner, if you like. Uh, or a skirt, Christmas tree skirt. Seven ninety nine for half a metre. Hundred percent cotton, quilting weight. Jason Yenta designer fabrics, winter blooms. That's that one. Anyone in particular going to follow me? HP UQ twelve. That's like the other one, but without the stripes. You see. But look at the detail that's gone on into there. Gone on. Gone into there. Well, one gone on. Seven ninety nine. That's not a Christmas song. Where there's no little boxes on it. Right. Okay. Look at the set. Right. Hannah thinks that that looks like a window, and she thinks I'm in an attic, and I'm going to climb out and go onto a roof and sing Chim Chim Mini Chim Chiru. And these are the brushes for cleaning things. If you saw Becky leaving, right, you know we have the little trolleys, right? Becky was just leaving at the end of her hand. She put a trolley and suddenly the whole set was moving and she'd got all of this, all of this was all caught in her wheels. But look, you can see where she's just chopped it off. Anyway, uh, next one, I like this one as well. Uh, ZXUQ78. <gasps> oh, that's classy, that one. Oh! It's not available by the half metre, sold out. That's why. It's only in the bundle. Well, you better tell me which ones you've got then. Yeah, Holly. Ending 27. This is lovely. So, hang on. In, uh, all his fabrics called In the Beginning. Winter Blooms from Jason Genta In the Beginning Fabrics. They must be up. We always call that one going, oh, is this from the In Beginning range? But they're all in the beginning. Anyway, seven ninety nine for half a metre. What are you going to do with this one? Serviettes, napkins. Uh, 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 a little bit on a telephone. Uh, do people have telephone tables anymore? A, a table in an entrance hall. Right, I've got two left now. Seventy six. Or, but it hasn't got a telephone on it. Seventy six. You haven't got a hall. So how have you got a table in your hall if you've not got a hall? Seven ninety nine holly mistletoe Christmas rose. Isn't that called a healy bore? Aren't they healy bores? Hella but hella bores. I got taught this last week, didn't I? Lovely. I fold that one away. And then last but not least, sixty five. This are poinsettias, this one. He's gone for all the traditions, hasn't he, with this? I don't know what the blueberries are. A blueberry smoothie or blueberry and muffin for your breakfast. Gorgeous. Beautiful. The bundle is here. Now, this lovely green fabric in the middle, this one, is only available now in the bundle. There you go. Six fabrics, £47.94. Only three bundles left. That's it. Gorgeous. Fat quarter packs. Uh, I haven't got any stripes. Oh, yeah, there, there you go. I haven't got any numbers, you see. So um, It's red and cream stars and stripes. Stars and snowflakes, even. Stars. Snowflakes. Stripes. Stars. Snowflakes. Twelve ninety nine, five fat quarters. They feel a little bit. Um, 
They're 100% cotton. No, they're good quality cotton, but they've got a dressing on them. You might want to wash them, rinse them through by hand first, just to get rid of it. It depends. If you want them kind of like with that stiffness to them, then that's fine. 12 99 That's that one. For five fat quarters. Tartan now. Oh, now these feel different again. Here we go. Oh, now. Oh, now. Um... Alison Marion, Marion Alison uses these for one of her, some of her Christmas projects. There you go. You get your five fat quarters Christmas tartan. Beautiful. Twelve ninety nine. Got to get a move on. Which one's next? Yeah. <laughs> No, but that one's all red. So these are all cream. Get You get your electric Christmas trees, your ginger Christmas... Ginger? Sparkly Christmas trees, your Merry Christmas, your sparkly Christmas trees and your baby Christmas trees in that one. All on the natural tones. Pretty, isn't it, that one? Uh, 12 99 for five fat quarters again. Add it to your order. Remember, you only pay one P&P for the whole day. And then last but not least, we've got the red... Red swirls. There you go. Red swirls. Oh, I suddenly got divided into three then. Yes. Did you not see it? There were three of me then. Okay, so you get the red swirl. You get your holly. You get your star. You get another holly and a snowstorm. Be lovely if snowstorms were like that gold, wouldn't they? Beautiful, twelve ninety nine for those five fat quarters. Okay, next. On white background or green. Oh, it's the same collection, right? Here we go. So one, two, three, four in this one. Yeah, two bundles, one with green backgrounds, one with cream backgrounds. This is the green background one. Uh, it's from Modar, this, Green Poinsettia Plaza. Oh, she said pizza, I fancy a pizza. I won't have a pizza for my tea tonight, though. I wonder what I should have for my tea tonight. What are you having tonight, Hannah? No, I don't know. Either. Paisley, Poinsettia, berries, more berries. 29.96, I might have to make a new soup. Oh no, I'll wait for my soup books to arrive. I've ordered two soup books. What? Well, I, 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 did, lots, I, I did one with onion, potato, leek and carrot in it. And it was delicious, but very basic. And I kind of want some exciting ones. Like if you do asparagus, do you just put asparagus and onion and water in? Is that all you put in? I don't know, you see. I don't know. Anyway, that's the green one. Pumpkin soup. Oh, that's the pumpkin that you cut up for your house. Oh, okay. No. This is nice. I don't know if I know what pumpkin tastes like. Cream. Poinsettias. Oh, well, I use butternut squash all the time. Is that from the same kind of family? Oh, Pauline's having stew and dumplings for her tea. I can't have that, you see, unless it's a vegetable stew. And I can't have dumplings because they've got suet in them. So that's no, I can't come round to yours, Pauline, I'm afraid, tonight. 29 96 for your four cream ones there. Um, Kat, I might be moving on to this desk in a minute, just so you know. Right, next. Oh, those. Oh, sorry, that's my bad. The green ones and the cream ones. Paisley first, yeah. Paisley on cream or, oh, hang on, which one? Oh, I've got number. Yeah, cream, yeah, 38, got that here, yeah, brilliant. These are brand new, these are gorgeous, aren't they? 749, for half a metre, it's Modar. Isn't that lovely, very traditional, very, very traditional. You don't have to use that at Christmas. Charlie'd like that all year round. I feel like I haven't seen Charlie for months. 
Oh, June's having crab linguine. Ugh. Sounds a bit posh, crab linguine, doesn't it? You going out to catch the crabs yourself? You no, know, she lives on the seaside. She lives on the seaside. She's got and get them in the pools. Go, 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 you catch them in the crab pools. I don't know. I don't eat crabs. That's fine. Ugh. Anyway, moving on to the other one. <laughs> Oh no, it's red, 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 red. I'm getting confused. Poinsettia Plaza, this one's called, in Paisley in red. I'm just going to have to scratch me in one minute. Lovely. Very rich, isn't it? Oh, you can get vegetarian to it, apparently. Oh, so that's a Maureen and Sue. Oh, there you go. June says she caught them fresh this morning. Oh, not by me. Caught fresh this morning, but not by me. Ooh, no, thank you. Next. It's all right. Love my soup maker. Parsnip, apple and honey is yummy. Yeah, but I need to know the... Um, it's all very well saying parsnip, apple, but I don't know how much of each to put in, you see. On cream. Yeah, big point set is on cream. I'm just a bit worried I'm not going to fit my stripology in, that's all. I'm going to have pot noodle on mashed potato, says Carol. That's an unusual... <laughs> that's an unusual dish, Carol. Pot noodle on mashed potato. I used to have boiled eggs, mayonnaise and mashed potato mixed together. I was like, no, it's when I first went to college. So I was 20, 19, 20. No, I don't remember pot mash. I remember pot rice. Remember pot rice. Okay, moving on. I've got that one on green. Yeah. Uh, so we're, am I going to Gemini or Stripology next? Okay. Okay. Yeah, I need, just need to cut in that cat, please. There you go. £7.49. £7.49. I don't know what Delphine did with hers. Beautiful. Oh, hang on. The cat's just down here. <laughs> Stay there. Okay, I'll just see the folding of the fabric. Is that one big enough for the stripology to fit on? Right, here we go. Back in stock. Stay there. Back in stock, back in stock, back in stock. I'll just show it to you, actually. Right, I'll take it from under this then. Stripology ruler, back in stock, back in stock, back in stock. This is where if you've got to cut a lot of squares, a lot of uh, strips. If you're doing a Bargello, anything like that, this is going to take 69.99. Now, I've seen this for sale elsewhere for way more than that. Um, so you can do... Uh, half inch, one inch, two and a half inch, whatever street you want to. But you can also square off on it as well. You can do squares. You've got your angles on here. You've got your, um, if you want to square off by the solid inch, they're the black ones there or the white ones there. Uh, 69.99 is how much this will cost you. Very, now when you get yours, it'll be all beautifully wrapped up. And in, uh, on it, there's got a little brochure. I don't know what I've done with it now. Sorry, I'm being really pathetic now. There you go. When you get yours, it comes like wrapped like this, and it has this um, this uh, brochure in it there, which tells you how to use it. You can also go to the Creative Gribs website to watch how it's used and everything like that. But it's so easy. You literally just line up your fabric. Oops. You line up your fabric like this. I'll just do it folded over. And then you, li you line the fold up with a straight line on your mat like that. Line it up with a solid line on there. Like that, like that, like that. And then you just get your um, rotary cutter and you zero it off there. Then if you need to do two and a half inch strips, you can do two and a half inch strips. Two and a half, five. But it tells you, it tells you exactly 
where you need to cut and then if you look here you just take away your excess there oh oh was nearly right there you go the blade in this needs changing but look you've got your two and a half inch strips along here perfect every time make sure you use a rotary cutter that's got a sharp blade in it that one hasn't 69.99 but did i see a did i see a price comparison price comparison um is that the same thing how much is it 96 pounds and 18 pence I've only got half a picture on there as well. There it is, there it is. Yeah, 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 it's fine. It's exactly the same. There you go. It's in stock, £96. Whoa, that's a brilliant price comparison, isn't it? Brilliant price comparison, that one. Um, so you can use it to do all sorts of things like that. You go and look at the YouTube, um, uh, the Creative Grids website anyway, and there's all the YouTubes on there and everything, because you can do it to do squares, you can do it to um, triangles, you can do all sorts of things, diamonds, everything like that on here. Beautiful. You can use it if you're left-handed or right-handed. And it's 69.99. What else can I tell you? Square off your blocks. The black ones there are your solid numbers. And then the white ones are your half-inch numbers. So you can square off blocks on this and everything like that. Trimming. Half-inch size blocks. You can do it left-handed or right-handed. Uh, make sure you've got a decent rotary cutter. You've got your little pair uh, teardrops here, so that you blade because you start cutting. Put your fabric up there. Start cutting here, so your blades in, ready to go. Oh, right from the start. Say that again. Right, the rotary cutters you shouldn't use is that one that I had there. Don't use a rotary cutter that blade comes out when you push it down. It needs to be a rotary cutter where the blade is already out and you can slice it along. That one there is one that you press it down and the blade comes out, I think. Uh, but you can, use, uh, I, you can use all rotary cutters with it as long as they're not one of those ones that you press and the blade pops out when you press it. One that where you put a handle in or your blade, you push your little thing up like that and the blade's out. You can use all those. But again, like I say, you can use it left-handed or right-handed. £69.99. Back in stock, back in stock, back in stock. Message on my bottom. John, I have pot noodle sandwiches for lunch sometimes. Hannah, please invite John to your house. Jules from South Wales. Uh, Julian Monmouth. Uh, first of all, how do you make a pot noodle sandwich without your bread going soggy? Because isn't pot noodle wet? Isn't pot noodle a thing where you have a pot and you pour water in it and then it's wet? Or does the, does the thing... I don't know. Pot noodle sandwiches. Do they do vegetarian ones or gluten-free ones? I don't want to go to a house. It's fine. It's fine. I'm not bitter. Not twisted. Oh, okay. Let's do tomorrow's menu and then I'll show you the, the deals from today. Here's the menu for tomorrow. Uh, is it me tomorrow? Yes, yeah, it is me tomorrow. Oh, now it's a bit of a change tomorrow. So, 8 till 8.30, it's Liberty Fabric. A new collection. New collection. Okay, then at 8.30 till 9, we're doing the Holly Walk bag with Lucy. Then from 9 till 10, we're doing the Leicester bag with Lucy. Then at 10 o'clock, we're doing homeware kits. Oh, we'll have to look at the trolley. I don't know what that means. Then at 11 o'clock, we're doing the Crownway Shopper with Lucy. Then at 12 o'clock, we're doing tools. Tools at 12. Add some adjuster forms as well. We won't be moving the table. Uh, Anyway, that's right. But, 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 I've got to remind you about this. I've got to remind you about this. I've got to remind you about this. This deal, right? This deal is flying out. Absolutely flying out, right? So, the Gemini machine will normally cost you $179.99 on normal day. And what you get with that is it automatically comes with these. You get your two plates to make the sandwich. You get your cutting plate. You get your shim. You get your magnetic sheet. And you get your embossing sheet. All of that... Comes to 179.99, uh, split pair 59.99. However, today uh, we've got this bundle where you get, and that's worth 239 pounds, six pounds and 96 pence. Two, three, six, nine, six. She's not, she's not agreeing with me. Uh, you get uh, the, um, Two, three, six, nine, six. Thank you. Eventually, Karen Lewis. Uh, that's the Catherine wheel. Now, in this in this pattern here, there's a pattern for a quilt, a bag, and a wall hanging. 
You also get this one for like, so like Hawaiian quilting, that isn't it? Uh, with your pineapple. Then you also get this die here, which has got the uh, ribbons. Plus, you get some embossing details. I'll show you the slide. There it is. All of that. Now, how many have I got left? Well, here's the thing. 14 not checked out. Oh, okay. Sorry. Right. Okay. Say that again. 14 left, right? 14 left, but seven of those are in baskets. So let's see. Everyone checks out the seven left. Is that what you said? Seven left. If you're it's supposed to last all week. We, I'm not saying we'll never get the Gemini again, but this is the bundle that's, a, that's available right now. Also, the other deal, very, very quickly before I go, the bundle for, uh, well, Hannah got this for you, actually, I have to say. So if you buy these individually, that's £99.99, .99, and that's £99.99. .99. This one does uh, oblongs, isosceles triangles, half rectangle triangles. This one does squares, half square triangles, and quarter square triangles. You can get both of those for £149.99. £149.99. Now, remember, they sell on their own normally £99.99, £99.99. So basically, you're saving £50. Oh, no? And also, remember the competition. If you buy... If you buy anything, Crafter's Companion this week, your name goes into a hat, and on Tuesday, I'll be announcing the person who wins £500 worth of Crafter's Companion goodies. I oh, know, it's brilliant, isn't it? And you don't have to fill in a form, you don't have to answer a question. It's literally just buy something. Just buy it. Copra Logo in Portuguese. That's it. That's it. Anything else? Oh, yes. Have you still got it there? The quilt from Delphine's first hour. It's gorgeous. It was Tula Pink. It was, had um, FPP. It had FPP, thank you. Beautiful kit here. Should be £299. Sunshine Daydream kit. You get 13 and a half yards of fabric, which is 12.3 metres. Here it all is in the bag. This is how yours will arrive. Plus the instructions, plus all your templates. How many have I got left? Because it's limited. Nine left when you've all checked out. Nine left. Now remember, 269.99 is Hannah's price. It should be 299.99. You can go to YouTube, watch Tula Pink. She's talked about it's limited. She's not making any more whatsoever. We're very, very, we have a good, we have a good um, relationship with her and with uh, Free Spirit Fabrics. So uh, that's how we've got some, but nine. Nine, once you've all checked out. That's all that's left. At $269.99. At a split pay of $89.99. That'll be three times, won't it? Three times, yeah. Right, okay. Now, I've got 20 seconds to say goodbye today instead of shouting goodbye. The most important thing today is check. Lots of people are leaving things in their baskets and you're going to miss out if you do that. The what? Oh, the velvets, especially. They've still got those hanging around in their baskets. You need to check out. You need to check out the velvets, but you need to check out on everything you've got in your baskets for today. Don't forget, it's Hobby Maker on the other, oh, on the other side of this. Um, I'll see you tomorrow morning with Lucy Pixley. Take care. See you then. Stuck for ideas for the perfect gift? Why not get them a gift card? You can buy Sewing Street gift cards loaded up with anything from £10 to £500. Shop our gift cards online at www.sewingstreet.com or purchase them via our UK call centre on 0800 001 44 33.